doing music is so good yes it is soundtrack is one of the best parts of this hello welcome back to the adventures of johnny anime and the hashtag the chat how y'all doing hope everyone's been having a good week i hope everyone is excited for a long boy stream today and tomorrow I hope everyone enjoyed the YouTube highlights that went up last night as well. Uh, we are going to be picking up today from where we left off on the video last night. So if you missed last weekend's streams or you haven't had a chance to watch that video, uh, full spoiler warning there. Uh, we're going to be starting piles too. We're going to be going probably about eight hours today. Long boy stream. Um... Trying to get, get this in mainly on the weekends. Haven't decided we'll do a weekday stream just yet. Uh, next week is busy, right? Um, let me just like give you a little rundown of the schedule. We're doing Persona today and tomorrow. Monday is Halloween, so of course we got to stream Halloween. We have the regular Tuesday stream. There's something else happening on Wednesday, and then it's the regular Thursday stream. So like, like, like there's like a lot of content. Uh, we'll be live a lot. Uh, I'll keep everyone updated on the Discord server uh, if, well, whenever we're off schedule. So like, I'll post notes for like Halloween, post notes for Wednesday then too. Uh, but yeah, we got a lot coming. It's gonna be good. I'm excited. What Discord? My Discord server. You should join it because we post stream notices there for everything and talk about everything. All the game suggestions come from there, and all the game discussions come from there. You have a Discord server. Yes, I do. It's in the description of every single video and Twitch chat and About tab and Google. It's everywhere. <laughs> Give it a look, because uh, we decide a lot of stuff there. I honestly... it's like. Uh, uh, but, like, even, like, the, it's because of, like, the Discord suggestion box that we played Stardew Valley this year. Uh, same with Slime Rancher. Uh, same with a lot of games that come up on the channel. So it's definitely worth checking. Discord? For real? Wait, you're the Persona 5 Royal. Ah, oh, Jesus. But, yeah. Uh, we're gonna be streaming today. Long voice stream. Hope everyone's excited. Uh, before we start, well, that's, uh, music is amazing. We're gonna transfer music. We're kind of just waiting to hop on in. Can you hear it okay? It's not too loud or anything. It's always hard to get the audio right for this one. The music tends to be uh, quite loud in parts. And then uh, I, I want to just adjust it for the audio. It's good. We can hop in in a mo. It's a bit quiet. Okay, that's as that's as comfy as high as I'm willing to make it right now. I think. Let me see. There's no filters on it. No, there's not. Okay. We're gonna go with that. And then I'll probably I'll probably adjust that again in a moment. Uh, before we start though. Uh, you're all very welcome to the stream. Uh, a big heads up. Uh, we're playing with no spoilers. So, uh, no spoilers is basically in effect. Unless I specifically say the key phrase, help me chat. 
Uh, anything I ask is purely hypothetical. I don't want to know. And just don't backseat either. Uh, I know some people are kind of like playing this game are going to be like, He didn't... He didn't raise his knowledge on the Tuesday. He's not going to get the 3.5 buffer effect in June now. Uh, no one cares. Um, so uh, uh, just don't don't be like that, please. <laughs> don't be like that. Um, I'm not trying to like be like kind of optimal in absolutely everything. I'm kind of just trying to do what seems fun. Uh, coincidentally, I like being optimal, and I find being optimal fun, but I won't always do it. I won't always do it, because sometimes you just want to check out the new shit, and the new shit's fun. But can we still remind you to grab lotto tickets, though? Yes, yes you can. So, Monday is lotto day. Monday is lotto day, and then Sunday is juice day and bash day. That's, that's like... Those are set parts of our schedule, no matter what happens. We have to get our juice on Sunday, we have to have a bat on Sunday, and we have to check the lotto on Monday. No matter what. That's very important. What about unlocking the exclusive royal content? I've seen a lot of people posting that. So, but here's my response, right? Because like, people are saying like, he's going to miss like the true ending of the game. A genuine help me out chat here, right? Is that even something I need to worry about right now? Because I don't think it is. I don't think we're even close. Yeah, no, a lot of people are saying no. Yeah, like, yeah, it's, like... Yeah, like, it's way far in advance, so it, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'll worry about that later. I'll worry about that later. People don't need to tell me that. Like, there was someone in like even like the original YouTube announcement like just in the comments where it's like holy shit He's gonna miss the ending And it's like I, I've, I've just started playing the game like it's like we're gonna be here like 150 hours this time This time like I'm, I'm <laughs> We'll get there, you know <laughs> Like we're in May of in-game time so, like, do not worry about it, okay? I will worry about that myself. I, if I feel like I've been spoiled or, like, backseating too much, uh, I'll pop it in sub mode. Um, that's just for my own sake. I hope that's understandable. Because uh, I'm having a lot of fun playing this. I'm really excited for today. I've been looking forward to this all week. My weekends are basically just persona now, and I love it. Having a very good time with the game. Yo! Because I love anime so much. Should we tell you if you can miss the royal content for the true ending? No. No, just actually th don't mention anything about any kind of ending. I don't want to know. I'll figure it out. Don't mention- I don't want to know anything about the ending. Because uh, like, the calendar in this game goes to like the new year as is. We have time. And like, if I'm truly worried, yeah, I'm pretty sure I can just Google search it, and it's like, as we go along, it's like, okay, what do I need to do? You right? So uh, I, I can do that if I'm actually worried, but I don't, I don't, like, we're, ju we're just playing the game, you know? Uh, Captain, thank you for the five gift subs, thank you very much. Thank you to everyone who's subbed. Thank you, everyone's giving bits. I, will, I love it when Persona said Royal and 5 D'd all over. <laughs> Are you a Mr. Persona yet? We're getting there. Okay, well, level 11. It's the 5th of May. Okay, this will be the more official sound check. So, does that sound okay to you? Sounds good? Okay. Let me just take off my jumper real quick, too. It's a little bit... It's, like, deceptively warm here. It's like raining in Ireland. Eh. It's still hot. I don't know. Confusing. Oh, yeah! We did unlock something that's just at the end of the last stream. We have, we have like, a main menu place. Yeah, so what exactly is this? This just lives in the main menu, as far as I can tell. 
And there's a small child that lives here. It looks a bit like an egg. Hi. You want to learn some stuff about this place? Like I mentioned before, this place is where many memories are given shape, including your own. You should be able to access your memories in all sorts of ways here. Uh -huh. Install all sorts of models, listen to music, watch videos, check out pictures, play cards. If you want, I bet you could even change your own appearance. You can check out all your accomplishments and even probably shouldn't just dump all this at you, on you at once, huh? What do you want? Smell that stuff in more detail. What do you want to know about? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> you know, I'm just going to have a look around. That that That's too many menu options. Yeah. Doing good? Okay, yeah. Let's just have a look. Start the palace maker. There's a vending machine. After you purchase items with P medals, you'll be able to place them within the thieves' den. Cognitive allies and confidants will come to and, view to and discuss your items. These characters will change when you enter the thieves' den or change the item's location. Okay. You can adjust these decorations based on your story progress. Turning to the thieves' den may even change depending on your decor. I I get to design a house? <laughs> sure? Oh my god, it's so difficult to read. <laughs> There's something new in decor. I can make it kind of this palace. Velvet room decor. Yeah, yo, give me like the blue prison vibe. That looks nice. Daily life, none. Confidants, none. Enemy, none. Metaverse. There's nothing here. We've been to the metaverse now as well. We can say that. We actually streamed the metaverse, like, since the time of the last stream. It's really shit. Velvet room, none. Oh, okay, but I can buy items here. Cool. Oh, wait, a laundromat. A diorama of the laundromat. Oh, shit, that... Why, why would I want that? <laughs> just Yeah, let's put that in the laundromat there. There we go. Customize this. Oh, we can get like a uh, naked goblin Kamashita in our in our base. Sweet. <laughs> or we can get the volleyball statue of Kamashita. Why why would I want him? Oh, we can actually get the personas as well. That's actually that's actually kind of cool. There is two people in Carmen's one. Like she was like stepping on one, and then there's like another one just flying. Is there anything else in the metaverse? No. Okay, that's everything. Uh, we can get we can get Arsene. Just a kind of like in memoriam. I'll have him just flying up there. Oh sweet, look at look at my base now. I've got stairs. Oh look, they're all in the laundromat. Let's go, let's go hang out with them. Oh wait, I, how do I get down to them? I don't think I can. Oh wait, no, there's stairs. There's stairs. Wow, look at this. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. You know, I've heard that cats love sleeping in laundry baskets. Huh, is that true? <sighs> How should I know? Wanna try it next time, Morgana? Maybe you'll like it. I told you a hundred times that I'm not a cat, but okay, just this once. E yeah. It didn't take much. Is that it? Laundromat's quite old. It can wash it, no matter how filthy it is. Located near the the Yanganyaya Bar House. Oh, okay. So you can't use this one, right? Mm -hmm. It's just a model. Okay. Laundry museum. Like neat. Uh, check my awards. Oh, I got one here. Moment, all out attack 50 times. Oh, so these are like your achievements. 
And they give you the Persona coins. Deal over 10,000 damage in battle without using an all-out attack. Jesus Christ. Form ambushes. Okay, so a lot of this we're just going to passively get over time. Maybe not complete all requests. That seems like a lot of work. Second boss of LeBlanc. Made Master Coffee and Master Curry by yourself at LeBlanc. There's a lot here. A master loves his maids. Oh, no. Japan is striking again. Are those NFTs? I wish they were. Oh, there's a fishing pond somewhere too. Neat. Okay. Alright, so there's like a bunch of like achievement art that you can get. I mean, that's cute. That'll give you more Persona medals. This is the Persona 5 Royal. Oh, you can you can buy all the pieces of art, I think, for characters. Okay, I mean that's cute. This is this is all just collectibles and that, and like a little bit of detail. And like, yeah, if you're like a fan of the game, you get like a load of shit. Concept art and stuff is there too. That's actual NFTs. <laughs> this movie. So I take it you can just rewatch. Yeah, you can rewatch the cutscenes. Uh, Persona 5: The Animation, The Daybreakers, Open a Movie. Wait, that's the only one there. Is that? Was that the TV making that noise? I feel like I just logged out with something in Windows. Did you hear that? I heard a weird noise. That was... That's the PS5 notifications. Oh, I think it's my controller. Oh, not again. Okay. <laughs> One second. Dead? No, no, I'm good. I'm good. Look, look, I'm moving. I'm moving. I'm alive. Okay, uh, what's this? Welcome. Music player. Oh, okay, so you can just play all the, the themes. Listen to them all. Prison labor? Yeah, that's cool. Okay, so it's like just a little customizable hub and like all the collectible extras. I mean, I think that's cute. I think that's cute. There's a card game. Oh, this is at the tables. Play Tycoon? Gather your party and play Tycoon. One game consists of three rounds. Your final rank is determined by how many points you obtain each round. Okay. Card number determines the strength. Each card must beat the previous one, and the number of cards in play must be met. Because card is three, but the strongest is two. What? 
Play old in the three of diamonds will go first, and the beggar starts each subsequent round for each additional. Okay, I don't know if I understand it. Let's keep it casual. Let me get it on this. Let me start. You got a pair. Yes. Pass. <laughs> what? Uh, I, I'm just gonna pass too. Get ready for a revolution! No more revolutions. What? What? What is happening? You got a pair. Pass. I'll pass. <laughs> what? <laughs> They're just all ignoring their turn. Pass. Pass. Don't go too small. Got it? I'm gonna play an eight. My turn again. Mm, you're good. I say. I'll pass. I'll play pass. force. I I did it. There. I'll pass. pass. I'll pass. Let me just get rid of all my cards. Guess I pass. should pass. What? Why? Like. Ryuji and An have not played a single there. card. I'll pass. Better play it this? safe. Here's the power pass. play. I've got nothing. Stay on the Sorry. defensive. Here comes pass. a pair. I have no idea what's happening. What you got? I'll pass. I I this can't make pass. a turn. Here comes pass. a pair. Ugh, no move. <laughs> there you go. How about this? I'll pass. pass. Okay. okay, you're next. At this rate, I'm turning this around. I can play two. Pass. Right? Pass. Another pass. I'm out, jumps. Um, pass. I'll pass. <laughs> I don't understand what just happened. <laughs> Love it, person. here. It, was it supposed Come to be Uno? Pass. I'm just that good. I'll pass. These two go together, right? I, I think I've lost. How about this? <laughs> okay. This I just have to wait for on the dump all great. the cards. Finally. I lost. Nice. Ah, uh, end the game. I think I'm good. Okay, let's uh let's head on home. Eat the thieves dead. Okay, cool optionals. You can play a little card game. Persona Uno. Persona Uno. Okay, what's going on here? Let me send the celebratory pick I took for today. Celebrating the fan of the fan thieves. Celebrating us crashing a classy buffet. We can cool all to celebrate at any time now. But well, you took that while I was eating, why didn't you tell me? Well, I did, you just never stopped eating. Anyway, this is our start as a Phantom Thieves. We're gonna take the world by storm. All the shitty adults in the world better watch out for us. And so, plot summation from last time adults suck. And that's our drive and motivation to do good. God, adults are the worst. Oh, I can feed my plant again. Oh. Perfect. Yes. I should do it for a while. Uh, my current goal is to prove my existence to society. The dread's starting to set in already. Thieves' dead has been updated. Okay. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, Kamashita's been arrested. That's like the news story right now. Uh, we should relax for the night. Starting tomorrow, we'll be working as hashtag the Chatamaze. Oh yeah, okay, we gotta take it easy. Uh, we've officially formed our group now. Uh, how? What do we want to do for the evening? Dad's not giving us an allowance, which is kind of sad. Uh, what do we want to do? S study. 
You need to study more. No, I'm, I'm... I don't want to. I'm gonna watch TV instead. Oh. Guy McVer. There's sulfur leaking from the tank. We need to do something fast. It's fine. I'll just use this chocolate. See? The acid and the sugar are reacting. What? <laughs> it's a story about a man who never gives up, beating all odds with science and ingenuity. Wow. He fixed the tank's crack with chocolate. How does he stay so calm at a time like that? Hey, hey! The protagonist knew just what to do despite the crazy situation. Have you learned a thing or two about profici proficiency from watching this drama? Hmm. I'm getting more proficiency for this than like making an actual lockpick. Like, wow, he used chocolate. Oh. You're now proficient with chocolate. Sweet. First off, I'd like to begin by congratulating you. We're still in prison. To think our master would give words of praise. You better treasure this moment, inmate. You have encountered allies who share your ideals, and you have found your place in reality. Thanks, group. The time has come. Your rehabilitation will soon begin. So you beat the tutorial, now you get to play the real game. I don't understand. Just shut up and listen, inmate. You have a special potential. However, that must be refined into a useful power. It is weak now, but refining it shall grant you the strength to stand against the coming ruin. <laughs> Gru is an adult, by the way. A damn adult! I'll sue! That is the rehabilitation cast upon you. The coming ruin? There are various means by which you may gain the power to resist the ruin. Fighting shadows and gaining experience is one way. The fusion process I taught you prior is another. Okay. This is all possible because of our master's guidance, inmate. Though it may be presumptuous of us, we have words of wisdom as well. Sure. When you're out in reality, you better hone your relationships with those you have contracts with. Spending time with those people will lead to the cultivation of your relationships with them. Like remember, if you're not social, you're gonna die. If you've got time to waste, you'd better visit your contractor's inmate. That is another source of power to evade the ruin that our master has mentioned. Thanks to the contracts you formed, your heart is steadily gaining the power of opposition. Sure. It seems the rehabilitation is going well. This is a truly joyous occasion. I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. May the devotion to your rehabilitation grow even deeper. <laughs> Those Gruen coming. <laughs> Gru's ruin. I have high hopes for you. I feel like my bond with, with Gru is growing deeper. Uh, okay, so we- Oh, we don't- we get extra personas with that. That's actually quite nice. Yeah, we don't have to worry about um, ranking this one up to it. It seems to be like automatic, which is handy. All right. Power stock. We can carry two more now. Confident ability. Power stock increases the number of personas you can hold to eight. Well, thank you for explaining that. The time has come. Return to your brief moments of rest. And don't forget to go talk to your contractor's inmate. Sometimes a person you meet in town can become your confidant. If your goals align, you may be able to form a contract with them. As your relationship deepens, your rank with the confidant will increase. This allows you to create even stronger personas. Do your best to find confidants and strengthen these relationships. So it's basically just reintroducing that because that's going to be such an important mechanic uh, for the game. Honestly, at the moment... Wait, fan site, do you believe in the Phantom Thieves? Okay, that's a new one. Uh, honestly, at the moment, I think I want to go, like, all in, probably, with, like, Ryuji, Takemi, and Coffee Dad. Those are, like, the three that stand out to me right now. Ryuji, just because he's such a bro. 
and, uh, and uh, it's probably handy to have at least one of these social contracts with someone who's actually in our party. Uh, coffee Dad, because he's Coffee Dad, and in Takemi because we need medicine. So um, we're gonna tr we're gonna tr yeah we're gonna try and prioritize those three. We also have the personas for them. I had money, I'd kill for a real breakfast. Broke ass college student. Have you heard? Energetic college student. What about Big Bang Burger? The one on Central Street is holding a contest right now. The Big Bang Challenge or whatever. If you go at night, you can eat for only 500 yen. You gotta eat one of the giant burgers though, right? How can anyone actually finish that? Still, 500 yen is a steal. Wow. A huge burger, huh? Interesting. I bet giving that a go will increase your guts. Oh, we need more guts. We want that. Gotta eat the burger. It was at night, is it? I don't think we can leave home at night. Like yeah. you heard last week, gym class is cancelled today. Instead, I'm supposed to give you some guidance. The gist is, don't go around talking about the incident. That's all. Oh no. The police are still investigating Mr. Kamoshida, so I can't say anything myself. As a teacher, though. I'm ashamed for not having noticed that a student was suffering like that. If you say anything, they'll sue. I'm not defending him, but as a colleague, he just seemed like, well, a normal person. Honestly, it still doesn't feel real. I guess people can have multiple sides to them. The teachers have it rough, huh? Kawakami oh, yeah. sounds so tired. I just remembered something I learned about psychology. They say that humans have several different personalities hidden in their subconscious. Different personalities? Oh, to be clear, I'm not talking about multiple personality disorder. These different personalities can be a different gender or a different age from you. A persona! I mean, if you think about how gods and monsters and myths were first based on the human image. If you actually saw one of those personalities with your own eyes, it might look like a monster. It's all a metaphor. Mm hmm. Hmm. You all seem more alert than usual. Did I finally talk about something that interests you? Well, I'm just saying what I've heard. It feels like I just now understood what I learned long ago. Kawakami is about to join the party. She is a persona user. Because I gain, I gain that knowledge made me a bit smarter. We're learning. But she's an adult. <laughs> it ain't much, but we've been getting more postings on the Phantom Aficionado website. It's true, we can't trust her. I want to make my friend apologize for not returning the stuff I lent him. Ugh, deal with that yourself. Oh, it's like a forum now. <laughs> hey, those girls. You know that Phantom Thieves rumor about stealing Kamashita's heart? I wonder if it's true. It's gotta be made up. Do you seriously believe they exist? But look what happened to Kamashita. He probably just couldn't keep hiding it after that girl tried to kill herself. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, you might be right. I guess there's no way they really exist. I mean, we're probably not real. Most importantly, it seriously sucks that our school is going to be known for stuff like this. Like, oh, that's terrible. Mental health and abuse. No. Oh. Damn adults. I wonder if it'll affect our college. Oh, Jesus. Entrance. That's probably a normal reaction for now, but they'll see soon enough. If we can take care of two or three famous guys, people will have to believe we exist. <laughs> this will affect the trout population. <laughs> it's like, like, they're having a conversation. It's like, oh no, like, Kamoshida's heart has been stolen. How will this affect the economy? <laughs> it's basically the conversation. About those big shots, we don't have any leads yet, right? Plus, there's that rumor about you two threatening Kamoshida, too. 
Looks like you'll just have to live a normal, honest school life for the time being. But what will our shareholders say, Morgana? Still, make sure you stay prepared just in case anything comes up, all right? I'll keep an eye out for info on any big shots that might be coming around. Okay, so, so people are getting very agitated when the word big shot is being said. <laughs> See people. <laughs> people are like whipped into a frenzy right now in chat. Big shit. Is that, a, is, that, is that a Delta Room reference? Is that a... Is that, that's a Spamton line! And I'll try to dig up some dirt online. We went and formed the Phantom Thieves group, but we can't even find a target. There, there. I guess sometimes things just don't go the way we want them to. Excuse me. Oh. Did you wish to see me, Principal Kobayakawa? Dignified student. They have an avatar. You saw the state Kamashita-kun was in, didn't you? It's as if his personality has completely changed. Something is definitely wrong here. I'm not sure I follow. From what I've heard, it appears as though some students were meddling in his business. But the nerve of those students. Like, considering all the abuse they brought to light. Emperor, thank you for the 1500 bits. With the adults out of the way, the economy will be flourishing, and jobs for the working class teenagers. Finally, the society we always wanted. I love child labor. If they did something to him, who could they be? Are you saying that these students may have caused Mr. Kamashita to change? That is what I wish to know. Even if it takes some probing into student matters. Do you think the principal's in on it all? Like he knows about like the metaverse? <laughs> I would like you to look into this for me. It is true that there are many rumors regarding Mr. Kamashita. Like but... Humpty Dumpty here is like the mastermind behind everything. Do you mean all of this talk about those phantom thieves? It is undeniable that Mr. Kamoshida has changed in some way. I'd like to have a grasp of the cause. This shall also ensure that I handle the mass media and police in the correct fashion. That's why I'm entrusting this to you, a high schooler, and not like the staff or something. No. Oh. I will continue speaking to Mr. Kamoshida myself. Unless you find whomever did this, these irresponsible rumors will likely never die down. Don't you agree? You have been at the top of your class since day one. Your conduct is good, and teachers favor you. I could write you a recommendation for any college of your choosing, Makoto Nichima. Thank you for saying her full name here. Thank you. Your lineage must certainly play a part in this excellence. Your sister is still young, yet she holds an admirable position at the public prosecutor's office, no? If something disappointing were to happen here, that wouldn't reflect very oh, well on your sister. Sorry, it's not a bribe. It's blackmail. <laughs> How quickly the deal changes. Do you understand? Yes. <laughs> How wise. It's no wonder you're our student council president. I'd appreciate if you'd look into this as soon as possible. I ask that you begin at once. What a shitty principal. <laughs> Damn adults. Yes, if you'll excuse me then. It's me, sir. My apologies for troubling you at such a busy time. Yes, it's about the matter we discussed earlier. Oh? I have all bases covered. The investigation will begin immediately. Mm hmm, of course. Yes, I will get results. I should be able to update you soon. Well then, I must be going. Thank you very much for your time. He sucks. Humpty Dumpty is evil. Get back to texting in class. The police are really here. I saw them at the entrance. I saw them too. They were talking to the teachers. Change of heart thing. Seriously amazing, huh? Hope that hope they don't find out we're responsible. Pretty sure we'll be fine. There's no proof it was us. Should we turn ourselves in, like, immediately? <laughs> oh, we're fine. 
Sound sure of yourself. I've been having rumors been going around about how you guys threatened Kamoshida. This world's Kamoshida shouldn't know anything about what actually happened to him, though. Still, he did what was right. Don't go freaking out over some label. Yes, that's true. Man, I really can't wait to keep living this double life. All right, Johnny Anime, we're gonna be counting on you. Hey, are you listening? <laughs> hey, Anime. You pay attention. Is that how you listen when someone's talking to you? Feel a murderous intent. Oh. We we dodged the chalk. <laughs> Can't believe he dodged uh, Ushibara's throw. Is he a ninja? <laughs> Well, whatever, moving on. Hey! You got your entire class's attention. Your charm is definitely increased. Nice! That's a gamer moment right there. <laughs> he wave dashed. The anime powers have activated. Hey. How you doing, Mishima? Have you seen that Phantom Aficionado website? I've heard of it. I'm the one who started it. Oh, he's a fanboy. Um, you guys are the Phantom Thieves, aren't you? Oh shit! He knows. <laughs> Give me some space, just please, please get away from me. I need to keep my distance. Sorry. Although, if things really are as I think, I should keep it a secret. Did he just sniff Johnny? I think he did. Kamoshida used me, and I did some horrible things to you guys. This isn't much of a way for me to apologize for it. But if there's anything I can do to help, just let me know. Uh, that's great, but... I'm glad to hear that. It's not just Kamoshida. There are tons of evil adults out there. <laughs> adults suck. It really is the main plot, man. But I'm sure the Phantom Thieves will do something. They can't let this end after just one target. That's why I wanted to make a forum where people could post their problems. So I started a subreddit. There are probably a lot of people who have high hopes for the Phantom Thieves' next move. So, I've also implemented an anonymous poll on the site. Okay. Do you believe in the Phantom Thieves or not? It's not much of the mo. I want to work on this forum so eventually it'll be packed with tons of supportive posts. I'd really like to help out in the Phantom Thieves' acts of justice. Can I, please? Ah, uh, I mean, <laughs> just do what you want. I, I don't want no part in this. Uh, sure, go for it. It's encouraging. I'll live up to your expectations. I promise. The fifth party member. It's the Reddit admin, of course. I sense abundantly high expectations from Mishima. Oh no! <laughs> we go back to the present size like, you must have had a Redditor on your side. <laughs> Someone had to run the site. <laughs> Besides the public's reaction to your group, there were others who supported you. <laughs> Someone who enthusiastically cheered the Phantom Thieves on. Perhaps they were quite close. How did you manage the fandom? <laughs> what do you have to say to that? Yo, the Phantom Thieves TikTok didn't I take off that. by chance. Someone thou had to post those videos. <laughs> thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. You must have had an R slash Persona 5 mod on your side. I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom Oh, we get the moon. Okay. Okay, we got the, the Reddit confidant. Machinist support allows uh, backup members to earn XP. Um, what exactly does that mean, a backup member? That's someone not in the party. The experience share. So when you get five. Okay, I mean, that's, I, yeah, that just seems necessary from like a gameplay perspective, I guess. Makes sense. 
I imagine it's gonna be kind of like a convenient thing. It's always weird how that works, because like in Pokemon, like when they do that shit, it can be like, it just can ruin the game's difficulty pretty much entirely. Whereas I imagine here, it's like you actually need something like that, or like they'll just fall behind. It's always kind of funny, ain't it? Depends on the game. All right. Okay, we got the moon. See you. New confidant. We we're gonna have to. That. We're gonna have to. So we, we. I mean, we have to get the confidant up with the the, the Reddit mod. Like we have to. You know, we, we need someone to manage our socials as the Phantom Thieves. Jeez, it was a little awkward trying to figure out when to walk over here. So that forum is Mishima-kun's. Has he figured out our identities? I kind of just admit it to him. <laughs> Even so, I think it'll be fine. He seemed to be playing it cool. I guess we should have a little chat about this later. I will say, though. A forum where people can post problems may prove unexpectedly useful. What if it's like a shit post forum? What if it's just like Mishima just wants to like uh, post like a bunch of memes about the Phantom Thieves? <laughs> Anyways, we gotta get looking for a new target. And we need to stay sharp until we manage to find one. Once we do, we'll have to head into another palace. So we should prep our equipment and... Wait! Oh, crap! Oh! Uh, what's with you? Don't we have an exam coming up? Oh, no, it's okay. We've already got knowledge of two. We're gonna be Judging fine. Judging by that reaction, I'd assume you're going to struggle this time, too. It's not like you're any better. All you're good at is English. I'd rather that than be bad at every subject. English is the best one. I approve. Even your Japanese is questionable at best, Ryuji. You haven't spoken a word of it. What's questionable is whether you're really even a human. <laughs> Good comeback, huh? Let's discuss this with our fists. Bring it. Yeah. <laughs> will you two stop it? Study for three, Dan, or you will die. Wait, do I actually need three? I, th I thought I only needed two. I've already got knowledge. Two is fine. I just need I just need a passing grade, gang. Okay. Let's not draw any attention to ourselves till we find our next target. Don't forget to study though, I'm not getting blamed if your grades start dropping. There are various things to do around the city before your next target. Try to listen to rumors and visit in different locations. Perhaps you meet someone who has new information. Deepen in relationships with your confidants can bring various benefits to the Phantom Thieves. Use your time wisely to get the best results. Okay, it's Friday. You got plans today. Ryuji wants to meet up. Uh, we might as well, actually. We Yeah, we want to get the confidant up with Ryuji. We can get the confidant up with An as well. Uh... How do I... Can I zoom in here? I'm assuming that's the Kemi. Buy the lotto ticket? It's Friday, I already have a lotto ticket, don't I? Press square on the map. Oh yeah, thank you. Yeah, there's the Kemi. It'll go up with An, it won't go up with Ryuji. If we go see him. Um, I probably want to prioritize getting, like, um... Getting the rank up with Takemi then. You need to spend time with him to get it to go to the go up stage. Honestly, like, do we want to beeline Ryuji? <laughs> Let me just see what the ranks are. Let me just see. I I, I assume we want to like even out everyone's ranks if we can. Ryuji's already ranked three, like. I'll be honest, like, when it comes to a lot of games like this, right? I tend to be of the opinion that you try and max one rather than be the jack of all trades because if you push it, you tend to get something, like, stupid good. 
and then you have that stupid good thing rather than you get like four average things. Like the one stupid good thing tends to be better. And so th th that, that, that's just how, like, how, like my mindset when it comes to playing a lot of these things. Like even if I'm doing like Dark Souls or something like that, I'll be like, right, level up this stat oh shitload first to use something good. And then I've got that, rather than just like a point in HP, a point in stamina. Uh, so it's either Takemi or Ryuji. Uh, we can get the rank up with Takemi, so we might as well do that. Yeah, we might as well do that one first. Uh, let's go to the clinic. Okay, we'll get to Kami up and then beeline Ryuji again. Actually, oh no, but Ryuji asked me to hang out though, didn't he? I don't know if that's worth any extra. It might be worth more if he asked me specifically to do it. It's not. Oh, okay, it's not. But we, we want to be bros with Ryuji. We do want to be bros with Ryuji. And you know, we can't leave him hanging. Okay. We can't leave him hanging. Let's go see him. Yo. Yo, Johnny, you're heading home. Hey. I, I was home, but I had to get the train back because I wanted to see you. What do you think about training a bit? We're going to get rusty if we don't keep ourselves active. We're going to become closer with Ryuji thanks to the chariot persona slime. Bond won't deepen just yet. Wanna get going? Okay, go get changed. We're gonna do some jogging today. Gotta get our bro time in. Ryuji seems satisfied. I think he had a pretty fulfilling workout. I feel like my bond with Ryuji will go stronger soon. Oh shit, so next time we hang out yeah. with him, it's another rank. It'll be rank four. Yeah, that, that that's really good. See him again, it's another it's another full rank. That's so good. Yeah, we're gonna prioritize Ryuji, That's I think. The key to this place. I think he's gonna be the first one we try to get up like just as high as humanly possible. You get to lock up from now on. I can't keep waiting for you to come home. Don't start any fires, okay? Oh, he's talking to me. I thought he was on the phone or something, but no, he's being aggressive. Can I leave now? I can go out at night. Thanks, Dad. Yeah, you can now leave at night. Hey! Do you want to go out now that we're allowed? Come to think of it, shouldn't we stop by the airsoft shop and ask about that paper bag? Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah, so we, we have so many more options that we can just do now. Uh, why? That, that's the, um, that was, yeah, that's the, the airsoft shop. The street orator. That was the politician, wasn't it? That was, uh, Sanderson. Yeah, Gunkle and Sanderson. Okay, uh, and there was the burger place mentioned as well. I think this could improve my guts. Oh, but there's, there's a straight up a confidant if we go to the airsoft shop. Oh, okay, which one do we want to do then? There's Gunkle, Sanderson, and then the burger shop. We just ignore, like, all the confidants. It's like, I want to go eat a burger. <laughs> so, like, think of all these possibilities you have. Now that you can head out at night, I want to go to McDonald's. The burger one is only at night. Yeah, it's true. Oh, it's the cake night rises. What's up? We've already seen that one. As amazing as it was. Okay, you know, I think I just want to go to McDonald's. Like, the burger place has been hyped up to me. <laughs> I kind of just want to go here, and then we can come back during the day. This, this one's exclusive tonight, as far as I can tell. Welcome to the Big Bang Burger. Open 24 hours a day, because there's no day or night in space. Currently offering what we call the Big Bang Challenge. You can finish a special large volume burger within the time limit, then you win. And we have a luxurious prize prepared for those who succeed. 
Taking the Big Bang Challenge will cause time to pass, but improve your guts. Except the challenge costs money. The, ch the challenge is cognitive. You can eat the entire Big Bang Burger. To succeed, you will need knowledge, proficiency, and guts. Interestingly, charm is completely absent from this challenge. Uh, prevail and you will receive a prize and an increase in a stat other than guts. Win or lose, your guts will always increase. Okay, I, I have rank 2 on everything. This, this will improve my knowledge. I'll get smarter if I eat this burger. We don't need to study, we just need McDonald's. <laughs> oh, you wanna do it? I'm gonna... Wait, I'll, let, me, let me see, I can order some takeout too. Let's order an er burger for later. 40 HP to all allies, seems pretty good. Let's take the challenge. Yeah. I think you can probably do it as you are now. Let's go. The Big Mac. And go take a seat and good luck. Thank you very much. Thank you for taking the Big Bang Challenge. Like, also, what's the, what's in that paper bag you just got sitting next to you on the seat? Is that a gun? Anyway, <laughs> this is your first time, yes. You started around to be third mate. Thus, your aim will be the Comet Burger. For real? This is a lot bigger than I was expecting. That, that's a pretty beefy burger. This burger is as voluminous as a soaring comet burning in the sky. But not be overcome easily. Oh, what's the for real counter on as well? Just for the for real counter, we're specifically looking to count Ryuji's for reals. And then I think we have a, we might have a side counter for all the other ones. It's on 74. <laughs> oh no, that seems quite high. Surely not. It's about 23, 26. Okay. If we keep track of it for this stream, someone can check the VOD of the previous stream at some point, And then we can just add them together and, like, make sure we've got the correct amount of for reals. So we just tally for this stream. And then we can add them. We can, yeah, we can, we can do, we can double check. We can do our homework for tomorrow. And check how many for reals are on. Yep, so stream specific for real counter. We're on zero for... Well, we might actually even have had a few for reals from Ryuji already. We might have already had a few. <laughs> so we'll, we'll, we'll piece it all together eventually. Should you conquer this challenge, you will reward with an extravagant prize. The prize will be great. Good luck, Johnny. Now then. Everyone else is just watching. <laughs> Look at that fucking table on the right. It's like, wow. Look at this guy. He must be really hungry. It's like spectator sport. This is a tough battle. Now then. I'm rooting for you. And remember, nobody will think any less of you if you give up partway through. <sighs> Somehow ate the whole thing. Oh. You did it. Congratulations. I don't feel so good. I need to use the bar. Did you manage to extinguish the Comet Burger? I present to you the second mate badge. Okay. And to the Burger Baron who defeated this challenge, we present to you our world famous Big Bang Burger on the house. Hope you enjoy the taste of victory. Oh, we got three of them. Nice. New challenges will await you now that you've become a second Please mate. Come again. I look forward to your next attempt at our challenge. I knew you could do it. You took that Comet Burger down. It was so admirable taking on such a daunting task with that intense level of courage. <laughs> Our guts have gone up. Nice. Your pace, your strategy of using well-timed drinks. Just a spectacular way you devoured it. Everything was perfect. <laughs> Knowledge up for eating the burger. Oh, we got so many points for that. Charm went up too. Charm actually did increase. Proficiency. Come on, we should head home. I'm just full. I'm full just from watching you. How do you get smart from eating a burger? It was a very smart cow. Hey. Look a little more to the right. I can't see the screen. And for today's train news, today's headlines are: volleyball beaten investigation. The school claims to have left teaching mountains up to its staff. It's denied once again that it had any knowledge of the beatings. Pollen warning as of next week. 
Greater volume on arriving later than in previous years. Hot spots of Tokyo. Experience art in Shibuya. The Matarama exhibit opens next week. Hmm. People are really talking about the Kamoshida incident. No one in the car knows what that were the ones who did it. Pollen warning. Yep, yep. You got your exam starting on Wednesday. Don't tell me you forgot. Open your textbooks. Anyway, today we'll be talking about the tale of the bamboo cutter. Most theorizes the oldest story in Japan. To some, it's the oldest science fiction story in the world. But if you ask me, it's the oldest story in Japan about a terrible woman. I mean, uh, Princess uh, Kaguya gives her suitors absurd tasks, demands fancy gifts, then runs off to the moon. Some men lose their fortune, some are humiliated, and some even get serious wounds or go blind. Uh, women like Princess uh, Kaguya actually show up in a lot of stories from around the world. Now then, anime kun. Do you know the Probably answer? heard that a woman who uses her wiles to lead people to their doom is a femme fatale. So what's the literal translation of the phrase femme fatale? I mean, I, I'm pretty sure it is this. Let me just quickly check Wikipedia. <laughs> Pretty sure it's that one though. French major. I actually did study French, I'll have you know. I wasn't very good at it. This is it. Exactly. Like thanks thanks, subreddit. You've helped me again. <laughs> the answer is fatal woman, in French, of course. The famous examples are the witch Morgan Le Fay uh, from Arthurian legend and Queen Salome from the Bible. Not to mention the wild, seductive dancer of opera, Carmen. Well, we actually knew that! Maybe I should ask if I can borrow his notes. Nice going. I have a whole subreddit in my pocket. Knowledge up! We don't need to study still. <laughs> Let me just warn you that exams aren't so easy you can pass them with, uh, with a single night of cramming. Take your time, make sure you understand the material, okay? Hmm. You heard, it must be rough being a student. Well, you have nothing to lose from studying. Give it all you've got. But if it's not raining, it doesn't make sense to study. None of these posts are any good. Everyone's just bitching about their parents or their boyfriends. Oh no. <sighs> there ain't even a hint of a hint about a new palace. The subreddit is toxic. We can't get everything online. Finding a post with a name and location is asking a lot. Guess Can't we trust just them. gotta find one ourselves then. Are you seriously suggesting we look for a target that even the police have overlooked? It's R slash am I the asshole? <laughs> it's like we're never gonna find someone who needs the heart changed here. These people are just terrible. God, everyone sucks here. R slash Johnny anime. It's our, it's live stream fails. We were actually on live stream fails recently, I believe. Uh, one of our metaverse clips got posted there. And the reason this was brought to my attention is because I was going through the Twitch clips. Um, the, the like the top clips of like one of my past streams, I I, I one of the, it stood out to me because the top clip had ninety five thousand views, <laughs> which is a little more than usual for a clip. Oh yeah, I think I got posted. Uh, so our metaverse experience was shared. That's quite sweet. Yeah, you're right. We should probably just hold off till exams are done with. Uh, her. what clip was it? It was the one where we pointed the gun at our head in the metaverse. <laughs> it summarizes the experience. <laughs> oh dear. We can wait and see for a little longer, then worry about coming up empty-handed if it happens. Oh. Oh. This place is off limits, you know. Makoto. <sighs> we'll get out of here once we're done chatting. Don't rat us out. Anyways, 
What's Miss Council President want with us? The troublemaker, the center of gossip, and the infamous transfer student. Hmm. Interesting combination. Did you know I was expelled. I prefer defending someone on the street. Don't mess with me. Great way to start a conversation. By the way, it seems as though you got to know Mr. Kamashita pretty well. Not really. Yeah, you know, he's only been here a month or so. Hmm. I heard Mr. Kamashita used a volleyball team member to spread details of your past record. Yeah, it was kind of mean of him. Don't you hate him? Mr. Kamashita, I mean. I mean, we did murder What's him. This about? So it's all okay now. My friend here is an upstanding guy. I don't mean to offend. Many students have been shaken up by what happened with Mr. Kamashita. The rumors about that odd calling card-esque posting aren't going away either. I didn't expect someone like you would care about that tactless stuff, Nijima-senpai. Like any moment now, Ryuji's gonna drop like three calling cards out of his pocket and it's like, oh no! <laughs> Anyways, we done here? We can't leave if you keep talking to us. Yeah, I don't know if it was tactless. Like, hey, I worked hard on that card. Like, Ryuji, no. Don't tell her. <laughs> At least try to understand my position. Being forced to deal with this horseplay. Horseplay? Ah, oh, yes, by the way. It's been decided that this place will be closed off due to the incident. I heard some people are coming up here without permission. After all. Oh, we're gonna need a new hangout spot. I'm sorry to have interrupted you. What was that about? She's on to us. That girl seems rather sharp. We should be cautious of her. She really pisses me off. She's figured us out. No, be careful. Be careful. You gotta burn all copies of the calling card you still have on you, Ryuji. Yeah, talk about a pain in the ass. That reminds me. Study hard. Especially you, Ryuji. <laughs> there are bound to be traps that will need to be solved with brains. It's fucking called out. Keep in mind that everything you do in your daily lives has an impact on your abilities. True. Studying won't be so bad if we just think of it as helping us prepare to be phantom thieves. I guess you got a point. But man, it's just so lame. I was all fired up about helping people, not about studying. Stay in school, kids. Well, I do have somewhere interesting to show you beforehand. You guys did originally promise to help me out with my mission, after all. Huh? Mission? It's like, we're hashtag the Chatamaze gang. You're all saying study. We're not hashtag, like, nerd patrol. Come on, now. We're not the, the, the dork dweebs. We can just all go to McDonald's. We'll study there. The burgers make you smarter. And we get like every other stat if we eat a burger. Follow me. What are you bringing us here for? Just do as I told you. Oh. All right. I've got the Phantom Aficionado website up. Now what? We're doing this in public? Look for a post with a full name in it. I already said, there's no info on any big shots. Don't you remember? Chat's getting riled up again. But man, people actually go put someone's real name on here. That's some scary shit. You won't listen to what I say. No, wait. There's no name on this one. Someone's bad-mouthing me in online chat rooms. This one's got a name. <laughs> We're just looking at the sub again. <laughs> Like, everyone in here is terrible. <laughs> Ignore those. Aren't there any posts about more serious trouble? I don't know what to do about my ex who's stalking me. His name is Natsuhiko Nakanoha. Oh, we can kill them. It says he's a teller at City Hall. A government worker stalking someone? That should be a suitable target. There we go. All right. Now get the meta nav ready. We're just gonna jump right into a palace? Fine by me. Hey! What happened to all that talk of unanimous decision? What do you think we should do? What do you think we should do, Johnny? 
<laughs> the illusion of choice is alive and well. That's what I'm talking about. Okay then, let's go. Do you want to say yes or yes with attitude? We need a name and a place, right? So the name is... Actually, we don't need a location this time. Just enter exactly what I say. Oh? The key word is... Mementos. Mementos. Huh? What are you trying to pull? Mementos. Me. It should work. I... Th ah, jeez. That again? Uh... Mementos, was it? We're gonna get him minty fresh. Candidate found. We got a hit? Just as I thought. If we do this here, won't that teleport a lot of people near us in with us? But that's how like An got pulled in before. Like there's a lot of people standing near us. Everyone disappeared. No, I guess not this time. Feels like I'm walking on air. Is this that Nakanohara guy's palace? That's half right, but half wrong. This is a type of palace, but it's different from the normal ones. Oh. Come on, let's head down. The shadows here lurk underground. It's like Johnny anim animates the, g the gang. Wait a minute, guys. We should be studying. What about our exams? Oh yeah, let's head home. I don't quite understand why. It may be because they're drawn to something. Underground? How are we going to get there? How? You use it every day on your way to school. Oh, we're gonna take the train. Follow me. Uh, wait up, cat. Let's get the train. The hell is this place? Wait, are clothes changed? The shadows know we're here? Since the moment we stepped in. You should have told us! We're still safe right here. Yes, this is like something new. I've come new. to investigate a number of times. Shadows never come up to this floor. But it's a different story once you go down. This place is simply teeming with them. More importantly, what is this Mementos? It's about time you start explaining. What is a Mento? Mementos is... Everyone's palace. Huh? What do you mean, everyone's? A palace as grand as the previous castle only forms when a person's wishes are extremely distorted. Oh, so this is more like... Not... Like... Because like, like, the last guy was just like, Jesus, he's the worst person ever. Whereas this is like, society's a bit shit. Everyone's a bit of an asshole. Welcome to, like, the asshole city. <laughs> so, instead of many individual palaces, the general public has one gigantic shared palace. That's where we are now. Mementos. Now that you mention it, this place feels a bit different from Kamoshida's palace. Casually terrible people. When you say shared, you mean they're all put together? Even though they're just strangers? Think of it as the collective unconscious. It's just Facebook in general. No, never mind. You wouldn't understand that. So what you're saying is, using this place, we can even change the hearts of people who don't have a palace? Correct. The steps to do so are slightly different, though. But this place looks pretty huge. Are we going to be able to get around just by walking? It's gonna take a while. It seems the time has finally come. Oh? Morgana! Transform! Oh no. Come now, Panther. Ladies first. <laughs> oh, of course. He's like a minivan now. Just without hesitation, step inside. A car? <laughs> no way! This comes from the way cognition materializes in the metaverse. Plus a bit of extra training. It's not dissimilar to how you guys transform. It's a cat bus. You turn it into a car is totally different than our clothes changing. 
It is a little bit. For some reason, cats turning into buses is an extremely widespread cognition among the general public. <laughs> For some reason. <laughs> why a bus, though? No idea. That's Wait, cute. Why didn't you do this at the castle? I would have if I could. But that castle was cramped. There were tons of stairs, and no way this fits on top of a chandelier. Hey, Skull! Ladies first! Can we just keep him as, like, a bus now? So, like, when we come up against the next, like, uh, palace mastermind, like, Morgana just runs them over. <laughs> Holy shit, look out! <laughs> And he's just like doing like 120 miles per hour, like a complete fucking crash. <laughs> hey, stop Let's do a hit and run. Panther, please be gentle. Oh Jesus, stop! <laughs> All aboard! Let's go. There's no one at the wheel. <laughs> Yeah, we're going with the McDonald's gang. <laughs> Why are you all just sitting back there? I'm a car, remember? Oh, sorry. I'm not going anywhere. Oh, okay. No, we have to steer. Oh, of course. You can't drive yourself? Do we need to put, like, gas in more cannon? <laughs> there you go. There's some diesel. But I'll get you going. Well, they actually used to call me the Drift King back in college, Anne. That's a bit worrying, <laughs> but I'll let you handle it. I don't even have that experience to lean on. That is a bit worrying. You're probably more skilled than I am, too. I am. All right, then. We'll leave the driving to you. Now start the engine. You can't drive. How, how is this working? Like, like... What part of the car engine is like your intestines? Are, like, are we sitting on like your kidneys? Are they the seats? How does this work like anatomy wise? Jeez, oh, what a pain. Where's the key to this thing? Why would you need a key? There's a switch just down next to the steering wheel. <laughs> that tickles. Oh, Lower. Geez. Lower. <laughs> so we just yank off the steering wheel. Like, his ear is gonna disappear now. Oh, there. That feels so Oh my good. god, no, I don't like this. Uh, is that Burren I hear? Oh, what a creepy ass car. I feel in danger. Don't underestimate my meowdery engine. Jesus. We're going full throttle. It's time to fly! I love every- I, I'm loving playing this game, uh, but Morgana, something I specifically do not love. <laughs> Everything to do with this character. It's the worst part. Everything else is actually like really fun and cool. This place uh, totally does feel like a palace. I guess it would be strange to drive on the tracks like this in the real world. Anyway, uh, Naka... Naka Nohara is somewhere in here, right? Most likely in a segment of his own creation. Don't worry, it won't be the size of a palace. The next step is to find an entrance to that segment. And again. What is this entrance going to look like? I have no idea, but strong distortions should be a pretty obvious visual clip. We just got to go wander around for it then. What a goddamn pain in the ass. Oh my god. Okay, welcome to the next bit of the game. We gotta go driving, we gotta map it out. Oh, there's like Mario Kart item boxes too. Can I still get an ambush? Yes, I can. <laughs> you just hit him with the bus. Now's our chance to strike. It's weak to fire skills. Persona! Okay, yeah, let's go. Looking cool, Joker. Oh, we have our new guy. Get him, Jack. Looking cool, Joker. 
Ravage them! Ooh. Looking cool, Joker! You're mine! Ooh. Looking cool, Joker! Uh, do we have a slime? We do have a slime, don't we? Yeah, kill him. Some good money okay. there. They were too weak to bother with. Okay, so we need to make sure that, like we grab all the items and just explore a bit. Examine. Joker! A treasure chest! Let's open it! Get him! I don't know if that was an ambush, I just kinda of drove into his face there. That shadow was crazy! Uh, let's go. Oh, what's this one we took? That's pretty good. Alright. We're just driving in like the victory screen now as well. Sooty boots. We can dry clean those. Not dry clean, just laundromat. Sleep vial. Wait, touchpad? Oh, God, he purrs if you use the touchpad. Oh, I hate that. It's like probably in the car or something. I'm just like wildly turning like the aircon or something like that, and that's what's making him purr. <laughs> you were weak to gun. Cool. Looking cool, Joker. Who are you weak to? So fire is its weak point. How strong are we right now? What level are these guys? I don't think it's on Merciless. Let me just make sure I didn't accidentally like turn the difficulty up. Which which sounds weird, but it get, the game gets easier. No, it's on normal. They're just low level. Okay, yeah, we're keeping it on normal because if I put it on hard, the problem is like I I, I I was thinking about this right, and it's I think the problem with hard is it's because if Joker dies. Uh, like the game just you just get a game over and Because of that it means that like on a lot of encounters. It's just an instant one-shot kill There's literally nothing you can do and you're dead and it just it's it's just kind of broken Like if I was to change like one kind of mechanic thing I would have it so that like your entire party has to die to die in a fight because it seems kind of weird that It's just one party member I was thinking about it, and it does kind of affect the difficulty, because I, if I put it on hard, like, we just die in one shot if an enemy decides to be mean to us. It's kind of silly. I, I wish I just went for a more, like, classic Final Fantasy right there. Why is it no cool down of them talking? Looking cool, Joker! Okay. They were too weak to bother with. Okay, what is this? It's like a black hole. Whoa! What the hell is this? this is all wavy and shit. This is the place that sends the target up ahead. Now oh, you're ready, Joker. Let's do it. He's not gonna expect this bus to pull up. Hmm? Hey, something's there. 
Seems to be uh, uh, Nakano Hara's shadow. Let's, let me see. Some front desk guy at City Hall became a stalker, right? I don't know how much evil he's done, but we have to do something if he's bothering other people. Alright, we'll go talk to him. Who are you? Are you that stalker? Haven't you ever stopped to consider how your ex feels? She's my property. I can do whatever uh -oh. I want with her. It's not like she didn't treat me like a plaything. What's wrong with me doing the same? You can't treat someone like shit just because they did it to you. What a load of crap. <laughs> Redditor spotted. <laughs> We're gonna oh, change no. the hearts of all the bastards like you. There are millions of people far worse than me. What about Matarame? He stole everything from me, but you're letting him off the hook? Oh, yeah, Matarame is the name of the next target as well, by the way. The game, it's spoilers, but like the game already spoiled it for us. Uh, that was the one in, uh, in the present that we were told we target. Matarame? What the hell's this guy going on about? This is the main villain, obviously. Get ready. Here he comes. Oh no, he's doing a happy dance. This monster that I finally have what's rightfully mine. I'm not gonna let you take it away. This is a winner takes all world. Come fight me, I'll show you what I mean. I don't see a weakness. I thought I crafted this guy. Okay, well. We just start with gun. Just hit him with everything. There we go. Nice going, Skull. Finish up. Here he comes. He's okay. I mean, honestly, do I do I have lightning? I think we just hit him more. No, I don't have light. I, I have so little like kind of like type diversity. Go down. Let's just start hitting him. Persona. Close the ground. Nice going, Skull. Can you explain to me what SP is? Basically, magic. There we go. Don't come back. He wasn't too fearsome. That gave us a lot of money, though. We got a lot of XP, too. Up. Take it. I'm... I'm sorry. Please forgive me. <laughs> He's calmed down a lot now. <laughs> I couldn't stop obsessing. Not after this person I trusted used me and then disposed of me. Uh, which person? Hold on, are you talking about that guy you mentioned earlier, Matarame? I was afraid of being thrown away again, like some worthless thing. So some selfish bastard was making you suffer too. Still, you shouldn't have dragged an unrelated woman into your mess. Yes, I know that now. I'll put an end to my love for her. Hey, gotta move on. You can change people's hearts, right? In that case, he deleted Reddit. <laughs> he just uninstalled on his phone. It's like, all right, that a resident of Tokyo saved. <laughs> well, no, no, because this is Facebook. Sorry, he deleted Facebook off his phone. The Chad Redditors versus the evil Facebookers. Won't you change Matarami's heart before more people fall victim to him? Change Matarame's heart? Hmm? What's that shining thing? Yeah, he just kind of collapsed into that. It's the bud of a treasure. Had we left it be, it very well may have blossomed into a palace. Joker, this will make a perfect reward. Sure. Attachment pearl. Beware the clingy ex-boyfriend. Request completed. So Nakanohara had a change of heart, right? Most likely. 
But how are we supposed to know if we succeeded? Well, the lady posted the dude's name online. If he really does change, she'll probably comment again. <laughs> it's like, update. Sorry about that. Mm, you do have a point. Either way, training against shadows down here is All's the best. All's G now. It's great prep for our next target. It's also nice to be able to give courage to the people who post their problems online. Like, update, he stopped bothering me. <laughs> On top of that, we can sell whatever treasure we get for some cold, hard cash. We'll go see Gunkel soon. Well, sounds like things are going pretty great for us. All right, we did it. Hold on. There's somewhere I want to show you guys before we leave. What, there's more? Don't worry. It won't take long. Okay, so we're not well, done here. Why don't we leave this room first? So this is like another like kind of mission thing you can do. That's separate to the palace, it seems. Yes, we gotta do it. What else it. do you want to do? Something I like to check in an area further down. First up, we should look for a platform that'll let us descend. But you've been here before, right? Don't you got like a map or something? That would hold no meaning in this place. The layout changes every time you enter. For real? So our pat changes too. This place is a fused cognition of a countless number of people. It's constantly shifted. Even so, our destination should be pretty close. I'm counting on you, Joker. Okay, yeah, so you can see that the layout has like actually adjusted. The map is actually quite handy here too. We can sneak up on them in our bus. Chalice dungeons. Oh, don't tell me that. I mean, it seems to be that kind of function, but there's like missions and other stuff to do. Maybe because we completed like a request and that had a name that was randomly generated. Let's go. Go I'd hope. Cool. Looking cool, Joker. Right. Let's go. Finish up. All right. <sighs> Didn't even break a sweat. Let's grab the items as we go to Devil Fruit. Yo, the door is just divided up. Down over there. Can go further in. Get out of the car. Oh, hold on a sec. You guys hearing something? Oh. The trains are totally running. Of course they are. We're in the subway, you know. Yeah, but I thought this was a palace. Then maybe this is how the public views this place? I don't know. <laughs> it's like, honestly, we're not really sure what's happening anymore. People go through this darkness every day? There's a metaphor in here somewhere. Forget that! You sure we're cool running around on these tracks? Should be fine as long as we're not on the same ones. I think. I'm no train expert. You gotta be kidding me! Anyway, let's head to the lower area. It should be right after we go down that escalator. Okay, so you can just head further in. The rail map's not looking too good. Oh, you gotta get try and get as deep as you can. Can I do all of this in this one day? Way. What if I just go to like area like 99? <laughs> That's what I kind of want to do, if possible. I want to see how far I can go in one day, though. Story gate it. Okay. What is this place? It's kind of creepy. And a dead end at that. Why does it even exist? Now hold on. Just watch. This is most likely not an ordinary wall. If my hunch is correct. Oh. It opened. And go to the Tokyo Underground Underground. A new area has been confirmed in the depths. Updating guidance information. See? It's just as I thought. What do you mean? That wall wouldn't budge when I came here by myself before. But it'd be weird for the deepest part of Mementos to be some normal place like this, wouldn't it? 
So you're thinking there's got to be more? Yeah, we got to dive as deep as we can. Like, this is going to be, like, my palace logic where, like, we go to the very end as often as we can. Like, yeah, we get to the bottom each time. Yeah. Now that Kamoshida's palace is gone and people are actually starting to talk about us, I knew something had to have changed down here. How deep is it? Should we try going further down? Absolutely. Let's not. That's no. not why we're here today, remember? No, it is, Morgana. The goal has changed. We've already accomplished our goal. We should head back, and I'll explain more once The goal we're... has changed. We need to dig deeper. <laughs> no. Hey, look. Oh, it's the egg kid. A person? In mementos? Hmm. Maybe it's this one. Ooh, tasty. Hey, what's he drinking? He's got juice. Oh. Hmm. I thought I felt something strange for a second. So, who are you guys? We should be asking you that. Good point. Sorry about that. Like, I'm the egg boy. It's customary for a human to introduce itself before asking another human for its name. His name is Eggnog. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me, Mr. Um... Tanuki? No, um, hmm. Cat? What took so long to come up with cat? <coughs> I'm not Sorry. either of those. <coughs> yeah, uh, getting confused about that seems pretty normal to me. My god, we found the only other user in the metaverse. My name is Jose. I'm looking for flowers. I'm pretty surprised to see some normal humans running around. I didn't know people could just come here. Well, we are pretty special. <laughs> wait, wait, that's not important. <laughs> Who you are is what matters right now. When you said you were looking for flowers, did you mean that floating thing? That's right, pretty lady. Those seem to be the ones I've been looking for. I'm collecting as many of them as I can, because I'm studying humans. Studying humans? That's why you turned a flower into a drink? Yep. Trying to okay. flower juice counts as studying? I mean, I ate a burger, Ryuji. Could you guys help me with my research? <laughs> How? By collecting flowers for me. I wouldn't ask you to do it for free, though. I find all kinds of stuff you can use while you're exploring. I'll trade you some of that stuff for more flowers. Okay, new collectible unlocked. This is like the seeds and the palace. Well, what do you think? Should we try and get him some flowers? Seems like it could do us some good, but we don't know this kid. We gotta be careful. It's the final boss in disguise. Oh, I'm sure he's fine. Let's give him a hand. He seems like he could use it. And it shouldn't be too hard to pick flowers while we're exploring, right? Okay. Any other reasons? <laughs> he called me pretty lady. Oh, Jesus. No. <laughs> like, Morgana is like freaking out having a crisis. Like, no! I'm the one for you! <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's probably fine. I mean, he said he'd give us useful stuff and all. What'd he say? Well, are you going to help me find the flowers or not? I mean, I like this kid now simply because he's making Morgana despair. <laughs> uh, let's help him. Gonna skip you. Go <laughs> I'm just Aww, skipping. Are you tired, kitty? You seem grumpy. I like this kid. I am not a cat. And I'm uh, oh, okay. Then are you hungry? I learned hunger can make a person turn grumpy. Here, you can have this. Milk taste cookies. Thanks, but I'll pass. It's not like a milk cookie, it's a milk taste cookie. Well, yeah, you're making the kid worry about you even more. Uh, guess there's no way out of this one. I'll be looking for flowers around here, so stop by and say hi if you see me. Oh, and I guess just gathering flowers would be kind of boring, huh? Since you humans seem to enjoy playing so much, I'll come up with some fun games for you. Sure. Ah, oh, I also remembered something humans like to say to each other. Good job. Okay. He's got a clown car. What the hell was that? 
If he's studying humans, does that mean he isn't one? <laughs> I mean, he just seemed like some nice kid. Well, he didn't feel like a shadow. I wouldn't say he's dangerous. At least for now. Anyways, can if we, we trade see any you of those flowers he wants, <laughs> I guess we can grab him for him. Whoa! Oh, I totally forgot. Hey! That's something I've been meaning to give to all of you. What will that be? I actually picked up something strange while I was exploring earlier. Here it is. Huh? What the heck is that? It's a star. At least that's what they look like, so that's what I call them. A star. Um... What about... Do you, did you want to show us? Huh. Make wishes on stars, right? That's so interesting. Stars granting wishes. So the star is going to grant your wishes. Wait! Our wishes. <laughs> or it would be nice to think that. Nice to think that. Seriously. Hey! I'll give this to you. It's so sparkly and beautiful. You want it too, don't you? It's a sign of our friendship. I know what that is. Doing good? Off I go now. Good job. Hey, wait! We probably had a lot of time to stop him. Uh, it's a primo gem. Oh, we're gonna get like a Genshin Impact wish soon. You know, there's a new five-star character out in the new banner. Like, no, stop! Don't. I know you're playing the anime ga game, Daniel. Don't mention that anime game. I highly doubt something like that would actually happen, even in mementos. But I guess you can at least try making a wish. Oh, I know. I wish for all you can eat parfait with zero calorie. All right. An extra large beef bowl with pork soup on the side. Mm. Nothing's happening. Was Skull wish, Skull's wish too petty? Huh? You're one to talk. I guess things just don't just happen that easily. Hey. But we can't just throw the, the thing away. Hold on to it for now. Well then. That was a bit unexpected. Let's head back now. Wait, we're gonna have to come back there at some point then. There's obviously more going on here. Ryuji deserves his ramen. Yes, he does. does huh? Still don't really get that place. Oh, and what was that wall thing we saw at the end? Not entirely sure, but that wall must have been there for a reason. If Mementos is the public's palace, though, it might be affected by the general public's belief in us. We need to go back. Why do you know so much about it, Morgana? My memories are a little foggy in that regard. However, I need to know what lies in the depths of Mementos, no matter what. Meme Mementos. <laughs> it does. It does say meme. Meme Mementos. <laughs> you could read it that way. Meme, uh, like meme, and toes. <laughs> meme and toes. No matter what. Mementos is not just everyone's palace; it's the source of all palaces. Mm, men's toes. <laughs> oh no. It used to be that palaces like Kamoshida's with one ruler simply didn't exist. So if we can do something about the greatest cause of distortions, I'm certain my appearance will... You wanted someone to save you too. I... I just needed pawns. You're just a cat. I see. So that's why you came poking your nose around with us. <laughs> I'll help you. I hope you can regain what you've lost. I'll... be relying on you guys. By the way, Morgana, are you a boy? Or might you be a girl? Fucking Professor Oak here. Could it be a car? <laughs> that is a possibility. I wish I could deny it, but I just can't be sure. Why not? In any case, of course I'm male. I mean, what is it? Oh. No, it's nothing. We're done talking about that. Anyway, we now know that we can perform minor changes of heart in mementos. If we come across any eye-catching leads, it may be worth dealing with them for a bit of combat practice. 
There were Morgana is actually Bethica from Bug Snacks, lest we forget. I bet we'll get tons of them if we can change someone famous and make the Phantom Thieves well known. The big fish are our main targets, after all. First, you need to find a way to get through your exams. I gotta study. He has no balls. Uh, Morgana, did you ever get neutered? <laughs> so come on, Morgana, we gotta take you to the vet. We don't want more cats on our hands. Just let's just chop those off right away. <laughs> You can now go to Meme and Toes. This is where you change the hearts of petty criminals who do not have their own palaces. For now, be patient until the next target appears. Oh. Who's that? <laughs> okay. And uh, that uh, Akin O'Hara guy was a piece of cake. You can take down some uh, kind of big target next. We're totally gonna be get famous. They were trying to help people not get famous. But people don't know how who we are, how are we going to give them any courage? It's like we got we got to we got to start the TikTok on. See? I don't think that you're necessarily wrong. Should we really be doing this at all if we don't have a reason like with Kamashita? I mean, we shouldn't be sticking our nose into other people's business. I don't know, man. If someone's in trouble, it's only natural to want to help them out. I mean, I agree with that. I guess I was glad we were able to solve the stalker case. Plus, what good are our personas if we don't use them for good? Don't you agree, Johnny? I want to help people. Same goes for me. We don't, much, we don't got much time to be arguing over this either. That Matarame guy bothers me. You have no getting carried away, you understand? So don't do anything to stand out. Like, fail all your exams. Oh crap, speaking of that, I haven't studied at all. <laughs> what about that star, the one, uh... Is it Jose or Jose? They, they, they said Jose, didn't they? Yeah, I'm, I'm used to saying it as Jose, but like, it's just how the game pronounced it. Sadly, Jose. I, 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 I'm, I'm just going to go with the, what the game says for it for consistency. Um, Jesse. <laughs> Where'd you acquire this crystal star, Jesse? Okay, Jose. Okay, we'll go with Jose. I uh, wonder if that could help us ace the exams. Yeah, somehow I doubt that. I'll let settle for just not failing. Bargaining isn't gonna help you here. We wouldn't use it for that in the first place. Maybe you should just, I don't know, put some actual effort and you still got time. Fine. What's up? Is it for you? Did you mention anything about me mentos? Is there anything you want to know? I can help. I can tell you. Okay, uh, we can. Wait, can we not go out? The map's not letting us leave. Hey! You must be tired after everything you cramped today. Let's go out another time. Okay, so we're, we're just stuck inside this time. Study, please, God, study. But what if it's raining tomorrow and the study is more efficient then? So I just need to see, make sure. I have Chari, I have Death, and yeah, I have the Hero Fan as well for her for Copy Dad. Okay. Study, please, God, study. I gotta finish watching my movie though. <laughs> I gotta return what? this. Damn, to... yeah, they shut off the power. How are we going to rig an alarm now? Whoever said you need electricity to make an alarm? Give me that empty soda can. I'll just tie it to this string. <laughs> what could MacGyver? It's like, oh, we're just gonna like welcome like arts and crafts today. Hmm. Oh. Proficiency hmm. increased. Pretty good. Another DVD okay. completed as well. We can return it and get another one. I'll trade and no study makes Johnny Anime a dull boy. No, that's the other way around. I'll work and no play. We're having plenty of play. <laughs> hey, I saw on the forum. Nice job sticking it to that stalker. 
My phantom aficionado website came in handy, didn't it? Who gave you this number, Mishima? <laughs> We're not gonna admit it, no matter what. You can just put them down. It's okay, you don't have to say it. I know deep down in my heart that it was useful. Anyway, I'm in Shibuya right now. I'd love you to come here. Hear me about out about your future actions. Waiting at the diner in Shibuya, you gotta swing by. What is he up to? Well, anyway, we gotta hang with Ryuji. Oh uh, no. Things bad, you know, with the special activities. Is that ah. a solid gold motorbike? Oops, <laughs> sorry about that. I uh, haven't been getting a lot of sleep lately. Oh no, he's taking over Juice Day. No, Mishima, we don't want to spend time with you. I've been staying up managing the fan site all night. Every night. I think it's called PR. I gotta have my bat later, too. I, I don't want to talk to you right now. Goddamn Redditor. <laughs> fan site. The Phantom Thieves Aficionado website. Fan site for short. You need a catchy name if you want people to notice you. This is all a bit of P Thieves propaganda. Please, uh, okay, no, we we need a new mod. Like, um, yep, don't call us the P Thieves, please. That really insinuates something different. <laughs> Basically, there's no point to taking down bad guys if nobody's gonna know about it. <laughs> the piss thieves. <laughs> That's why I've started a blog for posts from people you guys saved, while filtering out the haters. We need the Phantom Thieves to be seen in the proper light if we want to make the name popular, right? He really is like, I'm your new social media manager. <laughs> I think I've seen this guy like send me like a bit work email at some point. Like, hi, I'm from XX Company, and we could increase your views and performance reach on YouTube. When you want to schedule a call, looking forward to hearing from you. I don't want to be talking to you. But I probably have to support him because he's a confidant and I need to kind of get the confidant points. You've done good, kid. He probably just wants praise. Really? <laughs> yeah, Sarah, there we go. Makes my worth it. <laughs> oh, he's easy to please. So, actually, I really want to know how you punish people. Don't worry, I'm not gonna ask. It wouldn't be any fun if you just up and told me. After all, the Phantom Thieves have a reputation for being secretive. I... I wish I could be more like you guys somehow. But I'll still be here to draw attention to the stuff you do. You can leave that part to me. I'm gonna use my fan site to promote the Phantom Thieves and weed out any negative comments. It's not gonna work. Some of them always slip through. It's impossible. Your popularity is gonna be at my mercy. Or, uh, uh my fingertips. <laughs> They're just, he's just gonna create an echo chamber. <laughs> it's like I'll be your strategic image management representative. So to speak. It, it, I, I've someone has used that title, probably in my business emails at some point. Okay. Um. I I need to be supportive though, because we need to get the confidant points. It's probably practical to like be friends with this guy, even if, even if like we're missing Juice Day. Sounds cool, or you're really hyped for this? It's one of these two. Which one we which one we think it is? He's gonna like one of these. I don't think you can check what, like uh yeah you can't check what other people pick for this. Most people are saying two. Sounds cool. I knew you'd understand. We got like five points for them. Anyway, I'm gonna it's do so everything many. I can to make sure that title's more than just for show. I've got to say, though, managing the Phantom Thieves' reputation is tiring work. We have a social media manager now. The forum gets all sorts of weird posts, including tons of things unrelated to reforming society. Yeah, sounds about right, Mishima. It'd defeat the purpose of the site if the truth of the Phantom Thieves was buried among all that garbage. It's just like a load of memes. Like, people keep posting something about the lettuce winning. I don't, I don't understand. 
but you don't need to worry. I'll sort through all the trash. Speaking of which, I've actually already found some worthwhile info about our very own school. Our quest to boost your popularity can start close to home. I... <laughs> Please don't refer to it, any of it this way. I'll give him my all. Shiva seems motivated. I mean, at least we're getting the Kafatan rank. We got a lot of points for them there. That was an easy rank up there. All right. Shima will now give you information on targets and mementos. After making a target have a change of heart, meet with Mishima to deepen the trust between you give you more information on new targets. Okay, so we, we probably want to do this thing because this is going to unlock a lot of gameplay from the sounds of it. So Mishima probably is a very important confidant. It seems that... Yeah, we're going to have to focus him as well because like, we're actually locked out of gameplay, it seems, if we don't. I might be overworking myself, though. <sighs> Man, I'm exhausted. <sighs> I think I'd fall asleep on the spot if I weren't talking to you. I want to get my juice, Mashiva. I should head home. Please See do. See you later. <laughs> He's still texting us. Oh, anime, listen to this. I was checking the fan site earlier and found a bunch of hater comments about the fan of these. <laughs> It got me so mad, I'm not even sleepy anymore. At this point, I might as well pull an all-nighter fighting back. Uh, no, nah, that, that doesn't work, Mashiva. Nah, yeah, you just gotta kinda hide them. Hide by user. Nice hustle, image manager. Calm down, all-nighters could mess you up. See, I don't know. I, I, I think we just have to be like a yes-man, though. I think we have to be a bit of a yes-man. Calm down is definitely not it. It's like, care for him or just praise. Calm down just never works. Let, let, let's try personal care. Maybe he'll be like, Oh, you, you, you care about me that much? Oh, anime senpai. Oh, what, you're worried about my hell? Oh, thanks, that would be even more motivated. Anyway, I'm just gonna work my butt off, just watch me. No, no, it didn't work. Duty calls, I better set out for the battle of the fan site. Time for a wild night, night of modding and ban. <laughs> if the moderators here are just on my channel, just want to like screenshot this image for yourselves. <laughs> well, RT streaming. Time for a wild night. <laughs> here we go. Oh, Jesus, that is quite funny. <laughs> Local streamer bans his entire chat. Hang on, oh, let me just check one thing too. Hang on, gang. Yeah, I feel like that's that's one for the mod bin, just for the mods. We, we have uh, mod shit posts, and I feel like that's gonna be there. Yeah, your midterms are coming up, aren't they? Better make sure you study. What about that diner Chibu that Mishima told you about? It'll be a good place for studying, right? <laughs> Get permission to go out at night. I can go get juice! Well, then. Hang on. Oh, I need to go back out. I need to go back out. Oh, what's on the shopping channel? Recover oil, relax gel, and alert capsule. Oh, the mega fertilizer. Wait, is, is that better than the one I have? Hey, hey. Is that better than the one I have? I think it is, yeah. I'm gonna have to sell, like, some of those, um, the old, like, the old plant nutrients that I got. Yeah, let's buy the good fertilizer. I'm gonna get so much kindness. Well then. Okay. Okay, Coffee Dad wants to spend time with us. Oh, we can get a rank up with Coffee Dad. Maybe we come back and do that. We still gotta go see Gunkel and uh, Sanderson. But we, we need to go get juice first. 
Now listen up. Oh no, I need a bat today as well, don't I? I have to get the bat. Yeah. Oh, I forget that I can just do this too. Uh, Shibuya. Okay, juice stand. Hi. <laughs> it's nasty today. Hey, guts to drink this terrifying mixture. Take it. Get our juice in. Nice. I need to get a new DVD as well because we finished our existing one. Uh, it's near the burger shop. We'll spend time with Coffee Dad soon. It's just that right I, Sunday's bath day. We only get one bat a week. We gotta get it in. Okay, last DVD. Let's rent that out. Uh, the bookstore. Is there anything new here? There is a new one. Be knowledgeable about internet crimes. A group on the a book on the hacker group Medjed. Okay. New book. I learn about internet crime. Is this one open? Is this always open? Oh, this is the diner. Yeah, so we can we can go there now. Can I quick travel to the diner in Shibuya? Oh. Family restaurant has been renovated and is open again. Studying will cost time in the past, but will improve your knowledge. In addition, if you eat, you'll be able to improve your guts as well. Items will be added to the menu depending on the season. During bad weather, you'll be able to increase your knowledge more than usual. Hmm. But you can study here while also enjoying the menu. You want to study here. Okay, so you can study at the diner and get food, apparently. Is that better than the library? It might be. You want to study here from now on? Yeah, that's what I was thinking, because you can get knowledge up and then also... Um... Like, just another stat. Yeah, that sounds fantastic. I actually... It's a funny little thing. Um, when I was living in Japan, actually, um, when I, at the time when I was making content on YouTube, um, I was making, like, a very scripted series of content uh, in TF2. Um, and I used to actually always kind of go out to a restaurant like that and work on the script while I also got food while I was out, so that just reminds me of that a little. RT lore. <laughs> no, yeah, it's what I used to always do, so like all the scripts for like the How to Really Play series, I don't know how many people here even remember that. Uh, those were all written in like kind of cafes like around Ueno. That's where I would always go. Update the wiki. That's so cool, I never knew you lived in Japan. Yeah, no, I did, 2018. Lore. <laughs> oh, here's Sanderson. Please consider what I have to say. There have been far too many incidents reason to ignore. Can anyone deny this? There were no train incident, mysterious psychotic breakdowns, school with a corrupt teacher. We've yet to discover the truth of it all. The apathy that pervades society is a direct result of negligence by our government and the media. I'll be, uh, he's completely right, but my god, he sounds like a conspiracy theorist. You. You're listening quite attentively. Are you interested in politics? I'm interested. Are you a student? I'd like to captivate the interest of someone your age. Mm. Use the help of a young person. I can't hire someone without any experience. Sorry about that. However, I'd be happy if you stop by to hear one of my speeches again. That's all for today. I'm heading to the beatball shop. Hmm. The old man's speech is impressive. That kind of talk might be useful in negotiations in the metaverse. But I guess he's looking for someone with more experience. If you show him your dedication, wait. That he's going to a beef bowl shop, right? But he's talking about the one on Central Street. What have you worked part time at the beef bowl shop? Okay. All right, so that's how you get his confidant. Sure. Oh wait, wait. Do we get to check the lottery result now? I thought it was on Monday. Did I win the lotto again? I've won twice now. 
I didn't get all my money back that time, though. Welcome. I was down a little bit there, but that's okay. I'm going to just buy another lotto ticket. And on the next one, I'm going to win big. The lotto's on Sundays as well, apparently. I thought the lotto was Mondays. The lotto is Sundays, too. We have so much to do on Sundays. We have so much to do. Okay, right now, though, I need to get a bat. And I can I can buy out the vending machines again for when we go into the palace. Mm. Oh. What do you want to do? Okay, Sunday is bath day, so we're always gonna make sure we do it. Our, our routine for Sunday is pretty set. Arctic, thank you for the 250 bits. Hope you're doing okay in Scotland. Thank you for the kind words. Hope you're doing all right. You need to study. I need the mugwort bat. Whoa. We need to level up our social knowledge too, you know? Look at those three points of charm. Wanna head back? Sunday is bash juice lottery day. <laughs> that sounds like it's a lottery for bat juice. <laughs> the bat juice lottery day. You could win the best bat juice about buy a ticket. <laughs> You forgot shopping? Oh yeah, it's the Bad Juice Lottery Shopping Channel today. <laughs> what? Uh, shopping channels on Sunday as well. What's up with the goggles? You going snowboarding or something? I hear the cedars blooming later than usual. Climate change and what have you. Oh Jesus. Pollen allergies suck. Couldn't go to the mountains even if I wanted to. My eyes and nose would gush like rivers. That sounds awful. Seems pretty rough. In fact, the news said pollen season was starting later than usual this year. Looks like the pollen problems have only just begun. People are about to have some itchy eyes. This might affect mementos the same way weather does. Okay. What does it do with mementos? Uh. Uh. You have allergies? Allergies? Oh, uh, maybe. I do feel kind of dazed and everything feels weird. But... Um, actually, I've been having this feeling that someone's watching me. Oh no. Uh, I hope not. Oh, uh, maybe I just can't shake off the feeling of infiltrating a palace. At the palace, we're always cautious of not being noticed, you know? So it has to be my imagination. <laughs> yeah. That's not good. I think this, the atmosphere of school is kind of different now. I mean, with there being no Kamoshida. Yeah, nobody ever talked about him out in the open like this before. I wish someone would just thank us for it or something. Either way, everything has worked out for the best. After all, Kamoshida's actually been punished for his crime. That's, a, that's victory enough for me. No, I mean, that's a pretty good outcome. Like, you don't actually need the fame, even though we have our social media manager. <laughs> it's about the effect there. I don't know what's going to happen to him now. I mean, he's a famous criminal at this point, right? He's gonna have to deal with people hating him forever. It might be true, but I don't have any sympathy for him. He got what he deserved, for sure. There's over 6k people watching you on. I don't know where you're getting this feeling from. Oh no. Oh, Mishima has more info. It's on the fan side, but I heard about it at school too. There's a guy at school whose bullying has gone too far. I want to help the victim, but that's impossible for me. But I bet the Phantom Thieves could do something about it. I mean, you already changed the hair of that stalker, so this should be a breeze, right? Piece of cake. You're amazing. The bully is a brown-haired guy frequently seen standing out in front of the school entrance. But I can tell, his name is uh, Daisuke uh, Kanashi. Uh, Takanashi. I know you can handle this. Uh, you got some info on your target. This is a small case, we have a name, so we should be able to consider him a target. Okay, so yeah, so Mishima's just gonna give us these as time goes on. Request received. Can I... 
Um, can I stack these? Can I, like, world... Like, help me out, chat. Can I, like, World of Warcraft quest this? Where it's like, I'm gonna, like, not just go for one thing, but, like, seven in one go. Yes, I can. Perfect. Okay, yeah, we're gonna let these pile up in a while before we go. For all here, you want to go to Mementos, right? What are you talking about? Don't we need to study for exam? Let's go! Don't worry about that stuff. Let's ignore the details. Just go charge it head first. Um... Wait, no, I, I actually, I want to, I want to check my social connections. I gotta go see my doctor. Let's go. Mental is coming from Mishima. All right. Perfect time. Let's just go in right now. Then. Uh... Really do anything to avoid studying, huh? Check your information on the target by selecting view request at the hideout, or by pressing triangle to view request in the main menu. If the information has been confirmed, you can begin by selecting Explore Mementos. Mementos can be explored even without a target, but time will pass as it would in a palace infiltration. Exercise caution when nearing the time limit. Um, so you can view requests now, is it? Do you guys remember the most important step that a Phantom Thieves need to take before they can steal someone's heart? What? Tell us. Oh. You mean the calling card? Wait a sec, did we send one last time? Treasure materializes when we change the hearts of the target subconscious with a calling card. That's the rule in dealing with a palace. But mementos, it seems like we can just go for the target immediately. We can just leave like a Reddit comment that's like, hey, you suck and we know what you did. And it's like, like that puts them on edge. Like, that's enough. What? You don't need a calling card or nothing. Something else already ex exists that fulfills that role. Fortunately, Versa Mishima put a, co put a comment up in the forum saying the Phantom Thieves are. Oh, it actually is that. <laughs> it's just like a hateful comment. Like Mishima is like fucking on the subreddit. and it's like, we know where you live. <laughs> He's gonna dox him. <laughs> For a small target, that's enough of a calling card. That alone will put some fear in them for a while. <laughs> Even the, uh, uh, Nakanohara must have seen Mishima's comments about him on the fan site, and that's why the nav picked up on him. <gasps> we really leave something that important to someone else. The size of the mementos shadows are done compared to those of palace rulers. Still, we need to unanimously agree on our target, no ignoring the rules even for smaller ones. Anyway, let's get to discussing the intel we've gathered. The intel is on an arrogant brown-haired bully. He's a student at Children's Academy. Things have gone a little too far for just bullying though. He's abusing and blackmailing kids. I'm gonna make him pay. He's a perfect target. Come on, let's take him down. I'm sure you aren't just excited to go to Mementos. And again, we really can't leave a guy like that be. We should go. No objections, right? Wait, no, I I don't. I don't wanna go yet. I don't wanna go. Can I can I back out of it here? Yeah, just close. Okay, so infiltrate palace. There is no palace. That's just view requests. That's just go into mementos. Okay, exit. Mm. Perfect. Okay, so you don't have to do that now. Let's see what we really want to do. Confidant up with Ryuji? Or up with Takami? I think we just go for Ryuji. Did he send us a text? Uh, where, where is Ryuji? It's a library. Study, study, please God, study. No, I gotta go to Ryuji. He's in the cl he's in class. You will fail. I have enough knowledge, I think. No, those aren't my stats. Exams are in two days! Yeah, it's fine. I'm gonna pass. I have two knowledge. Let's go hang out with, uh, Bro Uji. Yo. Yo, Johnny, you're heading home. Dude, I really want to talk. I guess it's more like vent. If you want to grab some ramen? I'll show you my go-to place. Perfect. 
kind of far, but it's totally worth it. The flavor's out of this get world. Going? Anyway, it's in... Uh... Oh... Ikubo? Ikubo. It's... Ogikubo. Ogikubo? Let's take the train over there. Oh, we got a new area! Sure. Alright. You now have information on a new hangout spot. Okay. You can also invite people who may enjoy even ramen to hang out with you here. There are a number of hangout spots in the city, such as shops, events, venues, landmarks, and so on. Confidants will each have their own favorite hangout spot. If you go there with them, your bond will grow even deeper than it normally would. You can learn about hangout spots by having confidants invite you there or by reading about them in books. Try to find as many as you can. Okay. This is like kind of like a minor area. There's not as much to do, is it? <laughs> I love the feel of noodles slipping down my throat, sweat dripping over my face. This shit's the best, man. Ramen is life. Light soup like this really gets your body going again after a good run, you know? I used to come all the way out here after practice, Ad. <laughs> I guess that's all in the past. It's <laughs> us. Guys, please. <sighs> By the way, I've seen, uh... Nakawaka? Around a few times? For some reason, it don't look like he's getting along with the others. Okay. Now, we want to maximize points here. Don't talk down to him. He's a bro. Asking? Not quite. It's probably two. Are you worried about him? Yeah, kinda. There we go. That's what we need. <sighs> I've been thinking about what he said. How the whole track team was putting up with Kamashita's shit. And how I effed it all up for him. I think he was right. They don't even got a club room anymore. So they've been storing all their stuff behind the gym. They can't use any school gear either. They just run laps around the block for practice. There ain't really a place for outcasts like that. You should know that better than anyone. It's good they're keeping their heads low now, though. I don't want them ending up like me. So, but you're doing great. Or I know how you feel. It's not so bad. Probably not. Maybe just straight words of encouragement. I think straight words of encouragement is better than sympathy. Yeah. <laughs> You know what, you're right. Oh shit, that's so many. I guess now I'm thinking about it, trying to fit in is a real pain in the ass. I mean, I'd never m met you guys if I wasn't an outcast, right? So it's all good. For real, for real though. Okay, text for real here. I'm guessing that counts. Text face for real, no sound file. It's been a shit ton of fun. Hang it out with you guys is so freaking cool. Oh, we got so many points there. Stealth dash makes you makes you less likely to be found in the metaverse while dashing. So now we can just ambush more often. All right. That that actually seems pretty good. That's pretty good. Hmm. I just hope there's something I can do to help those track guys. That would probably mess them up if I tried to butt in. Oh yeah, we still gotta find a new spot for our training. Now think about it, no slacking off till then, okay? See ya! Later, dude. Yeah, that seems like a pretty good perk. Tokyo Tourist, a trophy earned. Ah, you're back. Yo. Another box came for you. Hey! Plant food? Oh! Sam's is such a downer. I already bummed out, uh, about. I already bummed about tests coming up. I'm in trouble for anything that's not English. I haven't been studying at all. Oh, maybe we can make some progress if we, ha if we keep an eye on each other. Want to study together? What's it going to be? Are you going to study with Lady On? We can meet up. But wait. Da we could get rank up with Dad as well. We could get rank up with Dad. Um, try a group study session though. I don't I don't know what that's actually gonna give us. We haven't had that option yet, have we? Let me just see if the plant needs anything too. Nice. It's pretty healthy. Yeah, let's let's try a group study. Group study. Study for the love of God, please. You're a big help. Let's meet at the diner in Shibuya.
Long sense is tough. Try to think about what the underlying section means. He's starting to understand how to dissect these problems. I think so. I'm so jealous you get a one-on-one -on -one study session with Lady Anne, J Johnny. Seems like you're making more progress than usual, too. Oh, okay, so you get even more points of knowledge if you do that. That's basically as if it was raining. Yeah, pretty good. Actually, no, raining was four. Raining was four. That's not. That's it. only three. I'm actually not so good at this because of my time abroad. Anyway, time to study. Here we go. You get a point with them too. Okay, that's that's what it, that's what it is. Raining is three. I thought raining was two and two. Okay. No, so rain, so rain, rain is just, no, it's two and one. Oh, uh, okay. Two and one. Okay, so yeah, so we got, we got the same amount. That's pretty good. And we also got a point went on. So yeah, group study sessions actually seem quite good. You think you could help me with Matt next? Let's get back. I'm so tired. Let's stop here. That's pretty good. It looks like you're attending school seriously. Oh, hey, Makoto. How you doing? You also seem pretty close with Takamaki-san if you're both coming to school together. She's, like, just watching us. You just transferred here, though. I guess you two really click. We're in the same class. I see. You seemed a lot closer than that yesterday morning. We were just talking? I heard she was a victim of Mr. Kamashita. But was that all there was to it? She's gonna kill you. <laughs> Either way, closer inspection should clear everything up. Goodbye. Yeah, she is on to us. He's such a weirdo, Makoda. <laughs> Exam start tomorrow. Are you all ready? Well, that to pick it up begin? from last time. The end of the... The Heian period marks the rise of the samurai, which I'm sure you've all been waiting for. That's describing the tale of the Hake. It was a time when all that was great would fall from grace. It was unusual for the heroes of yesterday to be struck down as rebels of the present day. By the way, sympathizing with the loser or the weak is called magistrate's patronage. The term came from uh, Minamoto no uh, Yochisune's position. And it also became a way of referring to him as well. Alright, anime kun. Oh. Do you know the answer? Do you know the time period uh, Yoshisune was active in? Don't you? Let me just quickly... Ch oh yeah, he literally just said it, of course. <laughs> this is it. Correct. Basic listening comprehension achieved. <laughs> He supported his brother, uh, Yoritomo, during the Heian period. But despite his contributions in defeating the Taira, uh, he was driven out by his brother and ultimately executed. Over in the centuries that followed, uh, Yochisune became more popular as a tragic hero. Oh, wow, really? Anime Kun seems kind of smart, doesn't he? Nice going. That's me. I have a smartphone in this world. You know how that's like a, a, a genre of that, like that, because that is a genre of like manga and anime, where it's like trapped in this world, but I have like a gaming PC, or I'm trapped in video game land, but I have a smartphone. Like that actually, that actually is one. I'm trapped in high school, but I have a smartphone. <laughs> that's what we're doing, Isekai. That's it. I always forget the name for it. I've seen a shield hero. I know what a Kanosuba is. Rather than side with the wood who has overwhelming power, people prefer the underdog opposing them. Stop. <laughs> sort of like rooting for a minor league baseball team instead of an all-star major league one. Yep. I understand that. It's like, if I don't root for him, then who will? I... I know a re-zero. You want a log a horizon? <laughs> Cease. <laughs> the 
thing is, right, because I, because I, I haven't seen a lot of these, right? So people can't tell what's real or not. But I'll confirm there, I've seen at least one of those shows I mentioned. But you don't know which. <laughs> you don't know which. <laughs> Comedy exams, you could always liven up the day and head to, to head to mementos. Nice, we could get some info on the target before we went though. Mishima have intel. Can we chat? I found a place. Oh, we found somewhere on the train. It's gonna grow stronger. Yeah. Yeah, we're hanging with Ryuji again. Another rank. We're like speed running Ryuji at the moment. Max rank. Going to a back alley in Shibuya. Just blanking on. We didn't even open her text. <laughs> this has gotta be it. Here we are. Protein Lover's Gym. It's pay per visit, so you don't gotta worry about any bullshit contracts or nothing. The equipment's kinda crappy, but they got tons of variety. Plus, it's real damn cheap. Totally worth it. Even without a pool or a hot tub. By the way. Yeah, you bring your stuff. Towel or protein? This is like the bro answer. Protein powder, yeah. I'm, I'm ready to get buffed. Hell yeah, if you want to beef up, you gotta wait, that ain't it. Talking about spare. <laughs> okay. Getting back into your sweaty clothes after a nice hot shower is like the grossest goddamn thing. Oh, don't go getting your hopes up. No way I'm gonna... <laughs> We're, get, we're getting real close with Ryu Ryuji. Wanna get going? Anyway, let's head in. You can now quick travel to the sports gym in Shibuya. <laughs> My form's coming back, but I don't got any stamina. Sakamoto. Morning. Uh, Ikeda Senpai. What's bunk? <laughs> Bonkin, you say the strangest things. Is that how you greet a friend? <laughs> We're trying to come up with some cool new slang. Maybe it'll catch on. You can't just do that. Oh, and you don't need to call me senpai anymore. I've already graduated, remember? I haven't seen you before. Were you on the track team? He's uh, a friend. By the time he showed up, the track team was already well, you know. Speaking of which, how's your leg? Yeah, I'll manage it. How about you, senpai? You're still running. You should join my university's track team. I think I would have quit entirely after what happened. <sighs> Without that, I'm real sorry. No, I should be the one apologizing. I was supposed to be the leader of our team. Yeah, I just resigned myself to Kamashita's will. <coughs> it's because you needed him to write your letter of wreck, right? We were just looking out for your future, but I still managed to F it up anyway. Lum, thanks for the 295 bits. All caps message, Dad, for the love of God, please study for your exams. Thanks for supporting the stream. Kamashita clearly never intended on writing my letter of recommendation. You were just an excuse not to. And honestly, I enjoy where I am now. The track team is an ending special, but it's perfect for me. So in truth, I should be thanking you for what you did, Sakamoto. Senpai. Always regretted not doing more to protect you guys. I heard some good news recently. The Shujin track team's being reinstated. For real? <laughs> there it is! I mean, Kamashita confessed all the horrible stuff he did right. He has the school team... The school got the old team together, and they told them that they want to try start it up again. Nobody told me that. Ah, oh, the rumors got as far as me, and I'm not even a student anymore. Anyway, I heard they're going to get, uh, Mr. Uh... Yamauchi as their new advisor. Huh? Yamauchi? What'll that Yamauchi? Yep, the one who was basically Kamashita's lapdog. Apparently he volunteered. He's really enthusiastic about pulling the track team up from the ashes. He is. You know... Now that that team is being reinstated, there's no need for any bad blood, right? Why don't you go talk to him? I'm sure they could use someone with your passion. Yeah. Hmm. The track team's coming back. Good for them. Okay. You're done with them, right? Not quite that. Do you want to rejoin? I think it... Uh, you seem conflicted. Yeah, I think do you want to rejoin? It's one of these two. Oh, people are all saying one. You seem conflicted. One feels right. Okay, I'm gonna try it. 
Not really. Okay, that's two. That's two. For real, though. I'm glad the team's coming back. It's sweet that uh, Nakaoka and them can start training again. I'm still worried about their advisor, Yamauchi. It's basically like a mini Kama Shida. He's short. He's an asshole. <laughs> Uh, Basically. He'll always yell at us uh, practice, at practice, but then there's this huge kiss ass when our parents were around. Can't believe a moron like that's gonna be advising the track team. He doesn't even teach PE. He's gotta be up to something. I'll do some research. <laughs> there's a chance I'm gonna need your help too, okay? You'd be free to lend me a hand if I need it, yeah? I'm counting on you. Oh, our bond's growing so deep. Rank five. Look at that. All right. All right, we don't got time to be messing around here anymore. Let's head home. Got a shower first. See ya. And you can't use my undies. See ya. Yo, what's bonkin? About that stuff today. I can't really let myself be happy about the track team starting up again. Like I said earlier, there's just something fishy about uh, Yamauchi being the advisor. I mean, if anything happens, I know you got my back, so I ain't too worried. Not that. Not that. Just don't worry, I got you. Thanks, man. I knew I could count on you. I mean, we don't know for sure if anything sketchy's going on. What's bonking? I don't think it's ever gonna catch on as, like, a catchphrase, is it? Why did I just start the stream? It's like, what's bonking, Twitch chat? It, it, it doesn't sound right. You want to go bonk with the homies? <laughs> okay, don't say that one. <laughs> don't say it. I get these gut feelings, they're usually right. <laughs> but if I hear anything, I'll hit you up. Okay, later. What's bonking for real? Uh, Exam soon. Oh, Ryuji wants to study as well. We're just spending- we're having like a nice day with Ryuji, aren't we? We're just having a real good time with him. Oh, there's a crossword too! Hang on, okay, let's do the crossword, then we'll go study. What are the May Blues? Doom's partner, plant disease, dull pain? Doom's partner, five letters, dull pain. Uh. Oh, eight. Doom's partner. Plant disease. What the fuck is the plant disease? Blight? Okay. Oh, it, it is just doom and gloom. Okay, yeah, because you got a lot of O's here. And then, what are the May Blues? Uh... Malays? There we go. In Japan, the May Blues are named as such uh, due to the change of seasons and the number of people who fall ill after the long holiday at April's end. Uh, similar terms are used across the world. Students in the USA get the September blues after summer vacation, while the UK has January blues to contend with. All right. I see. Oh, even I couldn't figure that one out. Nice. You got a bit smarter after solving these crossword puzzles. I think in Ireland, but like, I mean, we just say September sucks. We don't really call it, like the blues and that. 
For Fallen Ill, it's just flu season around Christmas. We just say that. Flu season. I don't know if we have, like, a more precise term for it than that. September is depressing and January are... Like, th those are, like, the two most depressing months of the year. I think that was, those were bottom of the tier list, too, when we did it. But yeah, flu season, I think, is just what we call it when everyone gets sick. Okay, uh, I take it we just want to hang out with Ryuji again. We can get some knowledge up and get a confidant point. It's probably just a good shout. We want to we wanna become, like, best buds with Ryuji. And this actually means we'll be studying, too. What about Han? We've still just left her on, like, red. <laughs> Trying to get the hang of this, so I guess that's what I'd do with this one too. But that's no good. Damn it, what did I mess up on? Try starting over. Good advice, Johnny. It's important to revisit and review where things went wrong. Yeah, so I'm only ever gonna study if like I'll go to the diner, specifically if it's raining. Or like a friend asks me to. Like otherwise, like what's the point? Like we're gonna we're probably gonna get so much knowledge over the course of the game. Yeah. Here, if I just fix this. Problem solved. You're freaking amazing, dude. That's another two points with Ryuji. I'm gonna go grab a refill. Solving that question's got me real pumped up. Got so what many. Faran doesn't even get red. You left her undelivered. <laughs> Can't believe it's a school assembly during exam week. The hell are they thinking? It's the day after tomorrow, right? I wonder if it's going to be about Mr. Kamoshida again. Can't believe the school is messing with our schedules like this. I don't care what it's about. It's going to it's gonna have nothing to do with us students. Wish they stopped dragging us into their mess. Seems pretty rough. Mandatory assembly during exam week, huh? Sounds rough for all of you. Well, shall we begin? Okay, it's exam time. What historical figure inspired the item of favor in the match? Wait, what was his name again? Uh, Yochisuna, yeah? Oh no, we can't check the internet anymore! Ooh, we can Sounds do about this. right. Mm. See, an essay question. This looks tough. Let's calm down and think it through. Provide the reason why Minamoto no Yochisune is viewed as a hero. He had a brother, right? I think his name was... Oh shit! You actually gotta remember this! It was this one! That's the one. Yochisune worked under Yoritomo, he did a lot for his brother, but they ended up coming into conflict. In the end, when they had to oppose each other... Um... Well, I mean, Yochisune died. I can't remember if Yoritomo won. Yeah, so I think he just won. Yochisune committed, Yochisune committed suicide after being exiled by his brother. Uh, but even though he lost, your student is the one who's going down in history as a hero. Probably because people tend to sympathize less with figures in power and sympathize more with... Uh... The weak? Not just any weak person, though. People love rooting for an underdog who stands up to powerful oppressors, and Yoshisune did that to his brother. So the reason Yoshisune is, is treated as a hero is because he stood up against the powerful Yoritomo. Yep. He finished in time. If only writing an essay was that easy, like in real life. Oh no, people are uh, believing in us less. Let's get started. Today's the second day of exams. Oh, we just missed the day. Which brain function is responsible for the phenomenon of seeing an illusion in this figure? Uh, cognition. Which of the following maps can you paint without any adjacent areas being the same color? Wait, what? Which of the following maps can you paint without any adjacent areas being the same color? What does that actually mean? Yeah, it's like, is that like, I mean, if it's just like a map of like, like, is that just like, what? what is a map? Like, blue water, green land. The color 
theory thing. Oh, okay, right. Ooh, we can do this! That's why you should have studied. Hadman has to be trolling, says the fan site. <laughs> okay, class, let's get started. Another day. Name the book that defined a malefactor as the chief factor in the progress of the human race. Um, that was the Devil's Dictionary. Ooh, we can do this! What character and archetype refers to a mysterious and seductive woman typically with ulterior motives? That is a femme fatale. Ooh, we can do this! It's just go over, like, the classes, basically. made this site ridiculous. The thieves should be arrested. People are losing fate in us because of exams. <laughs> a school-wide assembly at this time of year, really? I think we can bring our flashcards in. Kamashita is just one of many things wrong with this school. Gotta hurry home and study. Kamashita is still causing us trouble even when he's gone. Ever since that specific incident, Many of you have voiced concerns that I could not bear to ignore. He reminds me of Mr. Tato. That's who I was thinking of in, like, Irish media. If you slap, like, a hat on him, he's got, like, kind of, like, the face shape. <laughs> With the suit, yeah. We believe the mental health of our students is absolutely vital, so we've acquired the services of a therapist. The floor is yours, Doctor. Oh, we have a new staff member. Whoa. Isn't he hot? <laughs> <laughs> it's nice to meet you all. Male teacher with glasses. Whoa, his voice is sexy. My name is... Huh? Oh. It's Scott the Wasp. My name is Takato Maruki. <laughs> I kind of see it. Hey, y'all. Uh, Takato Mar Maruki here. <laughs> Thank you for welcoming me to your school. Oh, no. Seems kind of confused. Yo, you ever expect this place to actually give a shit about our mental health? I mean, where do you expect them to, Ryuji? Society as a whole seems to just ignore it. It's quite shocking to see this special interest or care. Well, our schools made national news. Maybe they figured they'd look even worse if they didn't do anything for us. And Dr. uh, Dr. what's his name? Maruki. Yeah, wasn't that guy just basically clowning it up on stage? You really think he'll do us any good? Ryuji. Hey He's there. right here. <laughs> Sakamoto-kun and Takamaki-san, right? And that must make you... Anime-kun. How do you know our names? Well, I was informed of certain students before beginning my tenure here. Those that had, uh, previous interactions with Mr. Kamoshida. It must have been especially tough for you after having just transferred here. I think I'd end up in a castle. He's <laughs> gonna have no fucking clue. Uh, yeah, it was. I can definitely believe that. So, what do you want with us? Ah, yes. I'd forgotten. I know I already offered my services to the student body earlier, but would you three be interested in counseling? Nope, not at all. Nope. <laughs> huh? The healthy male mindset. How's that surprising? You were just a touch more emphatic about it than I'd expected. Ah, but if you come to my office, you can have free snacks. All you can eat. Would be nice, but there's still plenty to be had. So, 
How about it? It's like, you can have a lollipop. Tell me more of these snacks. <laughs> hey, don't fall for that. To be frank, I've been explicitly ordered to provide counseling to the students directly involved with Mr. Kamoshida. Yeah, she seems chill, yeah. It's in the school's interest. For its students. Ah, the school's interest, huh? I know that asking you to be open with a complete stranger like myself is a lot. Making this mandatory wouldn't do you any good either. Might as well turn it into a worthwhile experience. Ooh, I know. Oh. If you attend my counseling sessions, I'll teach you different ways to improve your mental acuity. That seems good, considering this is like Inception anime game. Like ways to hone your concentration before exams or not getting nervous on dates. Oh wait, but fun bit of trivia because I know my anime, because Inception was inspired by an anime. It's more accurate to call this a paprika game. Your dad's hip and knows his culture. <laughs> wait, was it? Yes, it actually was. Uh, Inception is inspired by an animated film. Uh, it's called Paprika. It's why I believe that's why it's a female lead in Inception. It's because of that film. Oh no, Dad is ancient. Paprika is a really good film too. Would recommend. How's that sound? Uh. Mental training. We could use this. It may aid in our fan of these activities too. There's also snacks. <laughs> the snacks may aid in our activities as well. All right, all right. Enough with the snacks. So, which way are you leaning? I'm gonna do it. I want those <sighs> snacks. I guess it'd just be more trouble for us if we didn't go. Hmm. Yeah. Really? Then I guess it's a deal. I'll be in the nurse's office. Feel free to come by whenever it's convenient for you. Let's well, go. We should get going. Okay, I'll see you later. Damn it, he knows I'm gonna come for those snacks. Thanks for taking my counseling into consideration. Snack now that we have a deal. I promise I'll do my best to help you. You got the snack, confidant. Sai slams the table. You must have had access to snacks. Some of those meetings were very lengthy. You would have needed refreshments to be able to continue them it's hard so long. I believe an ordinary high school student could accomplish such grandiose heists. One would need a heart of steel, unaffected by outside influences, and prepared to act without hesitating. So, of course, you didn't leave the meeting, you brought refreshments. There has to be someone who helped strengthen your mental state. Sound like somebody you know? Give me a name. You must have had food. <laughs> I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. So we got coffee dad it and snack dog. The wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains or doc snack. I like Doc With Snack. It sounds like Dr. Ock. Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing. Snack Daddy. No, not that. A new power. Snack Doc. Doc Snack. Ice cream is here. Okay, uh... Consultant, confidant, mechanic, counselor. All right. Using personas of the counselor are con wait oh the con counselor is a type of persona now okay that's a bit of an odd one. So hold up, dude. Counselor persona. Okay. Sorry for keeping you like this. Well then. Call him Snunkle, the snack uncle. <laughs> okay, quiet down. <gasps> no, Doc Snack. That's Doc Snack. Not the Snunkle. The Snackle. <laughs> okay, alright. No, we could do the Snackle. The Snackle. Snunkle. No, Snunkle. Snunkle's not right. No, Snackle. 
Dr. Snackle. I have an addendum to the earlier assembly regarding the counseling you've all been offered. The counselor will be available to you starting after school today in the nurse's office. Tamaraki will only be posted here through November, so be sure to speak with him soon if you feel the need. The majority of you, it's your choice whether or not you see him. But there are a few students I'll speak with later. Oh, that, that's interesting. They're putting like a hard time limit on that one. He's here till November. It's May at the moment. So you want to level that one, because that's actually going to like hard end. It's still seven months. Yeah, it's like, it's a lot of time. So like, I'm not really worried. Visits to Dr. Maruki will be mandatory for these individuals. Are you guys going to go for it? What, the counseling? Kind of sounds like we're being forced to tell Maruki I'd do it, but I don't know if I'm really into that idea, you know? Let's do it. Yeah, probably better not to draw more attention to ourselves anyway. I'm going to go try going today. <sighs> counseling, eh? Lady Anne's right. Make sure you visit him so you don't draw any attention to yourself, okay? Gotta go say hey to Dr. Snackle. Gotta get maximum snacks. Yes. <sighs> Welcome. And you're here for a counseling session. Yeah, it's now a bad time? <laughs> not at all. It's always a good time, as so long as I'm not already listening to a student. I'm so glad you're here. Would you care for a snack? Well... Shall we, we get begin? started? Okay, but first, try to relax, all right? I'm only here to listen to whatever you wish to talk about. Yes. Sure. Although I really only have one thing on my mind right now, anyway. Hmm. Yeah, I said it makes perfect sense. Don't force force yourself into talking with me. You could even just grab some snacks and be on your way if you want it. Did I mention snacks? No, it's all right. I know. I know I need to talk to someone about this anyway. He has a juice box on the table. He's got juice. Be willing to listen to the super long story. Absolutely am. Take all the time you need. <sighs> the jungle? <laughs> no, it's Dr. Snackle. It's Dr. Snackle. Dr. Snack Uncle. You see, it's such a horrible thing to do to someone. <sighs> so I wanted to get to get even with him. Uh for Shio. And? <sighs> First, I thought Kamashita ought to face the same fate Shio was going to put herself through. But, but, later I realized that wasn't right. If he did take his own life, it wouldn't undo Shio's suffering. In fact, it'd just give him an easy way out. Right. Is that so? You know, you're quite the wise level headed young woman, Kamakisan. Takamaki-san. I think you're just, you've got the wrong. No, in fact, I think you're wiser than I was at your age. I wasn't anywhere near as mature as you are now. I did anything special, though. I hadn't gone through my own share of hell. I don't think I'd be so mature either. See, so what's on your mind now? Hmm, right now. Let me hmm. think. Just hoping Shio will get better quickly. We both suffered a lot, but I just want to get back to laughing and having fun together like we used to. At this point, I don't give a rat's ass about Kamashita. Yeah. There's a healthy outlook. You can't change the past, but you still want to keep your chin up and press armor. Is that the gist of it? Yeah, that sounds about right. I mean, it'd definitely be better if none of this had happened at all, but... Quite. I definitely agree with you there. But it's impossible to wipe every tragedy from history. Yeah! If only, right? Everyone would be so much happier if we could actually do that. Oh, it seems I lost track of the time. We should wrap things up here for t up here for today. Thank you so much for coming to see me. Oh, thank you. I feel a ton better now that it's off all off my chest. Be careful, okay? Good to hear it. You deserve it. Feel free to stop by any time. Okay, I'm we'll do. Gonna get See going. you around. Well, I went in for counseling. You're you're going soon too, right, Johnny? How'd it go? Well, it honestly, wasn't as rough as I was expecting. I think you should just go and give it a shot. Dr. Mark is easier to talk to than you think. Okay, see you tomorrow. Hmm. Then you have a counseling appointment. That's in the nurse's office in the practice building, right? I'll just pass time in the area until you're done. Oh, it's okay, so we're just going, like, right away. How are you? Oh, it's her. I haven't seen her in a while. I hear her for a session as well. You too, huh? Yes. Yes, that's right. Dr. Maruki is a wonderful counselor. 
actually been seeing him for a while before he ever came to Shujin. Uh? Well, I didn't know you two were acquainted. Don't go overselling me too hard, though, uh, Yoshizawa-san. I'm really nothing special. <laughs> well, I need to get going. Please excuse me. All she right just then. pops into the story every now and then, doesn't she? It's like, she appeared in, like, the present day, but, like, we're just not quite there yet. Let's say we get started. Welcome. Thank you for coming. Okay, so we made a deal, didn't have much choice. So it's a confidant again. So we gotta play the confidant game. We wanna get the max amount of points that we can. I think probably being honest is probably best here. It seems comes across as too cold. <laughs> you don't have to be so tense, we're just gonna have an ordinary conversation, that's all. I see. Thank you, I think I've gotten a good grasp of the situation you're in, Anime Kun. But full disclosure, the school gave me a brief rundown of the circumstances surrounding your transfer. It's in the past, I'm doing okay now, so much for my privacy. Not that one. That might be repressing it. Two might be the most important one. I'm doing okay. But you weren't before, I take it. You're trying to push yourself too hard, okay? No, I didn't get anything so... for that. Now that you've told me more about yourself, I think I've realized something. It seems that you've largely been able to reconcile your internal world with your external one. I should note, that's really, truly impressive. Even most adults can't reliably manage that. How to put it, you know how everyone has an internal reality? Some conception of themselves to strive for. For example. Like wanting to be a model student, or wanting to be loved and relied on, that kind of thing. But that idealized reality and the one in actuality are often far apart. That gap is responsible for a lot of people's pain. Not everyone can ace their exams, and not everyone can be the heroes they wish they could be. Hmm. You've already been through so much. This kind of suffering is usually enough to twist people up into dark places. But you, you're standing up to it, confronting a tough, painful reality. To me, that's incredibly admirable. And again, maybe that's a little weird for you to hear from a guy you just met, huh? Kinda creeping me out. Ah, <laughs> uh, but it sounds right. <laughs> Not, not even any deflecting self-depreciation. You really are a strong anime cunt. I'm sorry. Let's see. Sorry just went on longer than I expected. Somehow this conversation just took on a life of its own, I guess. Uh, Say. Hey, I've actually got one last request. Do you mind? You know, I... I'm actually doing certain research along with my duties as a counselor. It's not quite like counseling, more like a type of psychological treatment. Basically, it's a project to learn more about people's metaphorical hearts. What they think, how they feel. How about it? If I get far enough with it, I think it'll be able, I'll be able to help. It'll be able to help a lot of people. So, mm, not that. Probably I'll just need more details. Uh, sorry. Oh, sorry. I guess my point is I like to ask you to help with that research. All you have to do is listen to my theories and then tell me if they spark any ideas or realizations in your end. Please, any time's good for me. I can work around your schedule. I've got a lot of snacks too. You can have them, they're yours. Better make it word it? No, too cold. Well, okay, or why me though? He's got snacks. What are we thinking? Why me though, yeah. To be honest, sometimes I hit a wall in my research. I've been working on it alone, but some second opinions from a perspective like yours could really push it forward. Oh, and don't worry, I promise I'll repay you for it. Well... Let's see, I know. Maybe you I could teach you some tips for mental training. I happen to know a lot on the subject. I'm sure I can cook up a special regimen for you. If you're dedicated enough... Well, regime, sorry. Uh, if you're dedicated enough, I'm sure you could draw out your full potential. Thank you. Okay, I guess that's our second deal. Look, my bond with uh, Maruki is growing deeper. Oh, that's just straight up a rank 2, then. When Joker is inflicted with an ailment, he may recover immediately. That's actually quite an active ability for combat. Holy shit, that's actually pretty good. Yeah, compared to, like, some of the, the ranks that we've gotten where it's like, Dad's gonna teach you to make coffee. That's an active one in combat. That's actually really fucking good. All right. We probably want to level him up more, yeah. I know. It'll be okay if we try to contact information. Contact you when I've got time. Or when I need some input from you. 
to do it. Now. Now I better do my part to repay you. Let's talk about mental training and presence. Let's see, first off. Thanks to Maruki's mental training, my mind feels stronger. Alright. Holy shit, that's good. Is he gonna give that to me every time I come? Yes, he will. Holy shit, that's good. You get SP each time you rank up. Oh yeah, we're getting him the max. That's actually so good. That's such a huge stat increase. And like, that's actually like a really useful ability too. These are some powerful snacks. Snackle is quite incredible. Non-static gum. Okay, we get an item well, too. See you. Thank you for your help today. I'll see you around at school. We really spent a long time talking to Maruki. Look how late it is. Well, if you think the sessions are worthwhile, you should try going again sometime. Good night. But we should definitely get some sleep for now. Tomorrow's your last day of exams, right? Uh, I gotta hop out again. Let's go to bed. Oh, but I'm kinda why? Let me live my life. Damn cat! Oh, Sue! <laughs> Nice. Okay, um, I got another DVD I can watch. We're kind of running low on DVDs, though. No, you should rest up for tomorrow. He's not even... Oh, hey. my... God. Let me do something. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I just critique the room, sure. I can sit on the sofa. You should rest for tomorrow. Okay. Real quick, I want to check a counselor. Next rank, flow. Chance to receive the effects of charge and concentrate at the start of the bottle. I don't even know what that does, but that sounds like just a buff. That just sounds like a straight buff at the start of battle. Yeah, like, like this guy seems incredible. We're going to have to rank him up. Let's see what other ones uh, there are that we're working towards. Next is rank 5. Increase your persona stock to 10. Cool. Follow-up one. LeBlanc Curry we saw. A negotiation with a female shadow fails. You can try again. Harrison recovery. Chance to cure status ailments inflicted upon party members. That's off. That's like, um... That's the ability I just got for myself. Yeah, that's actually so good. So Ryuji's gonna give me that as well for the party. That's so good. Yeah, Ryuji and the doctor are like in the lead at the moment. Sterilization adds more healing items. I do need to level up to Kemi just because I want better heals. Oh, increase XP. Oh, we there's so many good abilities. I think we need to get that first. Because that has the longest effect. Yeah, everyone is so useful right now. I think that one's first, because that has the best long-term benefit. I think we still gotta, like, level up Ryuji, too. We should probably wanna... That's such an active ability. Yeah, so it's Mishima, uh, Maruki, and then, uh, Ryuji. There's some really good abilities here. Uh, I need to get a Persona as well for the Counselor. I'll save it as well. Yeah, I haven't saved it in a while. There we go. Got a week past the gameplay. We've been streaming three hours. Poor aunt. We're never gonna see her. We're never gonna see her. <laughs> so sleepy. Exams are done, I think. I ended up pulling an all-nighter once I realized today's the last day of exams. Oh, never mind. One more. <laughs> Staying up studying? Nah, I gave up on the exam. I was playing some games, and then before I knew it, it was morning. That's a mood right there. <laughs> I know that feeling. Oh, you, you say that, but you probably just spent the whole night studying. Actually, I was in therapy, Ryuji. Uh, morning. Yo, look who else is yawning. Exams are almost over, so I thought I'd make one last effort across the finish line. Just 
One moment, gang. I'm just gonna quickly flick on a light because it's starting to get a bit dark here. Where did we go? Oh no, he left us again. Panic. Chair, chair. Can I take a sip of my water too? How y'all doing? We're still gonna be going a while tonight. I kind of just want to go to like at least 11 or something. I want to just keep pressing off the game. I'm having a lot of fun. Y'all doing good? How are you with the game? I'm having a great time. I'm, I'm hugely enjoying it. The worst part is Morgana. <laughs> hate them. But having a good time. Common complaint. Yeah, I I, I, I guessed as much. Like Morgana's like just kinda making it like Cool anime! Pretty lady! That's right, I transform. And it's just like, no, please. <laughs> like, spare us. You should sleep. Yeah, Morgana just forces you to bed half the time, too, which is annoying. I just want to go outside. Okay, let's keep going. <gasps> Impressive, Lady On. You're quite different from the stupid monkey like, I know. This damn cat. Huh? Don't give me that crap. Your brain's tiny compared to mine. Size is meaningless if there's nothing inside, you know. What was that? What's going on? Will you please shut up? You're gonna make me forget everything I remember. Huh? Study. Am I imagining things? You need the bathroom. <laughs> Why is that even an option here? Huh? Uh, no! What? You see a groper or something? Oh no. No! That's not it. It's... Nothing. Hmm? Oh, we're anime now. Oh my god! That guy got off! This bad. <laughs> hey, at least act like you care. <sighs> Fine. Come on. Huh? No. Uh. Uh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh, hmm. Hey, uh, are you sure it's him, or are you just that self conscious? I'm not that. Is there something you want? <laughs> That's my line. You are the one stalking me. Stalking you? That's outrageous. I know you've been following me ever since the train! That's because. Huh? Oh? My goodness. I had wondered why you left the car, so this is where your passion led. All is well that ends well. <laughs> Something about our villains appearing in cars. <laughs> I saw you from the car, and I couldn't help myself <laughs> from chasing after you. <laughs> okay. G good opening. <laughs> I didn't even notice the calls from Sensei, but thank goodness I caught up to you. Okay. What? You're the woman I've been searching for all this time. 
Please, won't you? Unforeseen boy might be a Redditor too. <laughs> Wait a minute, I... Be the model for my next art piece. M model? Oh no. All that I've drawn till now has been lacking, but I feel a passion from you unlike anyone else. This man's highly suspicious! Ain't this a recruit for some shady business? Oh no, it's an Instagrammer. <laughs> Will you cooperate with me? What do you say? <laughs> Hold your horses. Who are you anyways? Oh, where are my manners? I'm a second year at Kosei High's Fine Arts Division. My name is Yusuke Kitagawa. Yusuke. I'm Motorame Sensei's <laughs> pupil, and I am being allowed residence at his place. I'm striving to become an artist. Huh? Do you mean that, Motorame? The one who was on Good Morning Japan the other day? The very same. You know who that is? He was introduced as a super famous Japanese style artist who's been recognized all over the world. And he's evil. Uh, but we heard that name the other day in Mementos. Yusuke! I'm sorry, Sensei. I'll be right there. That old guy's Matarame? Matarame Sensei's exhibition will begin at the department store near the station tomorrow. I'll be there to help out on opening day. Please come by. It'd be great if you could give me your answer in regard to being a model then. Oh no. I bet you have no interest in the fine arts, but I'll give you tickets too. So condescending. Well then, I hope to see you there tomorrow. <laughs> that guy's as easy to read as a book. You're not planning on going, are ya? I think I will. So I've made up my mind from the creep. Crap, but look at the time. I'll see you later. <laughs> I'm surprised Aunt's going ahead with it. It's like, well, he did chase me from the car and stalk me. But... Made a compelling offer. How dare he go after Lady On? Oh no. I've memorized that face of yours, Yusuke. It's like so Sai slaps the table. It's like, and that's when you killed your cat. <laughs> you became acquainted with Madarame's pupil by chance? That's a little too convenient. It makes me wonder if you're even telling the truth. So be it. What I want to know most is your method. It's true that Madarame was an unforgivable criminal worthy of the scorn thrown at him. Okay, yeah, no, he's definitely evil then. He was an adult who cultivated his own fame and fortune by sacrificing the livelihood of children. But he'd been covering his tracks for years. How did you uncover the truth in such a short span of time? It's all in the metaverse, so I... This metaverse business again? <sighs> this is what talking to Mark Zuckerberg's like. Fine. Let's suppose that people's hearts can be changed by stealing their treasure, like you've said. If so, a different suspicion arises. People have gone mad or lost consciousness never to recover, like the subway accident in April. Depending on how you look at it, that could be taken as a phenomenon for a sudden change of heart too. Were you related to those as well? Um, I don't want to say I don't. We didn't cause the subway accident. Hmm. We I didn't see. cause the subway accident. Yeah, that wasn't us. Fine. Let's get back to Madarame's case. Keep it concise and stick to the facts. Sorry, that's too many spoilers. <laughs> It's like, Jesus, yeah, you ruined the entire game. Because some of those were kind of tough. Yep. It's too bad you should have gotten a decent score, right? Oh, exams are over. Belief in the Phantom Thieves is dropping. Ugh, quit with the rumors. Play too many games. I've been waiting for this. Yeah, right, lol. <laughs> Are you gonna go in for counseling? I saw the volleyball guys getting called in. 
Shit, I got that question wrong. I know how I feel like I have to protect that teacher. It's over. It's over. How about you? It's over. Feeling I I'm feeling pretty good. I studied at least four times. You traitor! Oh no. Anyways, can we stop talking about the exams? Like it or not, they're gonna come back graded next week. Rather than focus on stuff that's over with. What are you looking at? The usual site. It's no use. There ain't any useful info. The number of posts are getting less and less too. The new video is not getting as many likes as the old one. This TikTok isn't going viral anymore. Gonna need another hit like uh, Kamoshida. I am not letting this end as a one-hit wonder, okay? There's no point in getting antsy, though. The algorithm's just against us. We have to accept this. I know. Why don't we go eat lunch somewhere? We still have some money left over from the other day. I want sushi then, or domestic raised eel. Very specific, but okay. We don't have that much left. Oh, right. There are those tickets to Matarame's exhibit. Wait, that's tomorrow. Wh why would you go? Don't tell me. Was it love at first sight with that Yusuke guy? More kind of, please. It's not like that. Oh, of course not. When I was watching that special on TV, his artwork was pretty nice. Plus, we've got free tickets. Besides, this could also be related to what we heard in Mementos. Matarame, was it? I mean, we know he's evil. So we gotta go do it. Gotta mm. go do it. That aside, what should I do about the other two tickets? Wanna go appreciate some fine arts for once? <laughs> fine arts, huh? I suggest we should all go together. Appreciating the fine arts builds character. A phantom thief who can't identify an original is lame. Well, if everyone's going... Let's look at our... It's settled, then. It's gonna be boring. It's like, you paint and smelly. I'm a gamer. Just the phrase, going to an art exhibit, sounds kind of mature. Let's meet at the exhibit entrance tomorrow. Rip Sunday. Oh, okay. no. Yeah. Can't afford to be late tomorrow. We better not go out right now. No, you damn cat. <laughs> I keep thinking about what uh, uh, Nakano Hara said. Uh, could have been talking about the famous artist uh, Madarame. Sounds about right. Second it. Right, the name really stood out to me. Yeah, I mean, have you guys ever heard of someone else called a Matarame? It's really not common at all. What we heard is true. Uh, Hishigawa-kun is studying under a corrupt teacher. I mean, a teacher who treats people like fools. Hishigawa-kun's life is probably pretty terrible. You gotta look into this. Let me go out. Let me go out. Let me leave the shop. God damn it, Morgana. Let me live my life. Damn cat. I'll sue. Okay, uh, well, what do we fancy doing then? We only have one DVD left, so I'm not sure if we should use that yet. Just in case we get, like, trapped in our room at some point. Uh, Dad's here, so we could spend some time with him. We could just make some coffee. Hey. There's coffee. We never. Hey. We never cleaned up before, did we? We never cleaned up. Yeah. Let's just see what that does. It said it would give us some kindness. Let's see how much. Yeah. I time to do some work for the chief. I'm sure he'll appreciate it. Well, then. You want to start cleaning now? Your kindness may improve a bit. Let's begin. Oh. Well, I'd certainly appreciate that. Yeah, you got a point with him. I'm going home now. Don't break anything in the store. Got it. Mm. Man, this store's pretty old. Sure you shouldn't clean your room. 
guess you could call this retro antique. It's nice in its own way. That should do it for now. All right, all clean. But the chief is gonna be happy with this. Thinking about the customers and cleaning the store probably helped increase your kindness, no? LeBlanc buffer. Go. Oh. Hey. That took longer than I expected. We should probably go to bed once we once we clean up the rest. I only gave one point of kindness. That wasn't too good. I guess the main reason you do that is if he's there, you get a point with him too. Yeah, it's not great, but at least we tried it. What's this line for? Oh, the exhi exhibition must be opening today. It's really packed. Want to come back another time? I want it, but it's so pricey. I should, I should take out a loan. I want to see that. Let's go together sometime. It's raining. We gotta get out of this art exhibit and study. It's so crowded. It'll be a pain in the ass if someone sees you, so don't stick your head out too much, all right? You came. Here he is. Um, yeah. So excited. You really came. <laughs> Not so excited. What'd you expect when you left us those tickets? Make sure that you don't get in the way of the other visitors. Jesus Come Christ. On. I'll show you around. I'd like to speak more about the picture I'd like to draw, too. Well, see you guys later. There they go. Will Leon be all right? What if he drags her behind some painting and tries something funny? Can we just close the bag? I told you not to come out. Are we really gonna appreciate the fine arts? Can't we just go home? Um, let's learn about Madarame. I guess we should do a quick pass through at once. Uh, which way are we supposed to start? He wants to make an NFT. <laughs> it's the next stage of Arton. My master doesn't understand it. We're going to sell the copies of the paintings online. We'll make a fortune on. <laughs> it's that old man from the other day. We continue to be truly surprised by your imagination. You have such expansive styles. It's hard to believe that it all stems from one person. Where in the world does all your inspiration come Probably from? Probably like stealing people's paintings or something. Well, it is rather difficult to put into words. They naturally well up from within my heart, like bubbles rising one after another in the spring. Naturally, you say. He's an asshole. What's important is to distance oneself from worldly desires, such as money and fame. My atelier is a modest shack, but it is more than enough to pursue true beauty. A shack? I see. So the act of emptying one's mind gives rise to inner beauty. Still, to think we could hear the word shack coming from the great artist Madarame. Wow, what a word. You would understand if you saw it. <laughs> Wasn't the word shack something? Madarame-san is actually here? Over there! Excited customer. I'm so glad I came on opening day. Wow. Hey, okay, stop pushing. There's way too many people. I'm getting crushed. Wait, let's stay here a little longer, Ryuji. Anyways, we gotta head for the exit. Don't die on us, all right? I didn't know there were so many types of Japanese art. Usually, one concentrates on their own style. However, Sensei creates all this by himself. He's special. I somehow doubt it. <laughs> there you are, Yusuke. Sensei. Ah, the girl from yesterday. Are you enjoying the exhibit? I don't know how to put it into words, but it's really amazing. You're sensing something from the artwork. That alone is enough to give us artists satisfaction. I hope this becomes a wonderful piece, Yusuke. Well then, if you'll excuse me. You'd imagine artists would be difficult to approach, but he seems really friendly. It's because he's evil. Indeed. Oh, this is it. The painting I wanted to see in person. This one? I guess it's the painter's anger? I'm not sure, but I sense this 
Just to think such a cheerful and gentlemanly person could make such a piece. <laughs> Something wrong? Don't mind me. There are better pieces than this one. Come now, this way. H hey! Got what? Real question is when can we study? Oh, lady totally elbowed me. Thanks to that, I remember now. About what? Well, let me get to it. It's about a post online. Here, look at this. I've been on R slash conspiracy lately. Something not quite right. Why'd you leave without me? You got it all wrong. We got dragged into this huge crowd and... Eh, anyways, you gotta look at this too. This post might be about Madarame. What's it say? A master of the Japanese arts is plagiarizing his pupil's work. Only his public face is shown on TV. Oh. Plagiarizing? I didn't think much of it when I first saw it, but hearing Shaq and Madarame triggered it. His treatment of the pupils who live with him is awful. He teaches nothing and bosses them around. He treats them inhumanely, as if disciplining a dog. We got a leaker. Abuse on top of plagiarism, hmm? Mm -hmm. If this is real, it'll be a huge scandal. I wonder if Kitagawa-kun posted this. I mean, he is a pupil of his. Who knows? It's anonymous and all. People are just still saying, like, Shaq! <laughs> My god, Shaq worked under him! In that case, it's possible the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is referring to the same one. A man like that doing such a thing? He stole my NFT. <laughs> he took my uh, he took my picture. I wonder if we can ask that shadow from earlier about this. All of my apes are gone. <laughs> No! He funged my token. Oh, actually, we just need to talk to him in reality. And how are we gonna go about that? Are we gonna explain it all, starting with mementos? Besides, if we make a move out in the open, there's the possibility that Madarame will find out. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this guy's right. gotta be stopped. Hey, what do you think about Madarame? Doesn't he seem suspicious? It wouldn't stop going on about cryptocurrency being in the future. Something about the metaverse in there too, and blockchain. I know, right? This all fits way too well to just be a coincidence. If this post is legit, ain't this the kind of target we've been waiting for? Well, yeah, but is it really true? By the way, what did you do about the whole modeling thing? Kitago Akun gave me his contact info. And the address to his sensei's atelier. He said he lives there, right? Perfect timing. Let's try going tomorrow. We're off to Madarame's house right after school. Yeah, we kind of need to do like a house call or a check or something before we decide. Like, yeah, we're going to like break into your mind palace and kill yourself. Huh? You want me to model tomorrow? This is too sudden. Yeah, it's Tuesday, Ryuji. We got to stay focused here. What? We're just going to go talk to Kitagawa. Oh, the lotto. The lotto results are today. That's what you meant. Okay. Okay, Morgana, you better let me leave the house tonight. We need to find out if that rumor about Madarame is true. If it is, we, this might just be exactly what we needed. Well then. That reminds me, the Home Shopping Channel program is airing today. You want to check out the TV? Please let me leave. Please let me leave. Please let me leave. Please let me leave. Please let me. Hey. How am I supposed to get my bat juice lotto in now? God damn it, Morgana. I can't get my bat juice lotto.
damn cat. <laughs> oh, there's an allergy relief pack. Nice. Cosmetic cure pack. Okay, so one of them is just gift items. Hey, hey. Oh my god, it's... That's so much money. Holy shit. It's 15,000 yen. No, like, no fucking way. That's so expensive. That's probably... Those items weren't that expensive in the shop. That's, like, more money. That's marked up. Yeah, buy the allergy relief. Well then. Not buying that. No, I, that that looked like way more expensive. Pull them together at 20k. Ah, even then. Coffee dad is a compliment. Oh, I didn't know you could use that in the world here. That's cool. Okay, uh, we got, like, a charm, didn't we? Not the breeze ring. Light bonus. I thought I got something else. Second mate badge. Oh, it, it, yeah, it's these. Sorry, they weren't equipped. Cost one to latch onto things. A life bonus. Is that any bad? Those are the same rank, aren't they? Brad ring and the second mate badge. Oh, okay, you get the details there. Cheers. Yeah, okay, so we don't need the... Uh... I mean, this, this isn't doing anything. Does Ahn have anything? Honest sums. Okay, so Morgana, you're gonna get the second mate badge. Give the allergy stuff to on. Oh, I did have the allergy stuff, didn't I? Where is it? Attachment proof? I thought it was an accessory. Oh yeah, I just bought it. Yeah, it hasn't showed up yet. Yeah, you're right. Now listen up. Okay, uh, we can get confidant points up with coffee, Dad, if we want. We can make some coffee. Uh, we can't leave. Hey. I'm just gonna think a moment. Let's have a relax. While, uh, let's just have a big think while we poop. We're getting somewhat close to improving knowledge. Somewhat close, somewhat close, somewhat close. Kindness is gonna need a lot more. Okay, I might as well make some coffee. With, uh, with, uh, coffee dad. Is there anything in the fridge? Mm. Nothing in the fridge. Yeah, if I do this, then at least I get a confidant point with that. Hey. And it, it it's also very practical. Oh. Oh wait, could I make curry? I... No, no, I need to be ranked four. I can't make curry yet. Sorry. Yeah, I can't make curry yet. Yes! All right. Let's get some coffee in. Get a bit of charm. We get two coffees we can use, and we get, like, a, uh, a point with that. <laughs> That's all pretty good. Mm. Colombian... Narino, is it? Let me explain. The high altitude, rainy climate, and soil of the Colombian mountains creates a strong foundation for the high quality coffee. Uh, Narino coffee has a creamy, vi vi viscous body that coats the mouth with fruity and nutty flavor. <laughs> so immature. I feel like I should be reading these with, like a different voice or something, especially when it's the coffee trivia, because it's like an advertisement, isn't it?
Hang on, let me see if, let me see if I still got it. Narino coffee, I see. Creamy, viscous body that coats them out with fruity and nutty flavors. Yeah, there we go. We can get some, we get some uh, gato in there. <sighs> Flavor profile is bland. You should practice more to bring out the roast full potential. Although, I see you preparing the cup the way I th thought you. I'll acknowledge your hard work. <clears throat> Still have a lot to learn in coffee and in life. Be patient. Again, in case people are wondering, like, why isn't he doing voice action for most of the dialogue? It's because all these characters have voices. So it's just kind of jarring to give them two voices. That's why I'm just kind of mostly reading it when it's not voiced. But, coffee profile? Yeah, we can do that. Narinho. Is it? Narinho. Thank you. Okay, let's get started. Hey there, I'm Dr. Maruki, your school counselor. Thanks to the school, I can even talk to you outside of counseling now. I want to talk a little about how mental health and perception can affect you. Don't worry, I don't want to stress you out or anything. Just relax and listen. How much do you guys know about the emotional mind? So... See, what's going on in your mind can affect your body pretty significantly. It's proof it can even heal you depending on your outlook. So, anime come. Any ideas? Dr. Snack. What do we call the phenomenon where believing in a treatment's power is enough uh, to improve your condition? Uh, that is the placebo effect. This is it. That's right. Correct. Some people specify that placebos don't actually have any curative properties. But even if the medicine does nothing chemically, it can affect your perception and help you feel better. On the other hand, if you don't trust the medicine to begin with, it might make you feel even worse. We call that a nocebo. <laughs> Didn't know that. That's funny. A nocebo. <laughs> Wow, you must be smart. Knowledge is increasing. That's just one example, but my point is that our minds and bodies are more connected than we think. So it's important not to push yourself too hard. Remember, your mind needs time to rest too. It's my job to come help with that, so come by the nurse's office whenever you're feeling down. Mind affects the body, huh? I think it'll, I'll change back into a human if I just believe in it hard enough. No, because you're a cat, Morgana. Okay, the Matarame exhibit is great, you gotta go see it. I'm feeling pretty down lately, maybe I should go I should go to counseling. Never knew that art could be so explosive. Have you been to counseling yet? Counseling is like a hot topic here. They've all heard about the snacks. Phantom thieves going by train. <laughs> This ain't any different from how I get home from school, you know. Do you want, like, a fucking limo, Ryuji? The train is the fastest way to go. Plus, we can bring pets on here. Hey, who are you calling a pet? Dude, be quiet! We didn't pay the pet fare. There's no such thing. I'm the one guiding you to your destination. You should be calling me Master. Oh, kitty! Uh, shoot. Is that your pet, mister? I heard it meowing. Innocent girl. It's a stuffed animal. <laughs> You're imagining things. But I see its head popping out of your bag. Isn't that a kitty? It's a damn cat is what it is. It's, um, a toy. It meows when you press on its head. You heard her. Press on its head. This is ridiculous. Smack him in the face. That's so funny. I want to hear it again. Oh, I just threw open my mouth. <laughs> oh, my God, it's just getting fucking destroyed. Oh, seriously? The next stop is Shibuya. Shibuya. Doors will open on the left side. I'm surprised Ryuji didn't say for real there. Oh, this is our stop. Well, see you later. Bye-bye. <laughs> Someone says all caps LIBERAL DESTROYED and I, <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> How does that fit here at all? Like, what does that have to do with anything? <laughs> Yeah, get dunked on, liberal. Like, what? <laughs> I'm 
Sorry. Morgana is a Tory. <laughs> so, which line do we got to transfer to? Doesn't look like there are any stations close by to that address. If anything, this is the closest station. What? And we got to walk the rest of the way? What kind of phantom thief takes the train and then walks to their destination? Stop your complaining. It's I don't know why someone's just shack, screaming that. But it's just... This is the neighborhood he lives in. <laughs> so weird. As expected of a famous artist. Looks like the fastest route is to get to the station square and then go to Central Street. Let's move. Oh, we're somewhere completely new. Yeah. Look at this. Wait, no, are we? Station square, okay. No, not quite. Search for your next target. Oh, we can't get to Central Street. Sorry, we're just we're just walking. Okay, it's just Central. Street. I thought we were going somewhere different. Can you check the lotto? I might be able to when I hop down here. I'm hoping. Oh, quickly! Come on. I'm gonna buy some lottery tickets. No, Morgana, you're the worst. Ryuji gets it. He's encouraging me. Damn cat! Wish I could paint again. It's his fault I have to live such a shitty life. What do you mean it's got nothing to do? Oh no. This, yeah, this is about Arave. Hmm. Just to head towards his house uh, from the central street. Hey! It's just a smoking area in there. Come on, man. Central Street. Wait. Um. Supposed to be in a residential area past Central Street. We'll have to walk a bit though. Okay, let's get going. Suguru Kamashita, former Olympian, teacher at Shujin Academy. Oh. Reason for turning himself in is uh, a heavy conscience, huh? The human mind doesn't change that easily. Let alone their natural temperament. Everyone's taking this very seriously, like the fact that he confesses crimes. <sighs> Shujin Academy. Seems doubtful. Perhaps I'll have someone look into it. Just in case. Is that it? We're at the right address. It's totally not evil. <laughs> the door plate does say Matarame. Uh, you ring the bell. Me? The walls won't collapse when I do, will they? No one sneeze or we'll blow this house down, okay? Who is it? Sensei is currently. Um, it's Takamaki. I'll be right out. People really do live here. He's running. takamaki -san. You two are here as well? <laughs> hey. How's it going? Sorry, but uh, we ain't here to talk about the modeling thing. There's something we gotta ask you. Is it true Matarame's plagiarizing stuff? He's abusing people too, yeah? Ryuji, you're supposed to wait until we get inside the home before you ask all this. Are you serious? We read about it online. Thanks. So what's bonking uh, with Matarame? This? <laughs> what? Preposterous! Not only is the plagiarism impossible, but abuse? Your maniacal laugh is very reassuring. He welcomes pupils into his own home. This is no act of violence, it is charity. And I'm the one residing here and studying under him. I'm saying it's not true, so it's beyond doubt. You might be lying about it. That... that is utter rubbish. I had no family when Sensei took me in and raised me into what you see now. 
If you continue to ridicule the man I owe my life to, you will rue this day. Oh, Jesus. You really think that? Yusuke. Oh, he's here. What's the matter? I heard you yelling. We just think you're an imposter. And you steal like all your students' works. These people are slandering you with baseless rumors. Forgive them, Yusuke. They must have heard some bad rumors and came in worry for their friend's safety. And he knows it's true. <sighs> Understood, Sensei. Well, even I doubt that a cranky old man like myself could be liked by everyone. That's not what we meant. I'm sorry to have butt in on your conversation. However, I do have neighbors around. Won't you please keep it down? Now, if you'll excuse He's me. He's evil. <clears throat> that was discourteous of me. I'm sorry. I know. I think you'll be able to believe in Sensei if you saw that painting. It's his maiden work, as well as his most representative piece. It's titled Sayuri. Sayuri? This was the painting that inspired me to become an artist. It's so beautiful. He stole it. I don't know all this fine art stuff, but even I can tell that this is impressive. When I first saw you, I felt the same powerful emotion as when I saw this painting. <laughs> it's an NFT. <laughs> I felt the same powerful emotion when I first saw this ape. <laughs> Look at this one. AI generated. This one has a nice hat on it. <laughs> Me? I wish to pursue beauty like this. I'm going to mint this one. And I believe drawing you will be part of that pursuit. I implore you, seriously consider my offer. I'm sorry that you took the time to come all this way, but I must assist Sensei today. I hope that we can discuss this further another time. If you'll excuse me then. He's evil. Those two seem like nice guys, don't they? Maybe the Matarame we heard about in Mementos is a different person. Man, right when we thought we found a new target too. It's him. How's the Metanav? Oh. Hey, the app. Was it picking up our conversation? This display. It means that Matarame has a palace too, right? There we go. But why? Matarame, plagiarism, and then shack, huh? These seem to be the keywords. It's like just the shack in particular. Like, what's he got to do with it? For real, though, what the hell's going on? Concerned, for real. Does an old man like him really have a palace? No, no, because he's saying for real in all caps. It's lowercase for real. Lowercase for real. It was like, concern. For real. For real. What's going on there? Different caliber of for real. Yeah. We have the person's name and the location. All that's left is the what that Madarame mistakes the shack for to enter his palace. You mean, like how Kamoshida thought the school was his castle? That's right. Let's try saying some things. They can be random guesses. It's a bit sudden, though. Why don't we start with castle? No candidates found. Then, what about prison? No candidates found. Need the keyword. Ah, what a pain! Jail, a warehouse, and guidance counseling office. Might as well add farm. <laughs> He's just trying whatever he can. No a single hit? Should we come back another time? A building that's related to artists. If we think from there, what would it be? NFT! That's the word! <laughs> uh, art school museum? There we go. Beginning navigation? Whoa, really? Try another word, Ryuji. Blockchain. Hey, when did you activate the nav? 
He surprised me. Didn't have much of a choice. I think we just happened to get it right. What if I hadn't noticed and then wandered off and got caught by an enemy? Probably would have figured it out once he started walking on two legs. It's got you there. So even you can slip into the metaverse without realizing it, Morgana? Yes. In a place with minimal cognitive distortion, the differences can be subtle. Forget that. Look. Scott. That shack Hell of a is house. seriously some kind of museum. Did he say museum? Let's go check it out. Museum. No, he didn't. Yeah. He said it right. Sorry. It sounded weird to me. Yeah. So extravagant. To the point You can check the log. Oh no, what? Yeah. Hang on. Log. No, it's gone. Okay. It's a museum, right? This is Matarame's? Well, a palace is a world formed by a mind twisted by desire. Matarame's artwork is on display at museums in reality too, though. Just give me one second, gang. Hang on. Just gotta check one thing. God. Chair, chair, chair. His exhibit was popular and people already respect him. Why would he fantasize about a museum? You got a point. It ain't related to plagiarism or abuse either. It's ego. Let's try looking around. Racking our brains here won't do us any good. He has the public face that he's all humble and focused on art, but he just wants the fame. Right. That aside, ain't a museum a must for phantom thieves? Hey, this is gonna be cool. Now that's our joker. I feel the same. But man, just look at that insane crowd. Time we begin our infiltration. We're gonna have to wait in that gigantic line. <sighs> Stupid, we're not going in the front door. There's a high wall around the building. Shall we go? Just to find a way over it then. In any case, let's get going. It's sort of like chill traveling music that we have for some reason. I'm surprised it's not more upbeat. Maybe it will be when we get in. I have something. Here we go. Yep. Really is how he thinks that rundown shack. It's overwhelmingly shiny. It's just not hitting me yet. This is that old guy's palace. That's why we're here, right? Come on, let's go check it out. Damn, we can't cross the barrier. Oh yeah, I gotta start stealing a bunch of stuff too. Stealing art pieces for this one. Something over there, but there's something over here too. Don't know if I can make any jumps there yet. I can see it. Let's take everything we can. Are we gonna be able to do the palace in one go yet? I feel like we we can't just yet. I feel like we're probably gonna be booted out again. Be surprised. Hey, skylight's open. I think we can get in here. That's a pretty far drop. We'll be able to get back out this way. Now's my time to shine. Don't worry, I have a rope. I'm a t our tool specialist, after all. What's your call, Joker? Want to head inside? Let's do it. <clears throat> this seems to just be the music for the palace. Yeah. How suspicious. It's very mellow. It's quiet in here, almost eerily so. Oh. Hey, this. It's moving. Oh, we're in a palace. That ain't anything to be freaking out over. Mm. The palace this reflects is... his ruler's heart. We may want to check out these paintings. If there actually is like a painting of an ape at any point in this palace, like 
everyone's gonna lose their minds. <laughs> so we gotta be careful. Hmm? Some kind of explanation here, let me see. Someone's name and age, what the hell? It can't be the title of the painting, right? Do you think it's the artist's name? Hmm. Let's check the other paints too, I think there might be something important about them. Hey, hey. Let's go look in the next room. Focus. There's one over here we can check. No? Can we check these? I can feel it. Persona 64 Royal. Bob on battlefield's in here somewhere. Hey, this doesn't make any sense. Madarame's famous for having a variety of art styles, but all the portraits on display here look the same. This is way different from what was at the... Wait a sec. Ain't this that guy we saw in Mementos? You know, the, the one who was shit-talking Madarame? Oh, it's everyone he, like, basically dicked over. Natsuhiko Nakanohara. His name's written on the plaque. Dude, I don't get it. Why is there a painting of him in here? And more important, why is his name written under it? You're right. Doesn't art usually have, like, the title of the piece or the artist's name? Hmm, this is quite the mystery. All right, let's keep looking around for now. It's chill ele elevator music palace, it seems. There's gonna be one of Yusuke here. Hey, hey! <sighs> it took a while to. <laughs> Ryuji's just tired. He missed a pot. I couldn't get that pot. Wait. No, I okay. I could, but there was no loot. You can just destroy that one for funsies, I guess. Wait! Probably should touch that button. Oh, there he is! Hey, isn't this a painting of that guy? It says Yusuke Kitagawa. There's no mistaking it. Huh? Wait, what do you think these paintings are? Matarame's pupils. I think you're right. For real? All of them? But it was only Yusuke when we went to his place before. It's past pupils. This must include former pupils as well. Only one remains now. Taking into account what that Nakanohara guy said earlier, things are getting clearer. Alright, let's keep investigating. We need something to further confirm our deductions. Somewhere. You gotta change his heart. He's evil. Some sort of brochure here. Mm -hmm. Wait, you fi find something. We're here to investigate, so we should check everything that catches our attention. Oh, sweet treasure already. I'm surprised this gets given as loot. Joker, a like, we're not oh. fighting anything yet. Thank God for our 11 lockpicks. We should be fine for this palace. We might need to make some more in future. Oh. A lunar cutlass. There you yep. go. You take that. Hmm. The pamphlet. It's getting way too detailed for freaking palace. Why'd he bother making something like this? The museum guide in here. Let's take it with us. Oh yeah. Why even show us the location of the treasure? Nice. It's a possibility. At the very least, it should be a good reference for the scale of this place. The map only shows half of the museum. See, it says it's one out of two. <sighs> the two out of two's gotta be around here somewhere, right? Just how big is this place? Worry about that in our time right now. Our objective is confirming Madarame's cognition. We may have to reconsider our plan dependent on what we find. I got the lockpicks from the DLC. Yeah. A lunar cutlet. We're gonna have a nice meal. The cat doesn't deserve it. I, I know, but we have to give the equipment to him. I'm as upset as the rest of you.
giant sculpture. Ah. Look at this. The Infinite Spring? A conglomerate work of art that the great director Madarame created with his own funds. That monster. These individuals must offer their ideas to the director for the rest of their lives. Oh, actual that monster. Those who cannot do so have no worth living? Uh-oh. Hey, this is most likely about the plagiarism, right? Damn it. What a phony geezer. In other words, his pupils are his property. He doesn't even qualify as an artist if this is true. He's stealing the ideas from talented students in exchange for securing their livelihood. I wondered about those portraits on display. They must all be his pupils through his cognition. Oh no, he's a capitalist. This even says that they have no worth. Couldn't this be about the abuse? Madarame will keep them around as long as they're useful to him. But the moment they're not... He's treating them like slaves or tools! Why is Yusuke keeping quiet about this? He's got no reason to cover this up. He doesn't he know. He did say that he owes Madarame his life for being taken in. Madarame's taking advantage of him. But still. When we were at the exhibit, I praised one of the pieces on display. But Kitagawa-kun acted strange. Maybe that piece was plagiarized too. What's the call? Ain't this enough to target Madarame? Uh, let's go. That's what I'm talking about! Hold on, you two. We should confirm these facts with Yusuke once more. Confirm what, though? It means we should get solid evidence that such crimes actually took place. Like, the apes are enough, Morgana. We gotta stop them now. What a pain in the ass. Besides, there's too much we don't know about Madarame yet. Mm, you're right. I'll try contacting Kitagawa-kun. I might be able to get the truth out of him if I accept his modeling offer. Wait, you're gonna do that? You all better come with me, okay? I'm scared to go alone. A famous, renowned artist, huh? Oh, this might be tougher than Kamoshida. Well, we'll just prep ourselves until we get confirmation from Yusuke. This is our first mission as real Phantom Thieves. We're gonna succeed no matter what. So all caps. We are literally in his brain right now. <laughs> yes, that, that that is the premise of the game. It's nice to have you here. It's not a tutorial anymore. It's moving a lot faster for introducing this guy. Seems that, at least. The reason why Yusuke is hiding the truth. Oh, please let me outside, cat. You really forgive someone unconditionally if you owe your life to them. I'm not so sure anymore. What are you bringing this up for? According to Kitagawa kun, Madarame isn't the problem. What do you mean? Something wrong. I mean, I know Madarame is a bad person, but still. Maybe I'm so hesitant because I haven't actually met any of his victims. Yeah, I guess that part's totally different from what happened with Kamoshida. This might be an extreme line of thinking. But if an evil person isn't causing any trouble now, is there really a point in us stepping in? Well, you got a point. We're gonna let y Yusuke decide if Madarame's work going after or not. Oh no, if it were me, I'd never forgive that bastard. Let's see how he feels. Yeah, I guess we could talk some more after that. So let's meet in Shibuya after school tomorrow. Hey. Another box came for you. Common masks and 20 eye drops. Nice. Plants doing good? Let's go to bed. Wait, can I not? I can see it. Shibuya after school. Don't sleep in just because you're in the palace. <sighs> Let me have fun, Morgana. <laughs> Damn cat. Well then. Give Madarame, but what Aunt said made me think. To Yusuke, are we just a bunch of thugs? Uh, honestly, probably. <laughs> I knew it. It ain't like he thinks it is. It pisses me off just thinking about it. Good people have to put up with so much crap while while shitty adults do whatever they want. 
It all comes back to adults. God, they suck. Makes me sick. I I'm not wrong, am I? I'll take him down. Oh, yeah. Don't tell on I called you, by the way. Uh, seriously. Well, see you tomorrow. We'll show those mean adults. Get to infiltrate the palace soon. Just a few more days. All right, I contacted Kit uh, Kitagawa Kun about modeling for him. Still waiting for his response. Thanks. Really have no idea what I'm supposed to do as an art model, though. <laughs> Cover yourself in pain. Uh, just be yourself. It's actually kind of hard. But you don't gotta go all out for this. You're only doing it so you can get dirt on Madarame, remember? That's true. It's not like Kita Kitagawa Kun wants this to be a private pic picture of his, though. Well, I guess I'll let you guys know when he contacts me again. The greatest evils in the world, adults and cats. I got a response from Kitagawa-kun. He said he wants me to come over after school today. Okay, here we go. Perfect. Probably dropped all his plans just to get you over there. We need to find out from Kitagawa-kun if what we saw in the palace was true. Hey, quiet down. It's that student council president. Oh no, Makoto. Don't tell her anything, Mishima. Yikes. She got hold of Mishima today? It'd suck if she noticed us. Come on, I'll split up. Okay, see you later. Don't snitch, Mishima. We need you. We finally landed a big target. Come on, let's get some dirt on Matarame. But man, Han's late. Sorry. I was thinking about some things and didn't notice how much time had passed. That's a mood right there. <laughs> Thinking about what? Don't you think Kitagawa-kun has to be protecting Matarame? I mean, they live together, so he'd have to be aware of Matarame's true nature. The only reason I can think of him doing that is that Matarame has something on him. Well, yeah, like, Matarame is, like, not going to provide for him if he snitches. Yeah, that's it's abuse, weird. ain't it? But that's why we're going to check it out, right? control. You ready to be a model? Yeah, I'm prepared. What do you mean prepared? <laughs> prepared for what? Something seemed different about her to you. What? Did she cut her bangs? Uh... I, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like she's got more makeup on or something. Nope, I'm the same as always. Huh. Well... Let's get going. We gotta talk to Yusuke. Kitagawa-kun seemed really happy when I agreed to be his model. Once he finishes drawing and gets a little friendlier, we should bring up Matarame. Let's go. <laughs> the hell's going on here? I don't know. <laughs> I thought it would just be you coming, Takamaki-san. Yeah, we're just here again. Don't mind us. Wouldn't you get nervous too, if it was just the two of us? We're here to keep an eye on you, so uh, don't try anything perverted, okay? Stop Jeez. making such odd assumptions. I have absolutely no interest in her as someone of the opposite sex. Huh? Is there a problem? He's no. an artist. Well then, let's get started. There he goes, he's painting. Hey. Kitagawa kun? Hmm. You hear her? He's trying so hard to focus. It's like, hey, uh, how's it going? Yeah, we're gonna it's get some no McDonald's. Use. This isn't what we planned. We were gonna catch him off guard and make him spill his beans, weren't we? How were we supposed to know this was gonna happen? Painting a painting. Guess we just gotta wait till he's done. What a effing pain in the ass. Perhaps I should try going outside this room. Uh, don't get caught. Huh. Who do you think you're talking to? This is too boring, so I'm going to scout around a bit. The cat has escaped. It's weird how flashy that door is. And 
Is that a lock? A door with a hefty lock. What could be in there? Oh. Got something to hide. Are you done? It's no good. What? I'm sorry. Am I the problem? No, not at all. It's just... I'm having trouble staying focused today. I'm sorry, but we'll have to resume this another time. Oh, hell no! How many hours <laughs> do you think you made us wait? Ryuji doesn't understand, like, the concept of waiting for a painting. Like, why isn't it done? You just use your camera. I'm sorry. Camera on your phone. We had another reason for seeing you today. We needed to talk to you. It's about those rumors regarding your sensei. This again. And that painting I saw at the exhibit. You're the one who actually painted it, right? Oh, shit. That's... I knew it. Your sensei's seriously messed up. He just thinks of his pupils as tools. That's why he doesn't give a damn whether he steals their work or physically beats them. I'll make this clear. There's no point in hiding stuff from us. Like, we saw the ape you minted, Yusuke. That was your ape originally, wasn't it? <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. You couldn't go against him, could you? I'm sure we can help you out, though. Stop it. It's like Matarame screenshotted his NFT, that bastard. It's just as you all say. We're our sensei's artwork. Don't misunderstand me, though. I offered my ideas to him myself. As such, it can't be called plagiarism. Oh, Jesus. Sensei is simply suffering from artist's block right now. He's manipulating you. Dude, He's still. stealing all your work. Kitago-kun. <sighs> then why are you sticking around? All his other pupils ran away. Aren't you the only one left? What's wrong with a pupil helping out his master? There are no victims here. Stop pushing your self-centered righteousness on me. And the other pupils. I'm supporting Sensei as his pupil. Where's the wrong in that? Don't ever come here again. If you do, <laughs> I'll sue you for causing a disturbance. No, he's gonna sue us! Not again! <laughs> ah, anime! I'll sue! Hold it! We're not done talking here! Then you leave me with no choice. Hey! I'm reporting you to the police. I asked Hakamaki-san to be my model today, but I don't recall ever calling you two here. Oh, shit. What the F, man? Ryuji, stop it! Calm down, okay? Damn it! I won't report you, but only under one condition. What's that? I want you to continue being my model, Takamaki-san. But oh. you said that it wasn't working out today. That's because I was unconsciously being modest for your sake. However, I have nothing to worry about anymore. If you are willing to bear everything oh, no. to me, I will put my heart and soul into creating the best nude painting ever. Oh, no. What? Nude? Ah, uh, to think I'd be able to create a nude painting with my most ideal model. Oh no. Of course, you two won't be allowed in, and I ask that you forget about our discussion today as well. If I don't submit a new piece to Sensei soon, there will be some inconveniences. Nude? Meaning it'll be without any clothes, right? Why are things suddenly escalating like that? Because those are my terms. But that's... Wait, ain't that bad? <laughs> uh, yes, it's bad, Ryuji. Why... Why are you confused? <laughs> Wait a minute! <laughs> Since he is out during the afternoon while the art exhibit is on, so I can use this place freely. 
I should buy more art supplies. Yeah, we gotta explain it to Ryuji again. It's bad for real. You have to add for real. He doesn't understand sometimes. Will you give me a second here? Uh, of course. I'm willing to wait. I'll make time according to your plans. But please come before the exhibit ends. No, that's not what I mean. Why are you not listening? Sensei will be returning home soon. Oh, Jesus. We're done for today. Takamaki-san, I'll be waiting for you to contact me. No, no, no. We are not done talking here. Hey, what should we do? Uh, we better go. <laughs> yeah, damn it. He got us good this time. <laughs> Let's regroup and have a meeting, gang. Don't give up so easily! We'll, we'll get him next time. <laughs> Is she done being a model? A cat? You moron! Oh. He's totally out of his mind! I'm gonna have to pose nude if this keeps up! Yeah, so I I mean Yusuke Yusuke is just I think an artist here, right? But the blackmail part's kinda bad. <laughs> Pro probably not the best way. Uh. <laughs> How dare that Yusuke! The way he said it, it's not gonna be semi, <laughs> but full on, nude. <laughs> Th thanks for the clarification. <laughs> No. Drop it. You know, you won't have to worry about that if we make Madarame confess before the exhibit ends. But Kitagawa-kun thinks he owes his life to him. Is there a need to make Madarame confess? Then, Lady On, you're fine. I just want to skip I what the cat not. says. <laughs> Every time he speaks, I don't enjoy it. Madarame is no different from Kamoshida. That asshole's using Yusuke who doesn't have parents. You're telling me we should just ignore how he's being treated horribly like the other pupils? No. It is frustrating to leave this alone, even if Kitagawa-kun is fine with it himself. You can't leave it be because you've endured a lot yourself with Kamoshida. Yeah. Anyways, we gotta go after this guy. Madarame is the kind of target we've been waiting for. Let's get him. Let's help Yusuke come to his senses, too. Before he ends up like us. Right. We need to look into Madarame first. There might be tons more stuff that hasn't been exposed yet, too. It may become easier for us to investigate his palace if he's preoccupied with his exhibit. Also, there's the thing about me modeling. Kagawa-kun said there'd be inconveniences unless he submits a new piece. Uh, it's chow. Right, I'm just looking at it. I feel like a... Hang on. Damn, man, I'll sue. We'll get him. I use good. I don't know why people keep saying liberal in relation to stuff here. It just feels like weird political insertion. One person said it as a joke, and I just think joked about it because it's just absurd. I, but I think some people are actually using it as like a weird hate thing now. And I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. I don't even. I don't even know what like, people are even implying. Like, right? Buzzword, yeah. Seems it. Maybe that's going to be announced soon as Madarame's next work. Does that mean the whole country's gonna see you nude? <laughs> For you, G, no. Are you not confident? <laughs> Uh. 
We gotta stop it. Oh yeah, it might not show your face. <laughs> no, Ryu, she just shuts up. That doesn't make me feel any better about it. We must deal with Matarame, no matter what, before his exhibit ends. Let's start after school tomorrow. Oh, it'll be a pain if Miss President finds us on the rooftop again, so... Uh, where to meet up? I guess that walkway-like place in Shibuya would work. It's near Madarama's place, too. Yeah, sure. Public place in Shibuya. Changing our Perfect. hideout periodically, huh? That's a plan I don't mind backing. Hideout has moved from the Shujin Academy rooftop to the Shibuya uh, Take You Building Access Way. Hey, uh, can I talk to you kids for a sec? Woman with camera. Huh? From the looks of things, you don't seem like the ordinary stalking fans. Uh... Oh, sorry. I should have been more clear. I'm actually looking for people that know Madarame's pupils. There's this painting, Sayuri, that was supposedly stolen in the past. But there's this rumor that it was taken by one of his pupils in retaliation for being abused. Oh. Have you heard anything about that? We don't care about ours. <laughs> I see. There's no case unless there's a victim, and if there's no proof of abuse, I can't write either. Looks like I'm back to square one. Sorry for taking your time. I'm a journalist. If you ever get any leads, mind contacting me here? Sure thing, woman with camera. See you then. I guess we should go home for today. I'm going to write an exposed piece on Matarame. Got another business contact for like a, a social media manager is going to approve of. <sighs> Whatever, I still can't forgive him. The man in the paint lady on nude. Then claimed to report us to the police. Hey, it's me. Got a minute? Oh, how's it going, Mishima? I have some interesting news. Someone who received a change of heart contacted me on the fan site. Said he wants to meet with you to discuss another person who needs a change of heart. <laughs> Why me? <laughs> I think he knows. You're better off talking to him in person if you want specifics. All I know is his target is a terrible person. And that it might complicate things if he posted the name online. I'll have him wait for you at Shibuya Station after school. The okay. guy's name is Nakanohara. Oh, it's your man. Nakanohara. That's Matarame's student. I told him to approach you. Good luck. Mishima just like gave away the point of contact. Like just so... Well, I, our identity so blatantly. What the hell, Mishima? Found out something insane about Matarame. Sounds like a student of his offed himself when he couldn't speak up about Matarame stealing his work. Is that true? Journalist was looking into Matarame too. It could be real. Someone died though. No one's talking about it. I bet it was covered up. Wonder if uh, Kitagawa-kun has heard anything. It could be great if he could help us out. He's been asking a bit much. After today, you're probably gonna be on edge about us. Well, anyway, Matarame's still a piece of crap. Let's meet up tomorrow. It'll be our first time at the new hideout. I passed away in Shibuya, right? Gotta see you guys tomorrow. If the rumor Ryuji just spoke of is true, there have to be other victims. Okay, so we're gear we're gearing up for the palace. Steal Matarame's heart. Are we gonna be able to do like a full palace tomorrow? Can we do anything fun right now? Hey! Not yet, not yet. We're gearing up for it though. We're gonna be in the palace soon. Uh what do we wanna do with our time? Yeah. Could craft, um, we could make some more coffee. We could watch a DVD. We could make some more lockpicks. We will probably always need lockpicks. How much coffee do I have? The Blanc coffee. Sakura mochi. Probably just want to make more coffee. What about Fidos? We already, we've already done everything for our exams. Burger challenge. We can't leave at the moment. We can't leave. 
Um, you know, I might just make some more coffee. I think it's like better to have a bit extra than not enough. Study, study. I'm not, I'm not making coffee. Make sure your clothes up. Yes. All right. There we go. Extra coffee. Bit of charm. Well then. Points for coffee, Dad. Oh no, he just went home. We didn't get the point with him. He just left. Oh no. Okay, hideout places change. Shima said, uh. Uh, Naka no Hara should be in Shibuya too. Yeah, okay, the game's just taking us. Yo! We're about to head to the hideout too. Who's that? Excuse me. That's Naka no Hara. Mishima told us to meet him here in Shibuya today. For real? My name is Naka no Hara. Natsuiko Nakanohara, the one who was posted about on the Phantom Aficionado website. I know who you are. He seems pretty nice. Doesn't seem like the stalker type. I think the change of heart must have worked. The administrator of that website contacted me. They told me to look for someone in a Shujin uniform with a cat. So, what do you want? You may have already heard, but there's someone I wish to trigger a change of heart in. Oh. An artist by the name of... Madarame. Here we go. <gasps> you think this is it? Is the pupil gonna confess his master's secrets? His shadow did mention Madarame as well. They're whispering very loudly to each other. I'm one of Madarame's former pupils. He gave me lodging at his home, where I thought only about art. I genuinely wanted to be an artist. There was another pupil as well. A very talented man, multiple years my senior. Obviously, Madarame kept tabs on him. Everything he made was claimed as a Madarame original. Oh, shit. He wasn't the only victim, though. All right. We got some real proof of the plagiarism. In response to Madarame's actions, that senior pupil committed suicide. Suicide? He must have been unable to bear seeing his work praised under Madarame's name. It's okay, guys. We're gonna kill Madarame at least twice. That was when I disobeyed Madarame's orders and left. But he quickly pressured other parts of the art world, and my life as a painter was destroyed. I tried to turn over a new leaf working at a ward office, but it was no use. My attachment to art warped my emotions. Soon I began getting attached to everything. In the end, I even turned into a stalker. <laughs> I'd like to ask again, please make Madarame have a change of heart. Not only for me, it's to save the life of another man as well. It's, it's current student. Save their life. Even now, there's still one young man remaining under Madarame's tutelage. I think he's about your age. That has to be Yusuke. Not only is he a talented artist, he also owes Madarame for taking him in after his mother passed. He is the perfect target. So Yusuke's got no choice but to listen. I actually spoke to him a few times back when I was still living at Madarame's. I asked him if he found it painful to stay with Madarame. And you know what he said? If I could leave, I would. Oh shit. Kitago Akun. I have no right to say this given my prior cowardice, but I don't want to see another suicide. Respectful. I'd like to find a way to save this young man. He has a bright future ahead of him. Please consider that when thinking about changing Madarame's heart. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna save gonna save Yusuke. We've been asked to act directly on behalf of one of Madarame's victims. He probably still shouldn't be blackmailing on. But we're gonna save him. Dude might have it rough. Doesn't excuse it, but. It sounds like we don't have the time to deliberate whether or not to change Madarame's heart. Okay, let's save you, Sky. Hell yeah! Madarame's just a piece of shit who preys on the weak. Suicide. 
I'll never let something like that happen. Plus, we finally got to hear how Kitagawa-kun really feels. Let's save Matt Mercer. Is he voiced by Matt Mercer? Well, since we've reached a unanimous decision, we gotta get Matt out of there. We continue this at our new hideout. That's funny. My fellow thieves, welcome to our new hideout. Not so loud. Our target this time is Matarame. We're openly in public. We all saw that palace. We'll pay dearly if we assume it's just going to be like the last one. And furthermore, Lady An's chest. <laughs> what? We'll need to do what we did with Kamoshida. First, we secure an infiltration route in the palace. After that, we send our calling card. Once the treasure has materialized, we steal it. Oh, oh, I got a question. Uh, Matarame doesn't know that we were doing stuff in the palace yet. Why are we already getting treated like criminals in there? You're learning, Ryuji. Well done. It must be because he doesn't trust anyone. Any unknown person may as well be an enemy. Or maybe he's just super salty from all those rumors that have been spreading about him. He could just be salty. Then his palace being so crazy had nothing to do with us? Either way, we should stay on our best behavior. He's a Call of Duty player. It'll be harder for us to steal we gotta the stop him. if we needlessly increase the security level. I saw I saw League of Legends on Madarame's laptop. That guy's sick in the head. We gotta do something. We need to be careful of Kitagawa-kun this time too. I'm sure that whatever he sees will just get passed on to Madarame. That's right. Hey, what is Madarame's treasure going to look like anyway? Another crown? I mean, it's probably going to be a painting. I doubt that, but my sixth sense will know when I see it. Oh yeah, you go completely nuts, huh? Our time limit is when the exhibit ends, right? That means June 5th. It's a fair bit of time. We'll carry out the plan after we've sent out the calling card. So our infiltration route will need to be set in stone two days prior on June 2nd. Now listen here, we can't mess this up, no matter what, okay? All right, let's go. Can we just go for it now? Okay. This is the first job for hashtag the chat amaze. So let's make sure we do it right. Come on, it's time to get this mission started. Your mission to change about a rabbit's hair has begun. You must steal this treasure by the deadline. Mission start. Occasionally you encounter palace obstacles that are impassable and require interacting with the target in the real world. You need to leave the palace to find the obstruction, enter palaces quickly to find obstacles and triumph over challenges before the deadline. Oh, okay, so you're gonna have to make like a, a few trips this time. Went to the palace, went to Mementos. Trial by Burger. <laughs> Incredible. Okay, I just want to see what the options are first before we sign up for anything. We can get a rank up with Takemi, um, which is like the main one that's kind of like being highlighted there. It might be wise just to get a few more supplies before we set on out. Yeah, it's like Takemi's going to give us access to better items. Just like an I like a thing or two before we go. Takemi might be useful. I'm just gonna get the rank up and then leave it. I think the only rank up that I'm gonna do before I do the palace is probably just Ryuji as well if that one becomes available. But yeah, we're just gonna get like a perk or two before we do it, because then it's like Yeah, we want as much like an advantage as we can get. So let's go see Takemi. Also, I need to get the uh, a lot of ticket. I need to check. Check the result. We won. Oh, uh, not enough. Not enough. No, we got we got to win big again. We got ten grand before. Wow. Welcome. Okay, results are next week. 
Do I have to try some scratchers? They're much faster than the lottery. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We gotta try it. Receive your scratcher results instantly. Yeah. All right, let's scratch away. Well, then. See, scratchers. There's three spots you can scratch at, and it seems you win if any of those spots show a money amount as the prize. So you can just go ahead and scratch them all. Which one do you want to scratch first? Here we go. Start with the middle one. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, come on. Hmm. What if I buy another one? Hmm. Can I buy another one? I can't buy another one. Oh, he's not giving a talk Hello. this time. Yeah, it's come the evening. I, I, I need to like talk to him as well. Apparently, he's a confidant too. Okay, we're gonna talk to to Kemi first, though. We're gonna talk to the Kemi, and so we can get some extra medicine. He's an addict. Can <sighs> we ever study the correlation between the rise in temperature and the rise in weirdos? So, what are you here for today? I refined the medicine from the other day a bit. Could you come to the back? Yeah. Let's get the rank up here. Please head to the exam room. That way we can get some spicier meds. Hmm. Here you go. The effect should be instant this time. Hopefully we don't pass out. Let's see. Eyes are focused. But this way, one, two, three, four. Nothing yet, huh? The inside of my mouth feels like it's burned and my nose is itchy. Oh. Oh, there it is. The inhibitory effect is just as I had hoped. Your weight was the primary reason it took longer to kick in than expected. This is what I expected from a teenager. I'm making great progress. Practice makes perfect, right? Okay, hold tight. Once I compile all this, the data, we can move on. Hello? Hello, it's Kemi Medical Clinic of International Medicine. How can I help you? An emergency, huh? But we're not a designated hospital. Besides, the head physician here is, uh, Tei Takemi. Ah. Awfully rude just hanging up on a lady like that. Okay, we got a... Confidant mode. What was that about? Was that an emergency? What were we thinking? What was that about? Maybe just not that. Because that's like doubting her. Oh. Oh, we basically just called the wrong number. Oh. <laughs> the ambulance driver was looking for a transfer location. All the designated hospitals are full. But the thing they'd accidentally call a general practitioner must have been a new paramedic. He seemed to at least know my name, though. I've been blacklisted by the larger medical community. They called me the plague due to a grave medical error I made. Oh, no. Okay. Mm. I think something's gone wrong here. Maybe we shouldn't call her the plague. What do you mean? <sighs> this goes back to my old job. I used to work at a university hospital in the city. And it was never actually convicted of anything, but I'm still considered a pariah in the medical industry. Does that scare you? Participate in clinical trials run by a doctor like that. I think just I don't mind. I think I don't mind, yeah, because the other is kind of doubter. I don't mind. Seriously, our one strange kid. That's fine. Being ostracized has enabled me to focus on my own research and development. <laughs> Regardless, I look forward to working with you. We should add some additional medicine for you, my little guinea pig. Okay. We got we got a few points there. It seems to be less than Ryuji. Ryuji gives like so fucking many. Every time right. you talk to him. We got some new medicine though. That's good. Hello? Hello, Dr. Takemi's Clinic of Internal Medicine. Huh? One order of teriyaki chicken. <laughs> you're all good for today, you can go home now. Come again if, soon if you're still alive. I feel like cooperating in that shady clinical trials increase my guts. Take it. Yeah, I need to see what new medicine we can get. Take care. Oh, I'm gonna have to walk back in a moment. Hey, my little guinea pig, I have to talk to you about something. 
You haven't told anyone about my drugs, right? Probably just... Yeah, I haven't done that. Okay, I mean, part of the deal is that you're strictly prohibited from Sheridan and it happens here, so... I guess I'll believe you for now. Feels like I've been getting a lot more patients asking for drugs lately. Wonder where they keep hearing about me. It's been really bugging me. That's all I want to ask, I guess. Okay, see you soon. Ah, you're back. Hey! Yeah, don't forget to ask the airsoft guy about the paper bag. I still- I've had that bag for like a week. But I gotta do the crossword hmm. first. Hmm. Let me just scare the customers real quick. Special on that guy to call Detective Prince Akechi on TV. Still doing the news, you'll make it home in time. Besides, you can see his face any time. That's pretty boy's been on a, a TV a lot lately. Thanks for the coffee. Get out of here, I need to do my crossword. Where art is shown off and sold. Is it. <laughs> Pretty straightforward, this one, I think. Uh, bro, thank you for the 10 gift subs. Thank you very much. Hope you've been enjoying the stream. Thank you to everyone in general who's just been subbing on that and giving bits as ever. Hope you're all having a good time. I'm having a lot of fun playing. Okay. Gallery. A room or corridor where artwork is on display. The gallery is also the area where observers group together for all sorts of events. From court to golf tournaments. I also refer to a society at large, especially in regards to majority opinion, even a passageway made by an animal, such as the tunnel system of a mole. <laughs> Didn't know that bit. All right. I see. Even I couldn't figure that one out. Nice. Maybe you got a bit smarter after solving these crossword puzzles. Okay, knowledge up. Okay, it might be time to go see, like, Gunkle. Or, if we got, if we get the job, if we get the job, we can also, uh, talk to Sanderson. <sighs> Please head to the exam room. Okay, I need to buy some meds here. Okay, which one? What we got? Stores 100% HP In to spring, all allies. One sleeps asleep that knows no dawn, huh? Remove stat buffs, stat debuffs. Okay, that one's actually pretty good. Like that's that's just a full heal. Only be used in safe rooms. I have five of those. That should work. I'm gonna buy two of them anyway. That, I mean, it's it's just good, ain't it? You want that one? I probably want some more revives in general. They they're quite a handy go. item. Work. You don't I already have anything. five of these. I, I reckon I'll be fine with that. You want that one? Get three more. Thanks. Okay, we have some good group heals for when we get back to safe rooms. That should work. In case we go. need it mid battle. You want that one? Thanks. These ones are for all allies. That should work. Here you go. Spend a fair bit of money, but it's all, it's gonna be all right. We like basically invest it in stuff. Yeah, we got a, a bunch of extra HP restore. Take care. Pretty good. Okay, do we want to go see like uh, Gunkle or do we want to like get a job? I wonder what everyone else did this time. Time with Yoshida, time with Mishima. Mishima is apparently available. Okay, all right, we're gonna return the bag to Gunkle just before we forget. We can get some more money too by doing this. Hey, you came just at the right time. So I changed your plans. A paper bag from the other day, all yours. Picked it up somewhere. Nothing to do with me, understand? I didn't see it. I didn't touch it. I don't know about it. We clear? Riot police. 
if that's it, then go home. You can go window shop somewhere else. Hey. A modified model gun should be a powerful weapon to use during palace battles. Let's ask about what was inside the bag. Don't freak out, Johnny. Just ask him. Don't ask him if I had dauntless guts. Come on. Oh, I'm not gutsy enough. Okay. I can't do it. All right, which one? Oh, and he's got some new weapons too. Oh, the stat increase on these is actually kind of insane too, isn't it? That's what you're choosing. Do you like it? Should probably buy that. Hang on. Okay, let me see how much I can sell. All right. I guess that's fine. I don't have a lot of treasure. I can sell my old weapons. You should be grateful. Fine. The sooty ones, I can't sell them. Did I? I got that through my own means, didn't I? I only have one of those. Was this confused? Sell the fanny pack. You should be grateful. Okay. Oh, we don't have that okay. much. Sounds good. And he's got a lot of new items. Shock boost, freeze boost, burn boost, like the packs. Chargeable battery pack. All right. We got a lot in your kit. All right. Bro, Which thank one? you for the another 10 gift subs. Thank you very much. Okay, armor-wise, I think we're good. Yeah, armor-wise, we actually already have some very good stuff. We should probably get something specifically for Morgana. Yeah, get, get that one from Organa. You change your mind. That's what you're choosing. Don't break it, okay? Okay. Uh. Sounds good. Can buy okay. a ranged weapon. All right. Which one? I had a gun, didn't I? Who's the gun for? Come again. Equip. Is it for Johnny? Riot Police High Shock. Model gun based on one popular in America. Oh, that's double the damage. It's only four rounds, though. Still pretty good, though. Yeah, it can shock foes, which is, like, pretty good. I, I can't talk to him about the bag yet, which is kind of right. sad, ain't it? Sounds good. Okay, uh... I could invest, like, massively in a new ranged weapon, but honestly, like, that's all my money, and I don't think it matters too much. I don't think it matters too much. I think I'll be alright without that. I want to, like, save some of the money. Uh, come again. Yeah, I, I, need to, I need to get more guts. I need to get more guts so I can talk about the bag. I, I might get equipment while I'm kind of going through here. Uh, I should check here just in case. I can get like, a, I have a counselor persona or something. Yeah, we're gonna get a job. We're gonna go to the beef bowl place. Thank you so much again, bro. Seriously. <laughs> okay, you must be accustomed to infiltrating palaces by now. Somewhat. Guys, you have yet to obtain a truly acceptable number of personas. This is not the full potential of the power of the wild card. But this is a prime opportunity to help further your rehabilitation along. Don't worry, this assignment is not mandatory. Think of it almost as a test of strength. Now. We will have you bring us the mask we specify. Huh. Just gotta show us the persona we ask for. Well, that's easy. <sighs> and then a Mabufu up, as well. Inmate. Farewell. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh. Hmm? A persona. Hey, sit right there. It seems you brought the specified persona. Oh, sweet. <laughs> huh. Fine, I'll take it. By the way, your personas are super weak. 
Did I make that with the right one? Inmate. Though I guess you deserve at least some praise for finishing your penal labor. You might actually complete your rehabilitation. In order to promote that process, we would like to offer you the use of a new facility. Sure. <laughs> it's rare to see you smile, Justine. You are the smiling one, Caroline. Did something happen to make you so joyful? Me? <gasps> hey! Are you laughing at us? Just happened to make this earlier. Uh, maybe. Know your place, inmate! As wardens, we simply feel satisfaction in seeing your rehabilitation progress. That is the extent of it. I find it upsetting that you would see such a matter as a source of amusement. It's like you forget where you are, inmate. You've got some real guts, though. With that spirit, you should have no trouble making progress. Can you increase my guts stat for showing this guts? Very well, then. If you have the will to continue your penal labor, we can grant you greater freedom within this prison. It is a deal between us, the wardens, and you, the inmate. Oh, they're gonna let me you out. Right to turn it down, though. Hard work is what you're meant to do, inmate. Oh, we made a deal, so we get a new confidant. I am thou. Okay. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the strength persona, strength I have persona. obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Yeah, another confidant. Group guillotine allows you to fuse three personas to create powerful new ones. Oh right. god, that's gonna add a lot of combinations. Now, it's time for your next task. Farewell. We request an Ame no Uzemi with the skill Frey. Sure. Frey. How uh, Justine, I was just making sure I register everything. Oh, uh, yeah, no, you had it. You'd like to register this? Super convenient. Um, I need to- I'm looking for a counselor persona. I guess the main one is still- as long as I have, like, chariot and debt or something, I'm, I'm kind of like, okay. By Arcana. How do you- oh yeah, there. There's all the fool ones, magician. Priestess, Emperor, Hierophant, Chariot, Justice, Hermit, Fortune, Strength. Oh, nice. Level 65 debt persona. Power Star. I could use a Moon persona for uh, Mishima. I realize as well, I'm probably going to get a lot of extra personas when I go through here, aren't I? I'm probably going to get some new ones soon. There's the counselor ones. The world persona. This persona? It's like, yeah, sure thing. This seems fair. Okay, let's just create one. Guidance, you wish to perform an execution. I can do a group can guillotine. Oh wait, no, these are the group guillotines, so you need specifically this combination, do you? That's how you make the world, is if you have, like, all of these. So for the most, that's for very specific now ones, choose. it seems. Um, how do I sort by result? Use by result. There we want? go. Okay, Priestess star. Not terrible. 
but not impressive. Like a spoon. You okay with this? Ice one. I see. I can't make I can't make this guy yet because I'm only level eleven, I think. You okay with this? You okay with this? Which one is star confidant? Not terrible. It's devil. Not impressive. You okay with this? That's a cool guy. Oh, I'm level twelve, am I? Okay. Looks pretty tough. I can make this garlic dude. But it would cost me my slime and my angel. I, I have a second chariot, don't I? Yeah, I got you on. The slime is better. You can... Now choose. I, I feel like I should fuse some of them just because I, I have so many here. I want to like clear out my stock. Like Jack Frost is the main one I want to use and then maybe slime. I'm even okay to clear out the Mandrake. Let us begin the Because we're gonna we're gonna get some more soon. So just Jack Frost and Slime. Let's see what we can get without those using those two. Okay. They're required for almost all of them. Not terrible. We can get a spoon guy. Impressive. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Um I take it this does more damage to cleave compared to lunge because it costs more. Take curse. Spooky spoon. No, it doesn't. Oh, okay, so th this is just strictly better then. Its power will be nothing unusual. Seems you have not yet formed a confidant relationship with the star kind of. And since persona will not get any extra powers from fusion, do you still wish to create it? I mean I might as well. Sure. Now We're just gonna try new Earth. stuff. Look at this dude. Me Kadama. Turn you into a mask and head on out with you. I'm gonna echo inside your heart, bro. Wahoo. I can get a counselor one. Looks pretty tough. <laughs> Look at this dude. He's actually got some he's got some healing magic. Low amount of HP to all allies. Yeah, we're gonna get him. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. High chance of confused, decreases defense for one foe for three turns. Probably just take wind? Actually no, because I, I have a charm for wind, don't I? I have a charm for wind. Confused, fear, despair, brainwash. Yeah, we can make him kind of like a healer one. And then sure, we'll get the diva. A fraction of power. Girls, let us begin. There we go. Okay, another one to craft it. Behold, the counselor confidant has awakened your persona's hidden power. So now he just has regenerate. So two percent of max HP each turn in battle. Sweet. That's a real buff one, and that's good for the counselor. Uh, the other ones I probably just don't want to make right now. Yeah. Fusion. Which means I'm down to four, but like three of these are like also really refined ones. I don't have debt right now, but I can pick it up again when I need it for Takemi. And I have Ryuji, and I have one for a counselor. So yeah, that's pretty good. Jack Frost is kind of like the one I really want to use. Finished for now, Justine. You handle this. And yeah, it auto registers anything new. I think you create, Done so I don't already. have to do it. What? Okay. It is time, inmate. Jack Frost is the most base one. Jack Frost just looks cool. Oh, here's Mishima. Hi. Do you remember that group a while back who were claiming to hack websites in the name of justice? Pretty high hopes for them, but they turned out to be posers. Phantom thieves are true heroes, though. I want to help out however I can. Um. You remember that horrible person I texted you about? You're going to change their heart, right? If anyone can do it, it's the Phantom Thieves. Yeah, Machine is just chilling. 
Yeah, we can't talk to Gunkle yet. That's actually so sad. We, we need more guts. There's no DVDs, I think, for sale. No, not yet. Uh, let's get our job, then. Yeah, let's get the job. So I have to get a flyer, and they were in the underground, I believe? Mm -hmm. Go as quick as we can. Don't want to waste any time. We've got to hurry. You've used this joke like four times, Dan. I guess what? I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> Okay, so let's get a part-time job. Part-time jobs will cause time to pass, but also enable you to earn money and raise stats of just charm and kindness. Some jobs require you to have high enough stats before you can apply. Depending on the job, uh, you may only work during certain times of day. Uh, the beef bowl one is the one we wanted, wasn't it? Are any of these beef bowl? This beef bowl? Triple seven? Bottom one is beef bowl. Okay. Okay. Yeah, let's do that one. This one requires charm. Learn to care for people. Time afternoon. Oh wait, no. This is the only one we can do right now. Time is night. Nice. Seems tough, but you might improve your proficiency. Let's go. Let's call him right now. This is Aura Nebeko on Central Street. How many people are you ordering for? Are oh, you calling about the job opening? It's a great time. We're in need of some extra hands. I take just about anyone at this point. You don't mind working at night, do you? Stop by anytime you're free to work. You wait, and we're right at the by the entrance to Central Street. Cool. Check what days you work at your part-time job by opening the menu of it and triangle and selecting calendar. Oh, it's only going to be certain days. Oh, you can actually check what you did every day. That's actually quite cute. That's a that's a nice log. A night job, night job, night job. It's pretty much every night. Uh, where was it? It was Shibuya Main Street, wasn't it? Let's go here. Near Big Bang, was it? It's Big Bang again. Big Bang is here. Big Bang Burger. Uh, convenience store. Underground walkway. We passed it. I only see Big Bang. That's the thing. Maybe it's the, oh, oh, it's the bowl. There we go. Beef bowl shop. Yeah, a quick travel to the beef bowl shop in Shibuya. Okay. Uh, some days the shop will be more crowded than usual. During busier times, you'll need to remember a lot of orders. Stay calm. If you make it through the rush, you may earn more money than usual. Okay, let's get to work. So we're, lo we're looking to find Sanderson. I've been waiting. You're your part timer, right? I've been expecting you. I need to introduce yourself. I actually need you to start working right any away. Any questions? Do you have any questions about the job? Uh, let's go. Thanks in advance. Okay, I need to head out for a bit. Keep an eye on the shop till I get back. Hmm. This job is ludicrous. You have to do everything all by yourself from the very beginning. Oh well, just give it your best shot, I guess. I'll be cheering you on. Hey, wait! The customer in front of you is waiting to pay. Ooh, that is one angry looking face. Hey, someone wants to change their order. Add an egg. They should have told us earlier. Nice work. Good work. You leave. You, you can leave now since the end of your shift. This is your pay today. Thank you. I hope you can keep it up. Just very to the point. A bit of extra money is nice. Man. It's so hard. This job is so demanding. 
you still manage all those orders by yourself. You ask me, you are pretty proficient. Nice. Let's head back. Punch that clock, trophy urn. Ah, minimum wage. Okay, so So it's you. You did use this line before, now that I think about Let's it. Let's talk to Yusuke first. I hope you understand. Allow me to warn you again. Don't involve yourself any further. Okay, we're gonna steal your master's mind palace. I only saw you coincidentally. I have no time for such an ambush. If you continue sniffing around my sensei, we have ways of dealing with that. That's all I have to say. It's nice to see you too. Oh, yes. The great artist Madarame is holding an exhibition in Shibuya right now, isn't he? I've gone to see his work before. Wow, they are truly incredible. I saw some of his interviews too. He really is a charming fellow. It's rare to see a gentleman artist like him in a field known for having a lot of eccentric types. By the way, he seemed far removed from the arts, anime kun. <laughs> Here's a question. Which, fam which famous uh, ukiyo-e artist of the Edo period is said to have moved residents over a hundred times? I don't fucking know. <laughs> How would you know? I, I'm just gonna look it up. I've no shame here. This is it. <laughs> no shame. Oh, not bad. Did you know a thing or two after all? Uh, Hukusai had a habit of movement, but he also changed his name quite a lot, at least 30 times throughout his life. His sole interest was his art, so he stayed in poverty, wore tattered clothes, and lived in squalor. No Did you get that question? It wasn't even close. Maybe he actually is smart. I'm kind of surprised. Nice going. Another point. Actually, Madarame's house was quite modest, too. All master artists, past and present, always put their art above their fame. It's convenient that, like, every time we have, like, a new target or palace, like, we actually learn about them in school. Like, it's always gonna be someone that you're just hearing about. And it's, like, also held in, like, high esteem. You know, like, underground mafia boss, uh... Who's, like, like, like operating out of here. Yo, know, he's a good guy, if you ask me. You know, this criminal underworld needs to see the light of day. We should be treated with better respect. By the way, we're gonna teach about him in school. <laughs> That's what I want to see. Like, yeah, like, unknown, like, isolated criminal, like, as well. Not even from this country. It's time to learn about him. Oh, it's rain and I can't go to the metaverse anymore. I'm sorry, I can't go to the metaverse. I'm sorry, I, I can't go. I can't go. It's raining. I have to understand. I can get a rank up with on as well. No, I... Do I have time for rank up with on? I need to study. I need to study. Uh, this is time to go to the diner. Please go see on. I. But it's raining. I got. Going to the diner. Hmm. We've got to oh. maximize it. It's expecting more people. It's so quiet. Welcome, may I take your order? Got a new menu now that renovations are finished. Would you like to try it? I'd highly recommend the surprise sando and nostalgic steak. For those with the guts to indulge, or you feel kindness. We, we, there's not a lot of opportunities for kindness, but we kind of need the guts right now, don't we? We need the guts for Gunkel. Surprise, Sando. We'll be right back with your order. She does look good, but yeah, it probably actually tastes good too. For real? Let's carry that down without any hesitation. I'm overwhelmed by your guts. <laughs> Point of guts thrown in, and then all the knowledge points. Nice. 
All those customers coming in and out was a little annoying, but you look pretty focused there. <laughs> Knowledge is up so much. Wait, no, it was right. Did we not get an extra point? It was raining. Ah, you're back. What happened to the rain bonus? Oh, I only got two because of the rain. It's only one. Oh, okay, right. So it's three max if you buy some food. Dino gives one knowledge and one food. So the library is still better than if you just want, if you want specifically knowledge. But the library is also free, yeah. Oh, Kitagawa couldn't contact me, asking you to bottle for him again. No. He said outsiders who do not understand my circumstances should refrain from button in. If you continue to involve yourselves, I should be forced to contact the police. It will be the same thing. He texted you too. We gotta uh, stop trying to convince him. He's not gonna listen to anything we have to say. He could just be an obstinate at this point. Pretty sure he, he can sense something is wrong. The only reason he made that impossible demand was to try and distance us from him. What do you think? It just seems like a weird, stubborn dude to me. I say he does fit the artist stereotype. Either way, what we gotta do ain't gonna change. You have to steal Madarami's heart. Oh, we have 17 days as well. It's quite generous with the time. Oh, we can get rank up with coffee, Dad. Do I still have the right persona? No, I don't. I'm gonna need to go pick one up real quick. Yeah, I sacrificed it. Check the TV as well. You punch someone and hurt them, you've committed bodily harm. Now consider these two cases. Unconsent and cutting of hair, use a noise to cause distress. Which of these two would be considered a case of bodily harm? You be the judge. Uh, I mean... I mean, probably both of them, if you're just screaming at someone, but I mean, bodily harm specifically, if you cut their hair. The correct answer is B, if you drive someone crazy with noise, that's bodily harm. It disrupts the body's functions, it counts as bodily harm, even if there's no physical contact. It goes back so it doesn't count as a wound. It should be a case of assault, not bodily harm. Oh, okay. Right. The more you know, yeah, we learned something there, chat. Laws are dumb. Oh, it's still raining if we were the study. But no, we gotta rank up with that. Okay, so let me uh, go to the airsoft shop so we can go to the velvet room. Oh, they had a point for the velvet room there. Didn't see it. You could get knowledge hey, though. Teammate. No, I gotta rank up with that though. Should I actually- I should just get the knowledge, though. It's rain, yeah. Alright, yeah, we're gonna have to leave that. Yeah, I can rank up with that another time. So, do I wanna just rank up here? Like, just come back to the diner again? <sighs> Coffee, Dad, no. All right, we'll see dad. We'll see dad. Go on. Dad will probably not make it through winter. How? You'd like to read the competitors These are the paths you have walked. Okay, uh, hero fan, wasn't it? I'm just looking for it. I went the wrong way. Is this what you want? You'll withdraw this persona. This is your power. Yeah, there goes all uh, my what? beef bowl money. No slacking off. All right, we'll go see Dad. Become closer and our bond will grow stronger. Yeah. 
clean up. I'm gonna finish preparing the curry. All right then. That's it for tomorrow's curry. Hey, how's it going? You getting any better at remembering how to handle different bean types? And there are three factors that determine the flavor for a cup of coffee. Grind, heat, and time. First of all, the grind. The siphons we have here, aim for medium fine. Hey, you listen to me. What grind are you supposed to use? Medium fine? Right, keep up the good work. It doesn't take much profit given the effort it takes, but hey, money is money. Not gonna forgive you if you serve our customers crap coffee though, just remember that. Look at this be. Yes, hello. How'd you get this number? Now, where? Fine. Sorry. Sorry, something came up. We can keep going with the lesson some other time. Does dad have mafia connections? Uh, it's not a date. It's probably is it trouble. Bro, thank you for another 10 gift subs. Thank you so much. Yeah, is it trouble? Oh, you're worried about me. Something you need to concern yourself over. Just do the dishes while I'm gone. Oh, remember to shut off the gas before you close up shop. It's nice having someone around to help at times like this. Turns out you're actually uh, harder working than I thought. Keep it up. Yeah, we gotta spend some time with that every now and then. It's important. All right. We need rank four before we get anything out. Rest is on you. There he goes. If Dad's gonna call us. Let's finish with the mob. Get everything closed up. Sorry about earlier. Had to take care of some business. But don't worry, I'll put put you to work. Got lots of time on our hands. Not that. It's either this or this. Just I'm ready or thank you. One of the two. Yeah, let's try I'm ready to work. Ready to go, huh? Some work addict you got there. There we go. We're in with him. Just make sure you turn off the stove before you head to bed. Okay, we've availed of the rain. I'm so depressed. <laughs> oh, that guy does not want to go to work today. <laughs> He's still working at that beef bowl place on Central Street. They thought you liked that place because the pay was good. What happened? I'm sure, the pay's fine, but the only one there at night. The job magazine said it was a fun, friendly workplace. Maybe I should just quit. <laughs> he says work can be pretty tiring. It's work while experienced. Don't give up. So depressed. I want to get that as a sound file. Oh, our grades are out. Oh, here we go. How'd you do? Damn, I'm dead. You have above the average. That's the real dividing line. My allowance is safe for now. Wonder what score I got. I finished a little higher than the average score. Yeah. Should set a good example for your friends. Got more charm. We were fine. We passed our exams. Hey. It's 16 days left. What's the plan? Oh, our counselor is hitting us up. Ryuji wants to talk to us too. Oh, we got so many options. It's rank up with both Ryuji and the counselor. Oh, uh, like, I mean, I kind of want to, I kind of want to press on with Ryuji, but the counselor perks seem really good, too. They both seem so good, don't they? They both seem so good. Maruki isn't always available. Oh, okay, yeah, we kind of, we kind of have to see him then. We kind of have to see it. We'll get to the palace eventually. We need like a boring day when we can do it. There's just too much right now. Okay, yeah, we gotta go talk to our counselor. And we have we have the persona for him now. How have you been since our last talk? Anything bothering you? You got time? I'd be happy to chat with you again after school. But come closer, and our bond will grow stronger. 
Okay, go see him. Thank you, that'd be quite helpful. Okay, I'll be waiting in the nurse's office. So, will he help me out here, chat? Will Snackle only text us for when we can see him? And, like, otherwise he's not available. No, he won't. Okay. Alright, so there will, there, will, there, will, there will be other chances. He's Snackle because he's Snack Uncle. Let's go see him. Hmm. We're getting a lot of students coming in ever since I arrived here. To be honest, it's been kind of a relief. That whole mess with Kamoshida was the reason why I was called here after all. They warned me a lot of students had been impacted. I knew there would be a lot of free floating anxiety. When I actually got to talk to everyone, I was pleasantly surprised. Most of the things on everyone's minds were college entrance exams, relationship problems. In other words, typical worries for high school students. Some did open up about deeper issues, but not the majority. Some students were still struggling with the scars from the incident, yes. But at the very least, I'm glad the ones who came to me have taken some steps towards recovery. Not you worry too much. We want to, like, max him out. Thanks to you, probably. We could give him some credit. Do his horn a bit. So to have her. Yeah, that's not really, like, doing anything. Thanks to you. I can only hope so. I don't think I've done much, but if it helps even one person, that makes it all worth it. I know I'm not the most reliable guy, but remember, you can always talk to me, too, if something's bothering you. I'm the counselor here, you know? If nothing else, I'm good at listening. Let's Having said see. that, it's a little awkward that I have to ask for your help, but... You remember how I asked you to help me with my research? Not I forgot. <laughs> for our deal, or just of course? Just of course. So many points. I said you'd be helping with my research, but don't worry. It won't be anything too difficult or intensive. Just need you to listen to what I have to say. And work through some questions with me. So... But let's see, maybe I should start at the beginning. I'll tell you a little about what this research is for. What I'm studying now is pain felt in the mind, or perhaps more fancifully, in the heart. Some specific examples include the pain of someone saying hurtful things to you, or being separated from those you love. Maybe this will be clearer. Pain defined by abstracts like trauma or stress. Bodily physical pain can be thought of as something necessary. An autonomic response to injury, illness, whatever. Still. What about pains felt within one's heart? That pain isn't born from any tangible problem in our bodies, right? It's something strange and immaterial. I guess it goes to show there are still a lot of mysteries in our own hearts and minds. You know, I... And well, I want to learn more about these internal psychological pains. Now, this is my question to you. When you truly feel pain in your... When do you truly feel pain in your heart? Anime gun. <laughs> when someone betrays me. When I get punched... Probably not that. It's probably, probably one. I see, yes, I can sympathize there. Sometimes all it takes is one betrayal for intense trust to turn into intense pain. It can be, it can be rough. It doesn't feel good to struggle with pain in your heart. For example. But with that in mind, how about the pain of a broken heart then? After all, that kind of pain is only born because we fall in love, right? Do you have any thoughts on this kind of pain, anime-kun? Better off without it. That one seems necessary. It's a seed for new loves. He's probably going to appreciate like the positive mental attitude, maybe, here. Could be that one. I don't think it's two. I never took you for a poet. But it's a wonderful sentiment, a very positive way of looking at it. Internal emotional pain can be difficult to deal with, though some say it's always coupled with other feelings. And I agree, of course, I think that's a fair assessment. But personally speaking, I think if pain can be avoided, it should be. Maybe it shouldn't exist at all. Hmm. Wounds of the heart are much harder to detect, and in a way, they're far more complex than physical injuries. That's why I'm doing this research. To save people who are suffering from internal pain they keep holding on to. Help me realize that purpose again. Thank you. Uh, inquire about his research. Does that help? Right. Of course. Thanks to you, I can articulate my thoughts for once. And sense Maruki's gratitude towards me. That's some good points there. We get a good perk for that too. So chance to receive the the effects of charge and concentrate at the start of a battle. That seems. 
That seems good. I don't know what charge and concentrate are. It's a chance, though. All right. But, I mean, I'll take it. Okay, I think that'll do for today. Oh? Why do I feel like I'm forgetting something? <gasps> oh, your mental training. What do I... Do? Oh, no, I didn't forget about our promise, of course. I'll teach you tricks for mental discipline. You help me with my research, just like we decided, right? Oh, we get... That's right, we get even more points. Mine feels right. stronger. Max SP increases. And we get a snack. Well, it, see you. So damn good. So damn good. But do you have time to talk right now? I'm taking a breather. Just finished my last counseling session for the day. And I thought I'd thank you once again for your help earlier. Not that. Good work over there. Get into your research now. General interest or just compliment him? Probably just compliment. It seems to be if you're just kind to people in general, that's like the best one to pick. Thanks. A lot of students came by to talk today. Hopefully they get some, got, got some out of it. To be honest, it's pretty tough juggling this job and my research at the same time. Thanks again for agreeing to help me out. I might be looking to you for more help, for, for help more frequently from now on. You know, a lot of you can lend a hand. All right, see you later. Yeah, so we should go see him whenever we can. Like the perks that he gives seems to be insane. Ah, you're back. Can't get the rank up with Coffee Dad at the moment, but we can get closer towards it. Uh, we could do beef again, though, and see if we can run into the politician. You got time right now? Uh, it's not gonna deepen just Next yet. Time, then. Could just go, um, go for beef. Going for beef is probably best. Do I need to talk to Sanderson first, or do I just go in? Yeah, help me out there, chat. Just go in. Just go in. Go. Cool. Get to work. So we're hoping he swings by. Not a huge group just came in. Gonna be provided with orders at this rate. Make sure you memorize them all. Okay, medium curry, medium natto, large beef, one large natto. Yes! Alright, stay calm and remember the orders. Oh no! Johnny's in trouble. Uh, the first one was a medium curry. <laughs> uh, the second one was the medium natto. I've forgotten what the last one was. Uh, I think this was large beef. Nice. Was it barbecue? No, it was large natto. Okay, thank you. Well, I almost got them all. I almost got them all. And you just have to make everything and serve. Oh, he's you. here. You appear to have a difficult time there. Can't you ask your manager to hire more people? You're extremely busy. Employees being overworked is becoming a real problem in the workplace. That's concerning. Mm. I should remember this. He really is just like Bernie Sanders. Sanders Sand. He's well, then, so based. Leave my payment here. Thank you for the food. Hey, hey! Isn't that the politician who gives speeches in front of the station? He's worried about employees in the workplace, huh? I think he knows who you are now. You should go to the station square again sometime soon. My. Good work. It seems there's a lot of customers, but you handled it well on your own. We were as crowded today as we usually get on uh, Yakiniku Day. I wonder if there was some event happening Thanks nearby. Thanks Paid you a little extra. That's actually quite a bit extra. That's a lot of money. Unionize. We're going to take over the beef bowl shop. <laughs> we got a lot of proficiency for that, too. Yeah, that was nearly triple our pay there. That's pretty damn good. I do want to start the palace tonight if I can. The The main 
the main if is just on what if hey. I can see Ryuji or like the counselor, I'm gonna go see him. I can read a book here. I can finish this book. Oh wait, this one builds guts though. This one builds guts. I need guts right now. Guts is really important because we can't talk to Gunkle. Yeah, I think we changed course. Hmm? Lone pirate ship sailed forward, forging its own path for the crashing waves. Wow! Pirate Captain Kid, huh? Ryuji should read this book. Hey, hey! You realize I don't even read. Yeah, we got some pages left. But that's progress towards guts. It's good. Like silly Morgana, Ryuji can't read. You ever use the study corner in the library? I always end up goofing off at home. How many people know about it? Isn't the environment kind of a problem? Have you heard the rumors about that transfer student? They're still just talking about me. Oh him, yeah, it used to be anyone all anyone ever talked about. You ever Mr. Kamashita's big apology? The transfer student's kinda old news now. My recent test scores haven't been so hot, but don't shave up my allowance could be in danger. We're right there. They're just like complaining about us. Today we're going over. It's possible to apply math even to an abstract con concept like beauty. The golden ratio is used in the Mona Lisa and the Parthenon as a famous example. A, diff a different ratio has been used in Japanese art and architecture since ancient times. I'm sure you've all heard of the silver ratio. Now, an anime sign. Take a look at this. Give me an answer. The golden ratio is one. 1.618. Do you know what the silver ratio is? Um, I mean, I'm assuming it's smaller. I don't know if it's 414 or 303. I wonder. I wonder what the answer could possibly be. This is it. Precisely. I'm so smart. You can see it's closer to a square than the golden ratio, right? One theory says it's because Asians have rounder faces than Westerners, so they prefer a smaller shape. This ratio is used in things like, uh, uh, Ukiyoe paintings and the pagodas at, uh, Ho uh, Horyuji Temple. Uh, one you should all be familiar with is B4 size paper. This proportion size silver ratio. No Anime Kun seems kind of smart, don't he? Nice going! Knowledge up. Oh yeah, I hear that mascots are, uh, that are seen as cute have faces that are close to this ratio. In other words, if you use this ratio, you can make cute things. I see. It's true that mascots tend to have roundish faces. But not you, Morgana. The only ratio you have, Morgana, is an L plus ratio. Okay, uh, we're getting a lot of points of contact here. So get up with on uh, to Kemi. We can go see Ryuji, but I don't think it's a rank up. Oh no, he's asking about the palace. Uh, I want to see. Hang on. Port. Counselor. Next rank is Mindfulness. Chance to restore Joker's SP when it is low. Holy shit, that's so good. Yeah, his perks are insane. They're all so active as well. Like, these are, these are all in battle perks. Okay, you know what? We're gonna... I think we're gonna go to the palace right now. Um, I don't think Takemi is going to have any new meds for us for a while. I mean, unless... Unless... Yeah, so it's not going to be until rank 5. So yeah, we're just going to go to the palace. I should write something. Should probably save the game too. Okay, first palace trip. Job to. Still hanging out in the hallway. That was 
That was the other day, we didn't reply to them. You're not going into that, it couldn't hurt to find the treasure sooner than rather than later. Okay, let's go. Everyone's here. If we can hurry and change Matarami's heart, more people might start believing in this. Okay, infiltrate the palace. Okay, let's go. We're going back into Facebook. Now then. I'm sure you already noticed, but the first thing we need to do is secure an infiltration route. Can we send the calling card? Yeah, yeah, we know the drill. Anyway, let's get ready. Oh, are we gonna have another quick chat before we go? We have much to discuss. Sure, let's hop on in. Does anyone remember the name of the persona we need to pick up to? <laughs> Uh, bro, thank you for the 500 bits, uh, as well earlier. I'm actually out of money, but the dumpling offer still stands. Once again, hope everyone is doing well and stays nice and hydrated. Thank you very much. I'm doing good. I got, like, a big thing of water with me here. Now I'm working away on it. And then I'm gonna make a nice sandwich when all this stream, when the stream is done. Basically ate just before I streamed. Okay, rehabilitation's going smoothly. Thanks to you. We should just suck up to him now. Get like the the rank points in. Excellent. I expect no less. Prepared a special gift for you. I must reward such exemplary conduct. Use this power well. Every persona has a specific trait, each of which has a different effect. Some may decrease the cost of a skill or increase the power of a specific attribute. There are various benefits associated with using a persona's trait in battle. Be sure to take into account which actions will best utilize the trait. View the details of Persona's trait in the Persona status screen. Oh, so now they have like a passive effect, do they? It's like a Pokemon <laughs> ability. Marvelous. Okay, cool. Then. Let's see. Increases SP cost of ice skills by half. Pretty damn good, considering uh, that he's like an ice Persona. Increases the chance of being inflicted by ailments. Increases damage after a baton pass. Increases the amount of HP restored to self by 50%. Very good on him, considering that he's the healing one. Jack is based. <laughs> okay, and then we can check. Uh, stats. May increase allies' physical attacks by 40%. That's pretty damn good. Increases the effect of allies' healing skills. Pretty good. May decrease SP cost of allies' magic skills. Those are all pretty damn powerful. No slacking off. Okay, back out we go. Chad plus based equals Jack Frost. What are you standing around for? Get with the program, alright? You're a vital member of the team here. Okay, in we go. The second palace begins. Hop on in. Gotta go all the way back around here. And swipe this too. Need to try and get some money again while we're... I can the music is so relaxed for this zone, isn't it? It really feels like elevator music. Like, I feel like I'm just like in a loading screen or something. Whoa. Hold on, Joker. An infrared laser device. If we touch it, the security will increase. Come on, man. Hold on, there wasn't anything like this last time, though. The rumors might slowly be making Matarame become more wary of us. 
Okay, they're not easy to see, but you should be able to do it with your skills. Be careful. You can detect infrared rays with third eye. If there's a wide enough gap, you can slip through it by pressing X. This can also be done by holding next as you approach. Remember that you can only pass through if there's enough room. Somewhere. So you wanna you wanna just take your time here. Yeah, let's Show get him. your true form. Okay, so just give me a shout whenever we see the one that we need for the quest. Because they'll be in here somewhere. It's almost scary how good I am. Oh, we can talk to them again as well. We haven't got some of these. That one looks pretty gloomy, but don't overthink it. Just go say hi. He's gloomy. I can't trust you. <laughs> Make him gloomy. Would have never accepted this if I knew it would involve this sort of suffering. Um, hmm. Pity. Uninformed choices are bad. I only had to. One or three. Complain won't help. That's a pity. That's a pity. Oh, no, he's just gonna give us an item now. Okay, there he goes. Let's pull back so it's three. Okay, we know for next time there. Oh my god, is that a moo moo from League of Legends? Basically. I can see it. Not mean to do it that way. Oh, they're weak to gun, aren't they? Good battle. <laughs> okay, that please join right me. Now. That won't work. Cool. Oh, it's only specific it ones. Look like it's in the mood for jokes. Save the witty banter for later. Okay, uh, type irritable. Oh, you stunned? Those ones are paralyzed. Oh, God. Yeah, the gun is actually putting in a lot of work, isn't it? Okay, just give him, like, serious answer, apparently. The horoscope scope said I was going to have relationship difficulties. Looks like it came true. I, I don't think on, like, these ones for, like, when you're working out how to get the persona. I, I don't think I mind looking at chat a bit for this. That might just be, like, a universal rule of help me out chat just for capturing them. I don't think I mind that much. People are saying two. There we go. But I'll work out weakness in that myself, but, like, when it comes to capturing them, yeah, it's fine. Chat is guessing too. To be honest, I have no clue what the correct one is. All right. I can feel it. Ambush. Wow, that shadow is crazy. God, the stun's actually so good. Do it. Not over yet. That just keeps stunning them, yeah. It's almost scary how good I am. Oh, that one's not on the ground yet. There we go. It's almost scary how good I am. Uh, just kill it. Pretty good. Okay. Easy win. The threat level see, does not seem to be too much of a problem, see does it? it? It's like already so lowered. Let's just swipe some stuff that we can sell off later. Oh, almost walked into that one. gonna break that one again is this gonna work 
sure. Pinpoint precision. We're just uh, Johnny anime is just too powerful. You cannot stop him. Okay, and that's the Dark Souls shortcut unlocked. It's a Souls like guys. <laughs> Not getting the ambush as well, am I? <laughs> Done. Uh, if I have to guess it's water, it's gonna be electric. Uh, that one's not talking. Let's go. It's just Pokemon. I mean, it has that logic if it looks like it's a certain type. Okay. It's probably just weak. It was so easy, I'm yawning. Yeah, wait for him to turn around. Show me your true form. Now's our chance to stretch. Okay, so this one's weak to electricity. Electricity and win. Go down. Get him, Jack. Looking cool, Joker. Go. Look how much SP we have as well on um, on Johnny as well. That went up so much. For like the counseling session. Pretty good. Okay. Uh. Oh, it, the mask icon appears if you have him as well. I don't even have that guy yet, do I? Yeah, let me your power. Use soothing words. Use soothing words. Do you have time? I forgive. Oh, it's not over. You understand that we are here because of people like you, right? Timid. I understand. Really? What? Would you please just die already? Why you? <laughs> Didn't go too well that time. I don't see a weak spot. Strong this against wind now. Something else. Yup. When in doubt, just gun it out. He took them all out. Pretty good. All right. Huh? That was a little too easy. I see it. it. Was too easy. Stop resisting. <laughs> hey. Be an unknown territory once you go past here, right? Security will probably get a little more fierce as well. Make sure you don't touch anything or run to any of the displays. All right. What are you looking at me for? I love the chill vibe of the second palace. It does seem way more laid back, doesn't it? It doesn't feel as like hostile or anything like that. The music is calm. <laughs> Pretty sure I've heard this music too, just like kind of casually listening to the game soundtrack. Like I wouldn't have thought it would be used here. Hmm? Oh, this feeling. Safe room. Let's get this. I feel like it's going a lot faster compared Let's to the first it. palace, too. Might just be early days at the mo. All right. I can feel it. There's an enemy. Be careful. I'm gonna get him. I'll reveal oh. your true form. Hope the game isn't so hand-holding now. Yeah, it's kind of just letting me go, isn't it? This guy. Okay, uh, this one is weak to electricity. And we know that. Up to you. 
Let's go, Captain! Okay, what are we thinking? Fire or wind? Let's try fire. Technical. Okay, this this one's gonna. Oh no, he's not gonna talk because he's level 15, isn't he? I can't get him to lend uh, his power. I just gotta kill. That's gonna give a lot of XP though if he's level 15. We're punching above our weight. Yeah, there we go. Level up. Jack Frost is getting started to get really strong. New skill suits me. Lucky punch, that's All cool. Right. That was so easy, I'm it. yawning. <laughs> wow, the game's difficulty is really tanked now. I can take him. Shadow. Show me your true form. <laughs> Bringer of misfortune. Look at this guy. He's so cool. Blocks the gun. Not weak to a lot of these. Ryuji's he's, he's okay. Don't know what he's weak to. Medium physical damage to one foe, medium chance of forget. I kind of want to see how much this does. Ready when you are. Crab it. No Get ready. Okay, What's sleep. Up? What's wrong with Morgana? Let's get freaking out over there. I can get uh some other attacks won't work on this one. Oh, physical attacks are just completely immune. Uh, I can try curse. It's time. Wait, do I not have curse anymore? Oh, it's gone. Uh, I must have merged it into something. Yeah, just get the technical. Morgana is enraged. Morgana, no! I got too reckless. I'll back out and focus on support. Persona! He's just immune to physical damage. So we might as well buff. And sleep. Let's go. Uh, I can hit with this one. Angel. Technical. Mm, try it. Just see if it's weak. Block. Fucking hell. Keep going. God, he's strong. Persona. I probably want to go back into... Probably want to go into slime. Just for defense, don't I? High chance of fear. No, I need Jack for, I need Jack for the technical. You're mine. There we go. Jesus fucking Christ. Uh, it might be time for an item. Where's the revive? 
using this. I'm completely asleep. Sorry. Get ready. Persona, ravage them. Got him. We're all locked down. That Serves you right. There we go. Guy's so good if you can get him though. Yeah, because he'd make him immune to physical damage, wouldn't he? That'd be insane. Whoa, a new move. Okay, better fire attack. Okay. There you go. Woohoo! That was hairy. Wow, that was that was a tough one. Uh we'll pop one of them on Morgana. Get some general healing. I have something. And then steal. Ask him the real question as we go. Open up every shortcut here, too. Oh, we need to keep an eye out for the seeds as well here again, don't we? We haven't had to worry about that for a while. This is the new palace. Hmm. Just open it. <laughs> oh, security is absent. <laughs> hey, hey, wait a second. You're just gonna ignore that golden This, this is sheet? obviously a trap. Look at that luster. Oh my god, I know. know. It might be tough to take with us, but don't you think it'd sell for tons? It's a trap. Oh god. Uh, we didn't come here to. Wait, hold on, you're stepping on something. Isn't this bad? Stand back. Oh no, I tripped the security. Uh, you were the one making us be careful, too. So, what do you want to do? Run out of here? Quick aside, is that my knife right now? Like, holy shit, that's massive. Damn cat. Nope, passing through all of these lasers will draw far too many enemies to our location. Oh, hold on. Joker's not trapped. Sorry, Joker, but we're going to need you to search for a way to turn off these infrared lasers. It's up to Johnny Anime. This is a museum, so there has to be some switch to let the workers avoid these lasers. Find it. Like the everything creeping about. Can I get up there? I can just jump down on him if I want. Show me your true form. Might as well. Oh, Morgana's not here to tell us. What was it weak to? It was weak to. Was it fire? It's time. I think it was fire. I think I have fire too. Yo, no, yeah, I thought I used fire. Oh, no, I didn't. Oh. Uh oh. Alright, we're gonna paralyze with our gun. Watch this. <laughs> Problem's up. Really hurt. Okay, persona. I probably want to make sure that like, I'm starting with Jack or something. Focus. Uh, oh, here's the button. Party of two now. Can I go 
over here? I can see it. No, I probably have to go up and around. Oh wait, no, she's not helping right at the moment. Hang on. Come on, on. Seriously, thank you. Okay, now she's coming. She was just gonna stand there. It's somewhere. This is just jump down. Oh, this. Okay, this revealed itself. It's I see somewhere. what's going on. This is a good position. Show me your true form. Let's just get him. <laughs> okay, we're gonna gun Jeez, to victory. Watch this. I don't see a weakness. Persona. Okay, if it's water, maybe it's weak the ice. Let's go. No. No, I should I should always bat and pass because this doesn't take up the move. Light fire to all foes. Try it. Weak. So good. Nothing. Morgana's just watching us fight. Press the button. No. Hey, bud. Hey. Who's like squirming in pain? I keep hearing weird noises. Sorry, that's me. Is this There's a little space between that pain frame and the wall? Oh, okay, there's one here. Yeah. Okay, Ryuji's back. Sorry. And now we're good to go. We can just leave the palace now and never return. Yeah, we're looking for a control room. I can see it. Uh, how do I even get over there again? Bye bye, cat. Honestly, I'm happy to just call it a day. You gotta do a sus. I can feel it. Is there... Is there a vent? <laughs> Oh, there it is. Thanks, gang. Whoa! Can't believe you found a pat like this. Wait. As I was saying, hey Joker, something here I'm wondering about. You played a monk. What's he wondering about? I can't talk to him. Okay, uh, we need to find no. the password. We need someone who might know it. Perfect. It's just like museum staff and that trying to catch us as well. The password's now hello. I said hello, 07734. If you read the numbers upside down, they spell out the word hello. Isn't that a little childish? Should be fine as long as nobody else finds out. It's not like anyone's eavesdropping on us. But anyway, don't forget, when you see the code input, be sure to say hello. Hey. Okay, perfect. We'll just leave them to it. Yeah. Nice. The 
event was peak content. I love the stream right there, honestly. Okay, let's go back and get the cat. I have something. Sorry. That was very much unlike me. Were you the only one? Weren't you the one telling us not to go around touching shit in the exhibit? It's true. I can't believe I made such an obvious mistake even for solid gold. But something was drawing me to this vase. Hmm. What do you mean? Isn't it just an ordinary gold vase? I wonder if there's something special about it. Take a closer look just in case. Oh, is it gonna be like the treasure, but it's in pieces this time or something? What? Wait! Oh god, no, maybe not. For real? That's why I was drawn to it. Joker, catch it! Let's win the rest of this layer, just get after it and attack. Hello? It's dropping a lot of money. Dropping a lot of money. Do I just want to kill it? I gotta just kill it. I don't know if it's weak to anything. But I got this man. There we go. To think you would coerce me into giving it in, how brilliant. My name is... My name is... Uh, Regent. My existence shall become a new part of you. Okay. What exactly is that? I thought it was gonna get, just give me a lot of money. Good, good. That was pretty nice because it was your first time running into one. What was that? That panther was a rare shadow that occasionally resides in pricey items. I call them treasure demons. They're great. Not only do they give you a lot of experience, they might be useful for your personas too. However, they run very fast and attacks don't deal much, very much damage to them. Breakable objects may contain treasure demons, especially when the security level is high. They may also appear in normal encounters. Defeating them will earn you many experience points. If you convince one to become one of your personas, you can use it as a fusion material. However, a treasure demon cannot be used in battle. Okay, right, so I can make a better persona with that. Neat. We'll, uh, we'll use that uh, a in future might then. Be close by. A I should write something. Yeah, God, it, it's moving. I feel like it's moving so much faster compared to the first palace. Just at the rate we're even finding safe rooms. I'm absolutely not complaining. We're supposed to get past this huge hole in the compound. Look where the security guard is walking. Wait, so what's the path? Okay. It's basically a zigzag, yeah. Can I just... No, no, that didn't go the way I thought it was. Alright, they're weak to gun. Looking cool, Joker. Leafy old man. Zona. <laughs> Go down. SB cost reduced. Joker took one out. Alright. Uh, technical with Lucky Bunch on this one. Right, I'm assuming the leafy old man is weak to fire. Pokemon logic. You bastard, what are you making me do? Let's get the old man. It looks scared. Yeah, I won't make you suffer. 
What the hell are you trying to tell me anyway? Why do we fight? I don't really know. Yeah. Hey. Here we go. Leafy old man acquired. Grandpa. <laughs> Your power's incredible, Joker. Student words didn't work last time. No, they didn't really. Okay. Yeah, that's cute. So it was just a painting. An illusion. <sighs> Can't believe I'm in here. I'm sorry, on there might be treasure. Cut it out. Chakra choker. What is what does that do? Mana bonus. Is that like SB? Oh, I need to increase his max SB by 10%. Yeah, okay. Do I want HP or lot well SB or life? Had to tell. I'm trying to get used to some of the controls and the menus too. I feel like I get lost uh, quite often. I kind of want to keep that heal one. The heal one's good. Light wind has been kind of handy. I don't have wind on. Uh, I mean, I have wind on Morgana. Yeah, maybe maybe we just equip it. Give it a go. Show me there your we go. form. You did miss a room by the last safe room. I'll, I'll probably hop back soon. Don't worry. Guys, weep the gun. It's really weak the gun. <laughs> Kill him this time. Everything's weak to gun if you shoot it enough. The new gun we got seems insane. It's like stunning them so much. Okay. They were too weak to bother with. Oh, we didn't we didn't miss a room by that safe room, did we? We missed that little bit there. The earlier one. Oh, okay, yeah. I'll, I'll, I mean, we'll have to go back through here at some point because the game told us that's like, you know, you, you're gonna have to make two tricks basically. Here we go. Looking cool, Joker. Uh, what was that weak to? Bad pass. And I already have one. He's learning. I kind of just want to get more of like the OP abilities from like the counselor and stuff. Actually, even saying that, we haven't actually had that clock in yet, have we? It seems good in theory if it actually activates. Okay. Focus. a cake. Oh, we didn't have the water lady, did we? Just swipe that out. Cruise huh? in the second exhibition room. Apprehend him at once. Yeah. Get out of here. Faster face the exit. Ah, it doesn't seem that bad. Show me your true form. Doesn't seem bad at all, really. You can just kill him. It's only two. That one is no joke. Be careful. Oh, that one's gonna explode, ain't it? I don't 
don't see a weakness. Don't know what they're weak to yet. Not that. Let's get them. Uh, lucky punch. Yeah, Ryuji's got a technical. Keep passing it. There's a fair bit of health to trade just to get it, but my fault. Another one. Okay. Bat and pass. That one's already down. That one does a lot. Just smack him. Persona! Go down! He resists it quite a bit. There we go. Victory! Yeah! Victory! Love Persona, this game brings out the worst in people. <laughs> okay. We defeated them. Oh no. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. What are you what are you I'll saying there? <laughs> Crazy. Okay, we can get him. I'm curious how this game seems relaxed. Like, I'm having like a great time with it. Got him. Dan, you're literally in the metaverse right now. My god, he's must hate it here. He's playing the Facebook game. I probably need to use a healing item next time I get back to the safe room. I would love that treasure. It's somewhere. There we go. Give me you. Remember, the explosion damage depends on how much damage you deal when killing it. Oh, yeah, you're right. Thank you. I keep getting that wrong, yeah. Yes. I gotta just stop, like, randomly shooting it. <laughs> I have something. Oh. Hey. Me play ve video game very good. Resub, anime is cringe. Good to have you here. But you know, you clicked on the stream. I have something. Oh. Welcome to the cringe chum club. Anime chats, yeah. Welcome to the chat maze. It's nice to have you here. What kind of please? This is my okay. first uh, Persona stream. Why is there a gnome with a leaf? There was like an imp like shitting on the toilet as a boss. Yesterday, like honestly, it's not that far fetched. Focus. It's not that far fetched. I think we've seen like way worse already. Shadow. Okay, let's dodge him if we can here. Joker. 
pick this up. Relax, gel. There's a little inside room there. Uh, on, you might want to, like, stand back or something. She just doesn't care. It's somewhere. Thankfully, he, that security guard was blind. So we got away with it. One of Madarame's will Oh, nice! I'm surprised we found the first one already. Yeah, we're really moving a lot faster compared to before. We're going so quick. This is going to restore all our SP, too. Our first will seed of the palace. Let's keep searching the area. It's going so well. There was one there. I'll reveal your true form. <laughs> yes, yes, there is. All right, the first move is ours. Go ahead. All right, okay, got the time. Yeah, 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 Oh, but the technical technicals on these ones, ain't it? Oh, I know. This one's just technical because it's paralyzed. Cool. Let's go, Captain. You did it, Skull. This is a holdup. You bastard! What are you making me do? All right. Kill. Just regular attack for no HP cost. Oh, okay. They're just kind of weak to physical then. What do you think? Adverse resolve. Increases critical rate when surrounded. It seems very specific. Okay. That's if, like, I fuck it up, basically. Uh, how do I go to the other floor? It's the other floor. That's the room I missed before. I'm gonna go back and just get a quick... Ah, no, keep going, keep going. I'll get a healing soon. There'll be one up here. It's a good time to use the one that's like 50% like for all allies if I find a safe room. I can see it. Yeah, there's a safe room right there, you know. Absolutely calculate it. Whoa! Don't you think that shiny building over there is kind of suspicious? This is amazing! Wow, it's even gaudier than the rest of his museum. Definitely looks like something very important would be hidden away in there. Let's go. Go find out. Just one second, gang. Whoa. Whoa. Just. Whoa. All right, sure. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Whoa. The hell? Are these infrared lasers? There's no way we can get past them. This level of security only proves there's something worth protecting up ahead. Oh, this is the door in his house, isn't it? Wait, there's something written on the sign. All personnel, this door can only be opened via the security room that lies beyond it. So we're going to have to go back and change it. Please be cautious as it is impossible to open from the outside. So it's never going to open? How are we supposed to get past? The window. Wait, that door. I think I've seen that pattern somewhere. We're just gonna throw like a brick through his window, Ryuji. Oh, right. There's no mistaking it. That's the same door I saw earlier. Could you imagine if that's how they work? Like, okay, Phantom Thieves, let's send the calling card. And they just like... Just like Kamoshida is just in P-Class, they just chuck a brick at his head. <laughs> it's like, ah, oh, what the fuck? It's like, yeah, that'll teach you. Don't mess with the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> He's like actually just down on the ground already, like completely unconscious. 
a way better solution. I mean, it just gets to the point of what we're trying to achieve, doesn't it? You never saw it coming. The fucking, like, bootleg Phantom Thieves. It lines up with the songs as well. Like, last surprise, and then, like, take over. We're forcing an entry. <laughs> take over. Matarame's just trying to hold back the door to, like, his shack. He's like, no, please stop. Take over. Like, Yusuke, bar the windows. <laughs> Guys, let's head back. Huh? Why? I think I know what real world door that's based on. There may be another way to open it. It's time to boogie Ninjas. down. I'll explain later. Come on, let's go. No, no, we need to get the safe room. So should we listen to Morgana for the time being? No, get the safe room. Let's head back. Don't head home yet. Don't head home. Thank God. I guess I'm not gonna need the heal then, am I? This looks I'm not gonna need to heal yet. I'll just add this. Uh, we can quickly check out the other room. And we're here. Focus. What do you want to do now? Come on. I spotted a shadow, Joker. I have something. That's great. A shadow. Yeah, Be careful. Him. I'll reveal oh, your true not form. See it. Box it. All right. The first move is ours. Ooh. Looking cool, Joker. Yo. All right, here, pop the baton and follow up. Coming. Let's see that again, Panther. Serves you. Got right. him down. Kinda sad we don't get to hear much of the song because we're killing them so fast. <laughs> Music is so good in this game. Alright. But like we're ripping through so the battles easy. here. I'm yawning. Atom ring. Okay, what does that do? Pray, a small small ring charged by nuclear power? Oh yeah, we gotta try that. It's somewhere. We have to give that a go. Are you kidding me? Uh, how do I get up here? Launch the nuke. It's somewhere. I think I might be missing something obvious here. Quick help me out, chat. How do I actually get up there? There's a vent. Uh, where is the vent? Is it in this room or is it like back out in the previous room? Got to we gotta suss it out. Show me your true form. There's a grapple outside the room. Cool. Okay, we'll get it. Alright. The first move is ours. Looking cool, Joker. Do it. It's not over yet. Persona. Coming. Well, we're leaving soon, so we can be like quite liberal with our abilities here. We gotta head back in a mo. Oh, I gotta use the nuke. Yeah, sorry. Next fight. Liberal. Thought this wasn't a political stream, Daniel. Oh, it's past this guy, ain't it? Show me your true form. 
I should have healed. I really should have healed. It's okay, we have a new. He's weak to nuke. Perfect. That's a lot of HP we got. Okay, let's buff the new. Attack up. Sleep. I got him. Bigger new. I believe most things are weak to new characters. Not cockroaches, they resist. Damn it. I don't have much health left. Don't think so. We've gone reveal the truth of the fog. Put your hands up, Sarge. Take all the best. Yes, I know. How about this? Oh, no. Persona, you're mine. His legs are in trouble. Serves you right. Do it. Thank God we got the nuke ability. That's so cool. All right. Seems quite strong. Shadow defeated. Now let's push forward. Oh, what an idea! It's a big vent. What have you done, Daniel? What in God's Let's name have you done? Must I can something feel it. Good inside. Fire Magatama. Oh, that was... We got one of those items before. We got them... Because of, like, the DLC stuff, didn't we? Okay, uh, are we done? I feel like we might be. Yep. Uh, leave the palace. Is there, like, a way for me to just leave the palace automatically? Go back to a safe room, I guess. Do I have to just consult the team? Talk to them. Well. That's our progress. There's nothing we'll be able to do without security in place. That's a treat for now. Yeah. Okay, so let's uh, hop on out. What are your thoughts? Oh, if I just, like, if I just fast travel to the entrance. Yeah, that works too. Okay, did we get the persona they wanted? I don't think we did. We did get this guy, though. Who we can put into something. Um, and I should probably just have a cheeky look what else I can fuse while we're going. Something. We might as well give it a go. You need to fuse anyway, yeah. We've stocked up on Justine, Persona. You want to register it? Are you sure? Register a new Jack Frost. This? Okay, create a new Persona? Needs our guidance. Let's fusion. Can you gather them up? Yeah, we're probably never going to use the Advanced Fusion. Like, unless we specifically get the ones here. It's quite unlikely we'd have it. <laughs> Look at this dude. It's Nicolas Cage. Fusion. Let us begin the search. There's a lot of them you can make with the big one. Phoenix sounds cool, but level 21. 
I can make it a new chariot. Wait, was the ame there? Oh, it is! Uh, okay, not that one. I'm Justice. You okay with this? Sweet. That is the one we needed. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Personas possess unique properties known as traits. Traits are capable of being inherited during fusion. If you make use of this properly, you could very well conclude with a nigh unstoppable persona. If some special traits cannot be inherited. In any case, only one trait can be inherited during fusion, so choose wisely. Oh, it needs to have fray. Does it? Oh no, that means Jack Frost has to get be consumed. You okay with this? Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Does Jack Frost not have it? No one has fray. Not terrible, but not impressive. How do I get fray? You okay with this? Jack don't have it. It's on your accessory. Oh, it's the nuke, is it? You okay with this? You okay with this? Is there not a nuke terrible. persona? Not terrible, but not not terrible, but not in not terrible, but not impressive. It's the nuke dog. Okay, so I need to get one of the dogs and then fuse them into this. Okay, so don't do it yet. Looks pretty tough. The fuck is this guy? I see. Oh, I can make the archangel. Indeed. Do we want to make a, a strong archangel? I don't want to fuse the counselor one. Looks pretty tough. Yeah, I can I can use the fancy one for this. Select the skills you'd like okay, to Okay, so strengths physical skills by skills by 20. Damage after a baton pass strengths magical skills targeting all foes by 20. Increases technical damage. Oh, those those are all really good. Which we thinking? Wait, make Orpheus. Why is everyone saying Orpheus? You okay with this? Well, this thing. You okay with this? That's DLC. Okay, no, I, I was gonna make the Archangel. Could do an Orpheus as well. I, I don't think those impressive. ones are exclusive. Yeah, we can do both of them. Yeah, we're, 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 we're earning it, even if it's a DLC one. I, I think it's fine. Okay. Which one do we think here? We're gonna do them both. What ability? Like physical damage, bat, bat and pass. Physical strength is good. I mean, would that increase like the gun as well? This guy does actually have higher strength, so yeah, you probably want to use him for strength. You'd like to inherit. Yeah, it's a physical attacker. Okay. What skills do you want to inherit? Oh my god. Holy shit, it gets like everything. Light nuke to all foes. Light psychic damage. Okay, we want to get the nuke. People are saying Mapsy is one. Uh, and what other ability do we want? We could just get like a uh, light bless to all foes. Chance of inflicting shock on that one too. You don't have much access to psychic throughout the game. Okay, so that one's quite good then. Um, yeah, let's get blast for variety because that just hits its them up. power will be nothing unusual. Go ahead. Now for a rebirth. Yeah, so this, this guy seems quite strong. Yeah, so the treasure ones are, seem very valuable. We have an archangel now. We're getting some cool ones. You 
You okay with okay, this? and people really wanted me to get this one too. This persona born within one who held a fate outside of that of your tale of rebellion. However, that persona still bears the power of its original owner. It shall be of great help to you. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Increases chance of inflicting burn. Revives with one HP when KO'd, usable four times per battle. That seems quite good. Yeah, that, that means I'm not going to die like as often. As long as I have it equipped. And then I can still inherit some abilities too. Uh, light physical damage at sleep was really good. Increases defense. Uh, just take a lunge. It will receive a fraction of power. Okay, yeah, we're gonna then try let it. Us begin. Give it a go. Okay, and it's getting a lot of fire ones as well. Yeah, geez, this gives a lot of variety. Restores 50% HP and increases attack defense. For fucking hell, that's strong. Okay, that might be a bit much. <laughs> heal everyone. Boost every stat the heal. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't think any of us saw that. I don't think any of us saw that one. Are we looking at our personas? Yeah, we got justice. What path do you want? Not terrible. We can get uh, uh, onion pretty. dude. No, we d I don't think I want onion dude because uh, of what it costs. I see. We can get the long it's dogs by fusing the archangel. And I don't think there's any need for that. I don't think I want to lose Jack Frost. You okay with this? Who's this dude? He's tanky. But, oh, he'd also take Eat Orpheus immediately. I, I'm gonna have to try it for at least one battle. I'm gonna try it for at least one. Onion Dude okay also will eat Orpheus, I think. No, uh, Onion you Dude okay eats, uh, eats everything. Don't wanna do him. Not terrible. This but is the impressive. ice one. I don't think there's anything else I want to do there right now. You change your mind? You'd like to read the compendium? Are you finished? What? Okay. No slacking off. It's a DLC persona, but he earned it instead of getting it for free from the registry. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm assuming it's okay. That that heal ability does seem a little strong, though. It costs a lot of SP, which I guess is the trade-off. I mean, we're just gonna try it out, gang, right? Like, we're just gonna try it out. Like, it's just a game at the end of the day. Well then. Yeah, I gotta leave here. I mean, we got as far as we possibly could. Well, I think we're almost halfway through. I'm starting to get a faint sense of the treasure near here. Like, yeah, we've moved really quick on this one. Oh. That means we're at least making some progress, right? Hey, what do you want to... When do you want to come here near next? Let me know when you decide. I'll be waiting. How are we supposed to get past that door? I don't know. You think there's some kind of off switch somewhere? A brick. In the window. Looks like this is where I come in. Just throw a brick. Mona? I have a suspicious place in mind. Remember? This shack is the basis for Madarame's palace. I actually scouted it out the last time we were here. Oh, so this was your plan from the start? Correct. You only went scouting because you were bored. It's true. Where's this suspicious place? It's on the second floor. 
I noticed an unnaturally hefty lock on a door up there. Use a brick. If it's locked, that means there's something in there he doesn't want people to see. But don't we want to be opening the door in the palace? Yes. And we're going to do that by opening the real one in front of Madarame's eyes. Basically, we're going to change his cognition that the door is unopenable. In other words, when we open the one in Madarame's house, that area in his palace will open on its own? Inception, but we gotta take a pit stop. I'm not really getting it. Uh, is that gonna work? Trust me, there's no chance it won't open. I think. You understand, don't you, Joker? Uh, I understand brick. Well, yeah, but... Why don't you trust me? It's worth a try. But even then, there's still that Break in. we have to deal with Take reality, over right? the home. Ugh, oh, that'll be a breeze. Just give me a hairpin and I'll handle it. It will take some time, though. Doing everything by myself in front of Madarame would be impossible. If only there was someone who could distract him for a while. Huh? Oh, no. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Man, how are we even going to get into his house? <laughs> We'd get reported for sure if we force ourselves in. What? I guess the only way is <laughs> having you go nude. What? Fancy you say that, Ryuji. I was just thinking the same thing. Like, we love Ryuji, right? But please, no. Please, no. We don't love Morgana. saying you should really get naked it's simply the best excuse for you to enter Madarame's house without raising suspicions so we'd like for you to play the role of decoy lady on this is way too sudden i mean i don't even know where the locked door is i'm just saying we could use the brick don't worry i'll accompany you but that's still technically only me worst comes to worst what if i get found out we can run into the palace or something. Is that really gonna work? I mean, you're not giving me much confidence in this plan. There's a building made of bricks just down the road. Do I have to be the bait? The brick. Hey! Why aren't you saying anything? Lighten up. It ain't gonna be so bad. All you gotta do is trick Yusuke, have him take you to that room, then just open the door. You make it sound so easy. But if there's no other way... I there is another way! <laughs> Use Morgana as a brick! A uh, God! Fine, I'll do it! For justice! Oh no. Seriously, you better pull this off. If it's for your sake, Lady On. I won't stop scratching even if all my claws were to break. I hope they do, Morgana. We'll be counting on you, Morgana. Don't let Yusuke notice you, all right? If he tries to force my clothes off, I'll tear that house down. Just use the nuke. <laughs> I'm really going to lose it if we do all this and the palace door doesn't open. Got it? Yeah, the door won't survive the nuke. We're working to get dirt on that guy's crimes either way. It won't go to waste. All right, let's get down and dirty tomorrow. Tomorrow? Earlier the better. Um, but Oh no, no, uh, tomorrow's will Sunday. Tagawa kun agree? I don't know. Just say something like I really It's Tuesday. No. No, That's Ryuji. What? Ryuji, no. Not tomorrow. Okay. Leave this to me. I'll get it open right before his very eyes. Get in touch with Yusuke. He asked me to come by tomorrow. Oh yeah, he fell for it. Do I really have to do this? <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, Jesus. This is such a pain. We gotta open that door and have Madarami see it. Why? You gotta say that will change his cognition. I don't get it. Oh, one more thing. Let us know if any weird shit goes down. <laughs> Now, there's some weird shit happening right now, Ryuji. A palace is a reflection of how its owner views the real world. 
So if Madarame's cognition of reality changes, it's only natural that his palace would be affected. And all jokes aside, we really will need Lady On to strip for Yusuke. It's the only way. Jesus Christ. Hopefully it's not. Oh my god, the damn cat's not gonna let me leave again. This cat is the worst. This cat is the worst. Check the fridge. I live in hope that someday there's gonna be like something in it. Hey, hey! Study. I'm not studying. Nope. Hey, hey! Plant needs nutrients. Premium plant nutrient for those who want serious care for their plants. Pretty good. Yes. It's pretty good. Okay, uh, we can make some tools or we can watch a DVD. Oh. Uh, we might as well watch the DVD. You need to study. Uh, you think I go out with her? What do I look like? What? You liar! You told me you loved me just last night! There's a show about young adults set in the ritzy upscale neighborhood of Bubbly Hills. They all sound pretty chad on that program. <laughs> <sighs> this is what high schoolers are like overseas, don't get any ideas, alright. Hey, hey! I really felt their desperate need to be loved by someone! Morgana knows that the most hated character. Yeah, Morgana's fully aware. It's like, oh yeah, I can relate to that show. <laughs> hmm. Well then. Oh god. Now I want to go home. I don't want to go to school. This sucks. I'm so tired every day. I don't want to go to work. Everyone. Oh jeez, are there any breaks coming up? This is just real life now. God almighty. Well then. Then Lady Ann and I will head over to Matarami's house. On, we're gonna. We're counting on you. Me and him are banned from going there, so all we can do is wait here. Yeah, we're just gonna sit tight, enjoy the afternoon. No, you two have something different you'll need to do. Oh. What do you mean? You have to wait inside the palace. Once that door opens, sneak in and look for some kind of control room. We need to make sure the door can't close anymore after it's open. Okay. Oh, I get it. Okay, you can leave that to us. So it's only going to be two of us in the palace this time. To think you'd really come. I assumed you were lying when you contacted me. I'm sorry it was so sudden. Oh, it's not a problem. Oh, God. But, as I told you yesterday, Sensei will be returning in about 20 or 30 minutes. So, um, I'm sorry if that causes some anxiety on your part. That's why I'm here today, damn it! What was that? Oh, no! It was nothing! By the way... Have you gained some weight? What? <laughs> you think so? I weigh the same as always. Maybe I'm bloated today. <laughs> Fucking Joey from Friends here. So then, can you, um, get ready here? I need to take my clothes off, right? Yes, please. I'm embarrassed. Uh, could you look the other way? <sighs> this is gonna take some time. <laughs> oh. Yusuke, no! Just be an artist! Phew, that was tight. Tight? No. I'm doing this for art. Come on, Yusuke. Don't look over here, okay? Just be an artist. Coming back soon, right? 
Jesus Christ. I believe so. Hmm. Do you think we could do this somewhere else then? A little more atmosphere would be lovely. Well, this should be good enough. But wouldn't a room with a lock be a bit better? A lock? <laughs> Must a girl say more? Oh, Jesus. But the only one with a lock is Sensei's room. Oh shit, he's then gonna open why it. Why not there? I can't intrude. Besides, I don't have the key. But you do have a brick, Yusuke. <sighs> he says he doesn't have the key. It's okay. That's why I'm here. I'll just use this hairpin. Takamaki-san, are you about... You were wearing all this? <laughs> Don't you think it's cold today? <laughs> I suppose so. The sun is starting to set. He's so oblivious. Right? That's why a change of location would be nice. I mean, I'm gonna take it all off. True. It might make for a better picture if I can brighten my model's mood. Thank God. Yeah, his heart's in the art. Uh-huh. That's right. She may even be willing to try out various expressive poses for use in a dynamic composition. It's a bit oblivious. W what kind of poses? You was good. Oh, be careful. Leon, you have to act. Get back in character. <clears throat> Let's go. I was just starting to get in the mood. Oh, no. Wait. If you wander around, Sensei will... Oh, it's so hot. We really can't use any other room. Oh, dear. Hey, why not this one? Please wait! Get the brick. I'm counting on you, Mona. Counting on you, Mona. <laughs> Hang on, that wasn't quite the sound effect I wanted. Hang on. <laughs> Counting on you, Mona. <laughs> okay, we're in, gang. Are they seriously gonna be able to pull this off? She was saying stuff like, I'll just seduce him with my acting, but that sounds out of her league. Oh, Jesus. Plus, we ain't got one sign this place is gonna open. Isn't Matarame coming home soon? On top of that, even if Mona's able to unlock the door, how's he gonna show it to Matarame? And then even if they do show it open, any normal person would just close it right up again. That's the point of the brick. Doesn't that mean we only got a few seconds to get in? You punched the hole. To be blunt, won't it be a miracle if this works? It'll definitely work. I wanna think that too, but... It's almost time. <laughs> go, go, gadget oh, assault please, and can fast you wait and <laughs> Just to tear down the fucking door. What's past here? That's... So the door Mona mentioned is up ahead. I keep telling you, you can't! You're still not done? It's hard to do this with cat paws. Oh, no. Uh, is something the matter? Oh, um... So, what is this room? It's a storage area for old paintings. Storage? Oh, it's like old paintings from his students, the rejected ones. Hey, Kitagawa-kun. Why don't we do it in here? Oh, Jesus. I won't be embarrassed if we go somewhere nobody can find us. We're talking about painting. Only Sensei can go in there. Please. I want 
gonna be alone with you. The talking about painting. Somewhere like quiet. <laughs> you know, where we won't get interrupted. There's a lot of outside distractions when you produce art, you know? Is he really going to buy that terrible act? Stay focused. Hmm? <laughs> you skate the tier three so. <laughs> Frustrating that my feelings aren't getting through to you. To the canvas. Kitagawa-kun, do you not like girls like me? Painting them on the canvas. No, th that's not true. How is that working on him? Please, we can continue this inside. Oh, gotta hurry the fuck up. <laughs> sure. I mean, no, we can't go in there. Uh, it's locked anyway, so... Fine. This is too embarrassing. I'm leaving. But... Let's just do it in here, okay? The arse. What do I do? I'm home. Oh, thank God. Just sensei Yusuke? All right, it's open. Huh? What are you doing there? It's it's not what it looks like. Got him. What? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> oh no, he's gone. <laughs> he's he's been abducted. <laughs> okay, quickly, Morgana, initiate the plan. There. <laughs> uh, nothing's happening. I wonder what's. Hmm? It's off. They seriously did it. We're in. <laughs> A brick works wonders. Yeah, for real. Let's go. Okay, so only a party of two now. All right. Find the control room quick. The path's gonna close up if we dick around for too long. But it's just gonna be me and you for a bit if we run into any enemies. You good? Let's kick some tail. Yeah. Can't say kick ass. It's up to the boys. Hey. I gotta go forward as well. I can't save it now. I should have saved it before. That's fine. Damn it already. Hey, what do you want to do? Gotta beat it. Hey. Real problem is the fact that we just gotta handle this with just the two of us. Anyway, it's so time up to you, dude. Sorry. Who are you? See that attire? You must be the thieves who dare threaten Lord Matarame. Oh, he's a bit spooked. Pest security system? You cannot go any further. You are trespassing on Lord Matarame's territory. You guys ain't got nothing on us. I'm more scared of screwing up and having on yell at me. Let's get him. Security shadow. We have no idea Persona. what he's weak to. But I'm gonna try the new. Skull cracker. <laughs> Jesus. Makes sense he'd use it on Skull. Persona! Ha! No way! Persona! Go down! Ha! Yeah, he's really trying to crack him open. Persona! Ha! Okay, try the gun. getting kind of low. Uh, let's just pop something here. This one. There you go, Ryuji. It's time. Oh yeah, we gotta try out our new one. 
You got two of them. Light fire damage, medium fire damage to all foes. Oh, that works. I don't think that was too strong there. That was just specific because it was weak to it. You know, it's gonna do more damage. Still seem pretty good though. <laughs> we'll try it in another battle. <sighs> Things real tough when it's just you and me. Be paying the ass. We got spotted anyway. Again. Anyways, let's go get the security system. Takamaki san, this is bad. Are these the lights? <gasps> oh. What the? Isn't this Sayuri? Why are there so many of them? Oh God. I have no idea. Get out! Sensei, what is the meaning of this? I suppose I can't keep quiet now that you've seen this. Oh no, it's multiple copies of the NFT. He is on the blockchain! Truth be told, I'm in severe debt. And it's because he invested in the apes! <laughs> I handmade these Sayuri copies and have been selling them through a special connection of mine. But why? The real Sayuri was stolen by one of my pupils long ago. I assume they begrudged my strictness. They right-clicked and saved the image. That moment was quite a shock for me. Since then, I've been mired in a terrible artist block. Because of this distress, some of my pupils handed their ideas over to me from time to time. <sighs> I knew I couldn't keep that up. So I attempted to recreate the Sayuri a number of times. However, it resulted in nothing more than replicas. That's when someone came to buy the paintings, knowing well they weren't original. It's the blockchain. It's all my fault. I couldn't pay the price of being famous. As expectations for me rose, it reached a point where I had no choice but to keep making them. I needed money to further your talents. I ask that you Please forgive your cowardly teacher. Please, don't. He's, he's manipulating you, 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 Yusuke. Hold on, something doesn't add up. He's just gaslighting. If the original painting got stolen, how did you make copies of it? I happened to find a finely detailed photograph of it in an art book. So you managed to sell copies of a photo of the original? I'm not sure how this works, but don't people who buy paintings generally have a keen eye for the fine arts? It's fake art. Mm, this sounds like a lie to me. What would you know? Okay, Morgana, here we go. Initiate the plan. <laughs> The real one. This. This is the real Sayuri. But you just said a moment ago that it was stolen. That's a replica. No, it's nothing of the sort. This painting kept me going. It's the reason I made it this far. Sensei, don't tell me. It's fake. Yes, a counterfeit. I heard there was a counterfeit spreading around, so I bought it. He's still lying. So you're telling me the actual artist behind the painting bought a counterfeit? That's pushing it. You're lying, Sensei. Please, just tell us the truth. You too? Oh. I've reported you to my private security. <laughs> oh no, he's gonna sue us. I had it set up to deal with some problematic paparazzi, but I never thought it'd come in so handy. Please, wait. Let's talk about this. You can talk all you want to the police. That includes you, Yusuke. Lady On, let's run! Let's just go. A cat! Where did it... 
There's no point. They'll be here within two minutes. Takamaki-san. Yeah, let's go. Meanwhile, let's hurry up and get that shit shut off. Everything's going so well here. It's somewhere. So quickly, escape into the metaverse. Uh, there's a door there. Can I open this? Okay. Hey, look! This is the room, so which one's for security? Uh, I think it's the one that's on. Disengage in security protocol. All right. And the lasers in the courtyard should be off for good. It's mission complete. Come on, let's get out of here. Hey, who's there? Whoa! Crap, let's make a run for it. Alright! It's like the security's totally off. Get back and meet up with the others. They're gonna come in here to hide. To get away. No! Oh! <clears throat> Yusuke's here too! I thought I was gonna die. Uh, hey, uh, will you let go already? Oh no! No idea what's going on. Push him so hard. Are you okay? Wake the, up! The brick. It worked. <laughs> Who are you all? It's me! Kamaki-san, that means you two are... I don't recall ever seeing this cat costume before, though. What is this? It's just so matter-of-fact. <laughs> We're inside Madarame's heart. Inside Sensei's heart? I'm sorry, Takamaki-san, but are you sure you're feeling okay? She ain't lying. This is what that bastard truly feels. He's nothing but a greed-filled money-grubber. Enough of this rubbish! Kitagawa-kun, didn't it cross your mind that something wasn't right about Madarame? <sighs> well, I mean, he had that locked door with, like, thousands of copies of the same painting that was supposedly stolen. But outside of that... You may not want to believe it, but this is another reality as viewed through Madarame's eyes. Is he honestly not seeing this? This is his true He nature. probably just thinks he's tripping drugs. It's easier to explain to people. It's just drugs. This repulsive world? Just who are all of you? I guess you could say we're a group that changes the hearts of wrong crooks. If everything you say is true, then the sensei I know doesn't exist. We're hashtag the Chatamis. You want to be a Chad like us? You gotta snap out of it. Still, he has kept me safe these past 10 years. My gratitude for that won't just disappear. You're gonna forgive him? At this rate, you'll... Are you okay? I'm trying to be rational about this, but my emotions are overwhelming me. Sorry, but we don't have time to dawdle. The security level's gone through the roof. We need to get out of here at once. Uh, let's just carry him out. No, it's all right. We need to get out of here. That said, we have an amateur with us now. Let's try to avoid fighting as much as possible. Sure. He's just kind of weird with, with us. He doesn't have like a weapon or anything. <laughs> Poor Yusuke. He's doing his best. So this is inside of Sensei's heart? A vain museum such as this? Just go for a run. Uh, this painting! Do you recognize it? We were thinking these might be his past pupils or something. But why are there paintings of them here? Technically, those aren't actually paintings. They're the pupils themselves. Madarame saw as objects, so that's what they are in here. Oh, and uh, we found yours too. You heard of non-fungible tokens, Yusuke. 
<gasps> we'll talk more later. For now, let's get out of here. Oh. The exit is right there. <laughs> oh, he's here. We haven't actually Clovis. seen him in here yet. What the? <laughs> Talk about bullshit clothes. First a king, now some kind of shogun. Welcome to the museum of the master artist, Madarame. Huh? Sensei? Is that you? S solid gold. That attire. Disgusting. This... This is all one big lie, isn't it? My usual ragged attire is nothing but an act. Besides a famous person living in that shack, I have another home under a mistress's name. Oh shit. I'm almost impressed, but not quite. Hmm. Such insincerity. If the Sayuri was stolen, why was it in the storage room? And if you had the real one, why make copies? If it's really you, Sensei. Please tell me. Why didn't you just move the paint somewhere else? Especially if he had it in their home. Foolish child, you still don't see? Painting being stolen was just a false rumor I spread. It was all a perfectly calculated staging. What do you mean? Let me see. How does this sound? I found the real painting, but it can't go public. You can have it for a special price, though. Oh. Haha! <laughs> How's that for preferential treatment? Art snobs will eat it up and pay good cash at that. What if one art snob talks to another art snob? Well, they like realize, like, wait a minute. No. The value of art is purely illusion. What's the matter with providing that illusion to eager customers? Literally NFTs. <laughs> Literally how NFTs are working. Though I doubt a brat like you would ever come up with such a brilliant scheme. You keep going on and on about money this, money that. No wonder you ended up with this disgusting museum. You're supposed to be an artist, right? Aren't you ashamed of plagiarizing other people's work? Art is nothing but a tool. A tool to gain money and fame. Also NFTs. You helped me greatly as well, Yusuke. God, piss me off. But what about the people who believe in you? Who think you're a master artist? I'll tell you this alone, Yusuke. If you wish to succeed in this world, I'd advise you don't rise against me. You can't stop my apes. Do you believe anyone could find success with my objection holding them down? <laughs> to think I was under the care of this wretched man. You thought I took you in out of the goodness in my heart? Plucking talented yet troubled artists allows me to find promising pupils and take their ideas. After all, it's much easier to steal the futures of children who can't fight back. Jesus Christ. I can't believe this. Livestock are killed for their hide and meat. This is no different, you fool. But I tire of this little chat. It's time that I... I'm gonna kill him at least three times. It's all right. You are unforgivable. Mm. It doesn't matter who you are. I won't forgive you! It's like... Go, Yusuke! <laughs> so, you repay my keeping you around for all these years with ingratitude? Then, dispose of these thieves! Get back! How amusing. Oh. Huh? <laughs> it seems the truth is stranger than fiction, huh? Kitagawa-kun? I wanted to believe it wasn't true. I had clouded my vision for so long. My eyes were truly blind. Blind and unable to see the true self behind this one horrible man. Oh, here we go. 
about to have a persona moment. Come to your senses. <laughs> How foolish to have averted your eyes from the truth. A deplorable imitation. You're gonna persona all over the place. It's mercy in time. <laughs> Let us now forge a contract. <laughs> I am thou, thou art I. Oh, Jesus. The world is filled with both beauty and vice. It is time you teach people which is which. Very well. Come. Go him on! He took ripping out his eyes a lot easier than most. A breathtaking sight. Imitations they may be, but together they make a fine spectacle. Though the flowers of evil blossom, be it known, abominations are fated to perish! He's an art student. Whoa, this is impressive! <laughs> Who do you think you are? The price for your insolence will be death! Where are my guards? Kill them all! The children who adored you as father. The prospects of your pupils. We get to replace Morgana How now. Did you trample upon? Madarame bad, but Morgana worse. Riches? No matter what it takes, I will bring you to justice. See what you're made of. Very well, bring it on. Oh, there's a lot of them. You are in the presence of Lord Marame. On your knees, intruders. Morgan is gone. Yes. I learned much from you, Marame. In order to see authenticity, one must be dispassionately realistic. With Goemon by my side, I can now ascertain your true self without any reservations. Here we go, Persona. Medium physical damage to one foe increases accuracy. Light ice damage to one foe. Got him, Yusuke. Let's go. Go again. It's up to you. I don't think I'm gonna be able to kill him in one go. I can try. I don't see a weakness. Maybe it's electric. No. Unfortunate. Headbutt. Oh, skull. You're pathetic. Morgana changed his chew quick. Wow, you're doing great. Oh, you're pathetic. What's his gun? Oh my god, he's just got an assault rifle. Yeah, they're weak, they're weak than you. Oh, he wasn't weak to fire, that's right. Let's go. Giant slice. Powers up after bat and pass that one. Unfortunate. <laughs> just smack him down. Morgana is gone. Just thrown your bright future down the drain. I'll destroy every chance you've ever had of becoming an artist. Matarame. You'll forever rue the day you 
dared defy me? Get back here! Kitagawa-kun! Why can't I move? Oh. Listen, you're totally drained. You can't do much even if you wanted to. What a disgrace I am. Just have some dinner, Yusuke. You'll be all right. Come on, just listen to her. Yeah, it's like, just, just come, come on, Yusuke. It's going to be all right. What was that noise? You've known for quite some time, haven't you? I'm no fool. Strange people have been coming by for years. And the plagiarism was an everyday affair. But who would want to admit that the man they owed their life to was doing such terrible things? Why didn't you leave, Kitagawa-kun? Well, he is the one who painted the Sayori. On top of that, I owe him a great debt. You mean because he raised you? I never knew my father. I was told my mother raised me by herself, but she died in an accident when I was three. Oh, no. That's when Sensei took me in. I heard he helped my mother while she was still alive. Heard? To be honest, I don't remember much about my mother either. I did everything I could for Sensei. I thought of him as a father. But he changed. To think he would treat the Sayori, the very foundation of his art, like that. A lot's happened to you, huh? When you had mentioned plagiarism, deep down, I it's knew you were gonna be okay, right. Yusuke. That's why I so vehemently denied you. I was simply running from the truth. <laughs> it's like illusion of choice. You have to understand. I'm grateful for the chance to face what I've been denying all this time. Imagine the dialogue option at that point. It was like, fuck you. <laughs> it's all good. You're way too serious, man. That's why you're always getting stuck in your own head. Look at me. I just go with the flow. There's nothing going on in my head, Yusuke. For real. Jeez. Oh, Hang on, Morgana. I'm not done with that brick. What are you going to do now? I don't know. We can't help the fact that Madarame's gone and changed. But we can change his heart. We'll make him pay for his crimes. Yeah, we'll explain all this persona business later. That reminds me. You mentioned something about that change of heart earlier. Have you heard the rumors? The ones about the phantom thieves that steal hearts? <laughs> Don't tell me. Oh. Oh, crap. We'll talk later. We need to scram. When did my clothes change? You just noticed. noticed that now? Save it for after. Let's go! Quickly shuffle out. We're all good. I see. And because of that, this PE teacher's had a change of heart. <laughs> Morgana's just locked in the bag right now. That's close. He's trying to get out. Phantom thieves who steal hearts. To think they truly exist. Right in front of you. Indeed. Well, I have to believe your words. Especially after seeing a world like that. So, your plan with Madarame, Sensei. With Madarame. Is to force a change of heart, correct? Let me join, as a member of the Phantom Thieves. And Morgana never escaped the bag again. Had I faced reality sooner, this may have been avoided. I must put an end to this, for the sake of the others whose futures as artists were robbed as well. That is the most civil thing I can do for the man who was, in some manner, my father. Civil, huh? Sounds fine to me. We're gonna deal with Madarame anyways. He may have a mental shutdown if we screw up. We have ways to prevent that, but they aren't fail-safe. Remember how we mentioned this on our way here? Madarame is a man who has the art world under his thumb. He has connections to many organizations. 
Let me just zip that bag back up. Sorry there, gang. You were saying, Yusuke. If someone like me raises my voice, it'll only be snubbed out. We have no option but this. Kitago-kun. It's a deal, then. We have a new member in the Phantom Thieves now. I hope we get along, Yusuke. You better not slow us down. I'll do my best. Oh, <laughs> no nude paintings. We, we, have, we have a rule against that, Yusuke. Uh, so that was all a plan. Oh, that's quite daring, Takamaki-san. It wasn't my idea. It was theirs. What else were we supposed to do? It's his fault for going on and on about the nude modeling thing. I haven't given up on that yet, though. Oh, no, Yusuke, no. <laughs> He's doubling down. <laughs> Oh, that reminds me. I wonder what's going on with the real Matarame. Yusuke and I were in a pretty tight situation. Brickham lads. <laughs> Actually, I contacted him before we came here. He believes that I continued pursuing Takamaki-san. And just as you all explained, it appears he knows nothing about his shadow. What did he say? He was complaining to the security company how they couldn't even catch one high school girl. However, he's still furious about it and said that he's going to take legal action against everyone. He's actually gonna sue us, oh no. Talk about being completely on guard. Legal action? He's acting way too desperate. Maybe he still has more secrets. If he were to act, it'd be after the exhibit is over. Any scandal during the show would be his loss. Right when I think the talk about being a nude model is over, this happens? Ah, uh, no, that bit's over. We'll have to force a change of heart before then, if we're to dodge this legal action thing. Looks like our plan must be accomplished while the exhibit is still open. By the way, what is this? Huh? A cat. <laughs> but it's talking. You have a problem with that? No, not really. Okay, it's been a long day. Why not? He's just on a different wavelength than other people. Do you wish to draw me? You better bring out the best of me in that case. Hmm. Hey, don't touch me like- So Yusuke's gonna close the bag. I was thinking of ordering some black bean jelly. I bet he got that idea from a black cat. Oh! <laughs> I didn't bring any money. Well, I guess we're paying for it. Never mind. He's just weird. He's just weird. Hey. Hope you're not up to no good. Don't forget you're still under probation. Got that one misstep and you're finished. Thanks, Dad. It's been a long day. No, no, no. Wait, I can still get the juice. Legal action. This ain't funny. Sounds problematic. The police hear about this, they'll totally get in touch with the school. We'll get expelled for sure this time. The school will be the least of our worries. We'll end up arrested. Unlawful entry, defamation. Guess that means we really can't afford to F it up this time. And yeah, from here on out is what really matters. Let's do it. We just need to change his heart before he presses charges. Try to focus on that problem for now. But like, there's physical evidence that if we called the police on him, we could probably just get him arrested for art fraud. Well then. I reminded the home shopping programs on. Can I go outside? Hey! Juice day, Morgana! It's juice day! No! No! Damn cat, I'll sue! Stronger lift S, harder core S, AccuSpeed S, the outdoors kit. Uh, what do we want? I think one is just damage, and then the other... I'm not really sure on the other. Muscle supplement for men that powers you up in any combat situation. A men's camping set that harnesses the powers of fire, ice, electricity. Probably that one? Yeah, they've sold out. Well then. 
poor cat. He's just concerned about your health. He's a good boy. He's not a good boy. He won't let us go outside. He won't let us have fun. I can't do much with that at the moment. Uh, we can go up and finish that DVD. Study, study. Yeah, so anyway, the DVD. Let's do it. Let's get this in. I... I still have feelings for you. Hmm. I guess if you're okay with the fact that I have a girlfriend, maybe we can work something out here. Oh, jeez. Man. Oh. We finished watching Bubbly Hills 90210, huh? We learned a thing or two about charm by watching this drama. I'm not sure, Morgana. Like, nice chat up. Okay. Let's go return the DVD soon. Well, Oh, more people are believing in us. Good timing. I wanted to tell you something. Oh, how's it going, Yusuke? Madarame was talking to a lawyer. <laughs> I suppose he's serious about suing. I think it's the fact that the game keeps using... Well, it's, it's actually using the word sue. It's like canon. <laughs> Just makes it funnier. Actually being sued. I think we should advance our plans. Why don't we go to the palace today? I have to prepare first. True. You never know what will happen in the palace. We should prepare thoroughly. It's good having a calm, rational person nearby. I'm counting on you. Your is so weird. It's happened literally twice, Dad. I. I guess it has only happened twice, yeah. Oh, have like, you I, heard? We've mentioned, joked about it a lot, that it feels like it's happened a lot. Feels like every week someone's been sued. In Madarama, the maestro of the art world. Artist with that good of an eye are rare in Japan. Wonder if he has, uh... Synesthesia? Is regarding synesthesia, one of many English terms that come from Greek root words. Haven't heard of it. It's a condition where your senses can cross over each other, like seeing music as color. For all kinds of varieties, though some sense combinations are more common than others. We call people who experience this phenomenon as sinistates. Mr. Anime, you were staring off into space, weren't you? <laughs> well, your number's up. The root words of synesthesia are sin and aesthesis. What do they mean? Um. Who wants to know what the root words mean? It's all Greek to me, but I can give it a try. Let's think about it. It'd be easy if we put our heads together. Let's start with sin. And in a lot of other wor words too. Like synergy and synchronicity. Synch I'm struggling with that for some reason. Synchronicity. Sync and sync. If we think about what these words have in common, then maybe sin means. Ain't you an English major? I struggle pronouncing words. Now let me cheat. Oh no, I can't cheat! But it's okay. Because it's together. And I knew that. And aesthesis, huh? That's a little like the word aesthetics. I wonder if it means... Eeny meeny miny mo. Senses. That's it. Looks like we know the definitions of the root words. That means a full word basically means senses coming together. Nice. We're so smart. Use a snack after all that brain power. Let's get a treat after this. Is this. It. Good. You've been studying. <laughs> Unfortunately, uh, synesthesia is something you have to be born with. You can't learn it. Some of the geniuses over the course of history have had synesthesia. The composer of France. Uh, List uh, introduced his orchestra to play the color purple. Well, instructed his orchestra to play the color purple. <laughs> they were probably very confused that day. And the poet uh, Arthur Rimbaud was also said to see colors and letters. Nice going. 
You're on a roll today. Seeing colors and sounds and letters and feeling shapes and flavors and numbers. Geniuses and common people uh, see the world differently. Were you able to understand that? I see. The few common people here. The reason Matarami sees the world differently is because of his distorted desires. Logan, thank you for a thousand bits. Thank you very much. Well then. Okay, we need to start inviting uh, Yusuke to the hideout meetings now. The fight's not over till the exhibit ends. Keep your head in the game. Okay, but wait. We can get sidetracked now. Oh, they both have a rank up. The Kemi has one too. Oh, there's so many rank ups. There's so many rank ups. I kind of want to go see Ryuji. Because I think if, if we level up Ryuji once more, we actually get something like straight away. There's like a next rank reward for Ryuji. You need the snacks. We desire food, fodder. It's gonna have to wait. Where's Ryuji? <laughs> I'd recommend going to therapy. <laughs> no, I got Ryuji's a higher rank. I gotta get it up. I gotta do it. Five SP is so good, but Ryuji, he's a bro. Let me see. I'm gonna just see, right? Yeah, Ryuji has something on the next rank. Check to secure status ailments inflicted upon party members. Yeah, I'm getting that. Mindfulness seems really good too, but we get an instant unlock here. We get an instant unlock here. Hey. Let's hang out. You think? Sure we're gonna be okay now heading in. Plenty of time. They ain't gonna hurt getting a change of pace. By the way, you remember that, that guy, uh, Yamauchi, I was talking about before? The mini Kamoshida. Yeah, it's him. Well, he's gonna be the new track team advisor. Doesn't give a rat's ass about the sport, though, or even the students. And you see, I heard this rumor. Apparently, he's gotten in trouble at school before with his drinking. That hasn't kept him from going out. I'm thinking maybe he let us, uh, he let some shit slip when he's drunk. I should only try and tail him sometime. I'll look into where he goes to drink. Time for Zeta, you're gonna train with me. Oh wait, I don't have a chariot persona. Hang on. on. Hang on, wait, I don't have a chariot. I need to go get the chariot, yep. Go pick one up. You have a counselor persona. I do, but that's not what the focus right now. You certain? You'd like to read the comp you want oh, to register? We can register these ones You'd too. You'd like to register this? Are you sure? Time for some rehabilitation. Let's execute them now. Choose. Do a poll? No, I'm going to see Ryuji. Yeah, it's just a uh, like summon. Read the compendium. Read here. Okay, we're looking for chariot. Oh, we can get our slime is back. This what you want? There we go. You withdraw this persona. This is your power. Slime has returned. The inmate needs is our there anything new we can make? Fusion. Let us begin the search. We're level 15. Not terrible, but There's not the impressive. long dog. A lot of these require stuff that I really don't want to fuse. You okay with this? Barret and a slime. 
but not impressive. No, but that, that I, I didn't need the slime. Yeah, just keep them for now. Finish? Are you finished? What? No slacking off. I'm seeing Ryuji. Backseat and the strong with this trap. Like that's it. I'm gonna have like I'm gonna have time to see the counselor again, aren't I? I'm gonna have like so much time to see the counselor. Yeah, I am. So it's fine. Like there's some here. Like he's gonna be gone tomorrow. I have until November. Yeah. I have until November. It's fine, I'm going to see Ryuji. Uh, he was outside the classroom. But November is tomorrow, whatever will we do? Give it the 200 bits. Hey. Okay, let's hang out. You think? Slime is gonna help us. Hang out. Somewhere's gotta be open. Let's try looking around at school. Hmm. He's playing the game wrong. Man, we really don't got a good place to train, huh? We can probably run into, uh... Nakaoka, uh... Nakao... Is it Nakaoka or Nakaoka? And them if we stuck around here. You got any ideas? Stay here, how about protein lovers? We can train at my place. Gotta be buff, gotta be bro. Nakaoka, thank you. Not today, man. No way. Didn't bring any spare undies, so I'm not going anywhere near there. Guess it won't hurt to peek around the gym. They ain't there. Maybe we can. Oh. Whoa. Like Oka. Uh, Takeshi. Uh, the hell are you guys doing? Just had a few questions for Nakaoka here. It's none of your business. So what, you're gonna ask some questions to your fist, and anyways, ain't a three-on-one kind of cowardly. Only coward here is Nakaoka. All the shit Kamashita put us through was his fault. He was telling that bastard secrets about us the whole time. What? It's a load of bull. Um... Yeah, we wanna agree with Ryuji here. That's right, you've been training together for freaking ever- forever. Plus, ain't the track team coming back? You don't gotta fight. Shut up. I'm telling you, this piece of shit sold us out. I think Kamashita found out about your parents, Sakamoto. It's gotta be a snitch. Whoa! Hold up. Out of the way, Sakamoto. We'll beat the shit out of you too if we need to. <coughs> I think that's gonna make you feel better. Go for it. You're gonna wish you didn't. Trust me, it feels real bad looking back on shitty stuff you've done. Huh? Look. Even if Nakaoka was working with Kamashita, ain't it fine now? The bastard's gone, so you guys can just put this crap behind you. There's no reason to fight, yeah? Can't keep people around who are gonna try and undermine our team. I didn't do anything. I wasn't working with Kamashita. But how, many, how much you hit me, my answer's gonna stay the same. Oh yeah, we got proof. Yamauchi told us all about it. Huh? Yamauchi? Come on, Takeshi. Uh, we gotta get out of here. It'd be real bad if anyone else showed up. Okay, shit like you isn't welcome on our new track team. You better remember that. <sighs> you okay? The hell was that? Stay out of the Sakamoto. It's nothing to do with you. But we kind of saved you there. When you hit Kamashita, you were really hitting all of us who tried so hard to endure his bullshit. We might have felt relieved, but it only made life harder for us. Because of you, we lost the one place we could vent our frustrations. The one place we, re we could really belong. Tensions got pretty high after that. Things just been kind of rough from then on. You really think it's all fine now, huh? What if I told you they're right about me? Just still think it's fine if I, if, if I was the one who told Kamashita about your parents. <sighs> yeah. You told him, you told him. And overall, that stuff with my parents anyways. Besides, hey. I 
realized something that oh, okay. I'd have messed up with Kamoshida back then, but hanging on to the past ain't gonna help anything. I'm just gonna focus on being myself now, being free. What are you talking about? Free, huh? You think you're free when you have to see the counselor every Tuesday? You have hey. no choice in this matter. You must play optimally. You don't play this game. You, you get to watch it in the set way you're supposed to for optimal play. Johnny, you get what I'm trying to say, yeah? Absolutely. Right, he's the he he was the one who wasn't making any sense. Hmm. Guess being free is like it's like how I feel when I'm talking to you, man. <laughs> oh no, I don't. Can you explain that? Uh, I don't know how else to explain. I just feel free. Huh? <laughs> Are we stuck in repeat or something? Feel like my bond with Ryuji is growing deeper. Oh, we're so close now. Six stars. Cure status ailments inflicted upon party members. All right. Pretty good. Man, that was some funny shit. So much for training, though. Come on, let's get out of here. Go. Oh, we should grab ramen on the way home. So close. So many good perks. Yo, you're good right now. All that mess with the track team. I guess I was right about my gut feeling. And that Goka can get weirdly stubborn sometimes. Keep his mouth shut whether or not someone's punching him. Uh, no, not that. Just like you? It sounds like you two were close. What are we thinking? Just like you. Wait, what? Why you gotta make this about me? Oh, we got it wrong. I ain't stubborn now, man. I'm open-minded as hell. That bastard Yamauchi's name came up again. I swear something about that dude is so shady. Okay, that's it. It's, I'm gonna do a full investigation. I'll hit you up if I find anything. Later. We got it wrong. He's not playing optimal. Uh, you're back. I think of that guy who approached you in the beef bowl shop was a politician, right? Apparently gives speeches at Shibuya Station, but you can't judge a book by its cover. Yo. Another box came in. Hey. Stronger lift and harder core. Oh. Accu speed. Okay, what does what does all that do? It raises attack one ally for three turns. Raises defense, raises accuracy. Okay. Cool. Oh, we could go meet the politician at last. We could finally do that. Plant good? Plant's good. We could finally say hi to Bernie. Or Sanderson. Uh, I gotta return the DVD as well. Oh, it's a lot. Is it Lotto Day? It's a Lotto Day. We gotta, we gotta check. Who would you like? Yeah, there's no more DVDs. We used them all. Please take your time. There is a new book though. Vague. Fashion magazine for girls with unique tastes. Sure. Okay, I gotta check. Hey, there he is, he's talking. Hmm. The results will be announced then, but I could Hi. buy a scratch ticket. Miss. Oh, it's man. a miss. Okay. Come on. Not having much luck on the scratch tickets. We should just stick to the pure lotto. 
which would just stick to the lot of Bad feeling. Okay, let's talk. Let's talk to Sanderson. Please consider what I have to say. Far too many instants, reason to ignore. Can anyone deny this? Get to discover the truth of it all. The apathy of Permian society is a direct result of negligence by our government and the media. You, listening quite attentively. Are you interested in politics? I'm interested. Are you a student? I'm delighted to captivate the interest of someone your age. Hmm? Have I seen you someone before? Oh, you were working at the beef bowl shop before. You have a lot of per perseverance for a young person. If you'd like. If you're interested, I could use your help. I want to change the state of this country. And to do so, I need the power of the youth. However, due to certain regulations, I can't offer a job to a student. I think you could learn some things if you chose to attend a few of my speeches, though. Be glad to. Let's go. Oh, would you mind telling me your name and contact information? You're a student from Shujin Academy. It's nice to meet you. I am, uh... Taranosuke Yoshi Yoshida. <sighs> used to be a member of the Diet, but no longer. In the past 20 years, I've lost seven straight elections. This isn't good. I'm dwelling on the negative right before my speech. Very well. Well, then I hope I can count on your help immediately. Everyone. The lines of what is considered right and wrong in society today has been, have been blurred. The common sense no longer our guide. We make decisions based on our selfish wants and desires. Is a result in a deluge of self-centered people who delight in taking advantage of the weak. However, however, even in this modern day and age, it's imperative that we act in the best interests of all. A world where it is acceptable to trample on the rights of others for your own benefit. A world where the young exist only to be exploited is a world that must be changed. He's so based. Easy for you to say, old timers like me have had our hands full taking care of ourselves. Actually making some good points, but he's in no name. He probably won't get too far. Nothing's gonna change. We'll just keep getting exploited. What's this wannabe politician blattering about? He isn't even affiliated with a party. But you just leave matters of state into the capable hands of the of the liberal co-prosperity party. Oh no. You mustn't base your decision on whom to support merely according to the party they belong to. Shut up already, you're just a washed up politician. <clears throat> if I have chosen to represent the will of the people, then I am fully prepared to... In the best interests of all? Ha! Save the bladder for when you get elected, if you get elected. Thank you. Aw, oh, Sanderson, you did your best out there today. What do you think of my speech? Uh, don't say that. That will be upsetting. Best interests of all. I'm glad. Indeed, do you feel the same? Such as I am, I'd like to believe that I'm capable of giving a moving speech. However, there are times like today when the audience is the difference of opinion on a topic. Some feel I should concentrate on getting elected before I worry about others. Do you agree? You have my support. Thank you. Thank you. It's encouraging to know that my message has won you over. Besides, I've grown quite accustomed to those types of reactions. No. Although I don't know if that is necessarily a good thing. Regardless, no matter what they say, I must continue on. I think I can learn a lot by listening to Yoshida's speeches. Well then, I shall Perhaps see you I'll again, ask soon. again for your impressions. I'll ask for your impressions again sometime. Did we not even get a confidant with him yet? Hey! No, we didn't. That didn't give us a confidant. Oh, we can get some guts though. Hmm? Wow. My kid's doing good. Oh. I love how Captain Kid was the leader of a ra ragtag group of outlaws. He must have learned more about courage after reading Captain Kid's exciting adventures. <laughs> We need so much more guts to be able to talk to Gunkle. I'm almost at the station. I said it was an efficient use of your time. Alright, let's okay, begin. Let's begin homeroom. First, I have an announcement about an upcoming school event. As part of a city beautification project, the entire school will be participating in a public cleanup campaign. That means we're going to uh, Inoka Shira Park to pick up trash. 
but it's oh, raining. I want to study Kawakami. Cleanup will take place next week on the 30th. All students have to wear their gym uniforms during the event, so don't forget to dress the part. If I send the calling card the day before, can I just skip it? I don't want to clean up the environment. You guys hear about this cleanup bullshit at Inoka Shira Park? I guess it's the principal's idea. Damage control after Kamoshida scandaled up the school's rep. Pretty sure scandal is not a verb. I get what you mean. Even the council and stuff seems like a desperate move. They're scrambling. All the girls in our class have been freaking out over this new guy, too. I've been hearing that Maraki's hot, kind, sensitive. Basically, everyone thinks he's their type. I guess he's pretty popular then. Yeah, I mean, my chat keeps screaming at me every time I don't see him. Oh, yeah, did you guys go to his counseling yet? Oh, shit, I forgot. Oh, no, I don't really feel like going. You know what I mean, right, Johnny? He's a good counselor. Well, really? You should just go already. If you're slack and draws attention to us, we're the ones who'll have to pay for it. Fine. He's a snack. It's open. Come on in. What's up? Hey there. Uh, Sakamoto-kun, here for a counseling session. It's not like I wanted to or nothing. Sorry you were forced into this, but anyway, come in, come in. <laughs> but this is pretty awkward. Mm, huh? Oh, why's that? I mean, I don't really go to see teachers unless they want to chew me out for doing something wrong. I'm not a teacher here, if anything, well, I'm here to be on the student's side. <sighs> oh, yeah. So am I supposed to tell you about Kamoshida now? Well... Oh, no, this isn't some kind of interrogation. Free just kick back and talk about whatever you want. Like what? How about it? How about, is there anyone in your class that you like? Uh... Not exactly easy to talk about either. It's not like there is anybody. Uh, sorry. Sorry, I just meant you're in the middle of your teenage years and all, right? High schoolers are just discovering romance and all, so... Is that how it went for you? Not exactly. <laughs> Just because I fell in love with my studies first. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I'm supposed to be hearing you out, but instead I'm just bringing down the room. How about this instead? What do you do in your free time, Sakamoto-kun? On the weekend after school? Uh... Well, we go into the mind palace of this deranged artist who's been producing a lot of counterfeit paintings lately. He's been abusing a lot of his students. But we're trying to put a stop to it. Uh, with my friends and our talking cat. It's a pretty fun hobby. I recommend trying it sometime. Before that, I was just pissed all the time, but even before that, I was only all about the track team. Ah, those so you like better now. Oh, so you know about that too. Yeah, pretty much so. As long as I don't strain it or nothing. I see. Quite. You really do enjoy running, don't you? I guess so. I mean, after all that training I did, it makes sense I'd like it. I train constantly, getting sweet, getting sweet times at meets along with everyone else. Eventually, I was going to get my hands on some running scholarships to make it easier on my mom. Oh, that's in the past now. It's cool, though. I got way more imp important shit to do now. More important, huh? <laughs> no matter what path you might have to take to get there. Hope your track dreams will still do you s some good in the end. E yeah. Thanks. I know. You know what they say, right? If you wish hard enough, your dreams can come true. What the hell? You're trying to sell me some kind of line now. Oh, well, no, this is actually a genuine phenomenon with a lot of research going into it even now. Look at it this way, Sakamoto-kun. What do you want most out of life right now? Uh... Hmm. Want something to drink, I guess. Oh! Huh? Like, well, I have a beer in the fridge. I wasn't supposed to mention it. I looked into a coupon for a free can of apple juice at the convenience store this morning. And now I'd like for you to have it. Thanks? <laughs> See, your wish came through. True. E yeah. Hey, Dr. Mara, I mean, Doc. Anyone ever tell you you're kind of not normal? You think so? Oh, could that be a compliment coming from you? Uh, no. <laughs> oh. Hey! There's 12 days left! Wait, what are we doing today? Hang on. It depends. Rank up with honor to Kemi. We could... Could just gear up for the palace again. We could gear up for the palace again. No. 
I'll just add this. Gonna save it here. Yeah, I think that's a good point to leave it. Come tomorrow's stream? We're gonna start the palace again. Well, we're gonna finish the other half of the palace, even. We've done one half. Wait. I actually want to check one thing. Hang on. Next ability is insta kill. <laughs> when encountering a weak shadow, you may destroy it immediately. Holy shit! That seems pretty good. We might we might want that. Yeah. That seems pretty good. This is what I mean. This is why we focus Ryuji. Like just like well focus on the character to get to like even the end. They might have some really good shit in the later ranks. We we got to get that. That's only one more rank. That's insane. Yeah, we're gonna have to get that next. Okay, yeah. I'll just add this. Well, hopefully after we finish in the palace, um, we can just have like another moment with Ryuji and pick that up. Holy shit, that seems so good. But that's gonna be it for today's stream. Thank you so much for coming by. I hope everyone enjoyed it. Long boy stream tonight. Uh, tomorrow, we're gonna pick up from where we left off, uh, and we're gonna try and finish this next palace that we've got. So it should be a good time. And also uh, tomorrow. Now also tomorrow, bit of a bit of a mention, right? I've been informed that there's something of interest we might want to check out tomorrow that releases. That I think might be quite fun. Um, yeah, we've only done once before. You'll see what it is when it releases. I don't want to say what exactly it is. I'm going to be an awful tease. Um, but we are going to be streaming Persona tomorrow, right? But we are going to stop playing Persona at a certain point and take a break. Okay. Because we got something that we're going to check out. No way, it's Fortnite. Persona Cat Racing. What it, when is tomorrow's stream? Uh, same time it always is on Sunday. Uh, check the schedule. It's three in Ireland. Um, oh god, it's wait, is it daylight savings tomorrow? It might be. Oh fuck. Okay, time in Ireland. Google time in Ireland. Daylight savings is gonna chuck everything off by an hour. Yeah, it's daylight savings. Are we going back an hour or forward? I think we go back an hour this time, don't we? We're going back. All right, fuck it. D just to prevent confusion. I'm gonna aim to start at two o'clock, which is the same time we started at today. I'm gonna just try and do that. Um, so that way it's the same for most people, I think. Because the clocks don't change like um, elsewhere for a while. I'm gonna just aim to start at two and just kind of keep it consistent, okay? And then we'll adjust to time in Ireland after that. Yeah, so it's gonna be 2 p.m. time in Ireland. I believe we're gonna be back on GMT. Like the, the BST ends, it's back on GMT. So I'm gonna stream at two, because that'll be the same as three BST. That also gives us time, because I know I know we got a, we got a palace to get through, and we got another thing uh, tomorrow. That should hopefully give us time uh, for everything. Yeah, that's the plan. Uh, thank you to everyone who came by the stream. Thank you to everyone who subbed. Thank you to everyone who gave bits. Thank you to the mods, as ever, for being on hand. And I do hope everyone enjoyed it. We'll pick up Persona again tomorrow. Uh, there will be highlights of it at, at some point over the coming week. 
Uh, I'm gonna leave you in Kelly's care. She is streaming Cult of the Lamb. And she's doing it for charity, I believe, as well. So go say hey, and you know, if you can support her, I hope for the day. Just do what you can. Just hang out. Cult of the Lamb's always a good time. Now, go say hey to Kelly. Okay, I'll see you all tomorrow. Uh, uh, we'll go back to 10 a.m. EST once we have daylight savings in the U.S. I can't remember what that is, uh, time-wise. Um, just tomorrow, so, streams. Tomorrow, it's, I'm just gonna start at 2, because that way it's the same start time as it was today for most places. And then, from Monday, it's time in Ireland again, so we're gonna change back to GMT. From Monday, it's just gonna be, what is the time in Ireland? And I'm just gonna be consistent with that, okay? Just so it's not horrifically confusing for a lot of folks tomorrow, I'm just gonna say like I'm starting at two of my time. Because that'll line up time zone wise then for many of you. Okay, thanks for coming folks. I'll see y'all then. Have a good night. <laughs>